only out temporarily. What's up, Yeah, we're 15 away from 1K. Howdy, howdy. Uh, the server was shit in the bed a bit. Uh, seems like it's better. Yo, Sandy with the five bomb. Um, I guess I could try to fill in bits and pieces if you've missed. So, Big L. Big L accepted our chess game challenge. Uh, I, I'm not good at chess, but on top of that, I, I literally role played that Jabaz had no clue how to play. To the point where my first game against Aurora, I was just making moves. <laughs> I was doing dumb moves, and I was saying, so I could do that, huh? <laughs> but, uh, two people have come in that are decent at chess that I've been able to play against. So, I've got somewhat of a strategy down. I'm gonna be honest, I'm, I'm going for a four-person, I'm, 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 I'm pushing hard for a fast checkmate. That's, that's all I'm doing. That, that, that's my strategy on Jabass tonight, okay? We're fucked? Yeah, we're absolutely fucked. I'm really tempted to offer... I'm really tempted to say if you're so confident, Big L, let me move- let me- let me move your first three moves. And then when he inevitably says no, just see if I can counter-offer until he lets me make one or two of his moves and try so desperately to do a Fool's Gambit. <laughs> Cause I got taught a Fool's Gambit and I got taught a four-move checkmate. <laughs> I killed Joey. Dude, if he if he lets me fools gambit him, uh, like low key, I hope he fools gam lets me fools gambit him and just he takes me away into solitary. I dude, it would be so fucking hilarious. See, I I love Kono with Big L because every single deal that we do with Big L, I'll never win, and it's so good for roleplay. Funnily enough, Jabaz is even trying to think deeper ahead with this in the sense that if he loses in this, he can still go for solitary for Sam's skull, which allows him to eventually kill Big L one day. That's it. That, that's why he was willing to do this game is even if he loses, he still has the po possibility of killing Big L down the line. And if he beats me in chess, it sets it up so well because I I have such I have a, such a crazy idea um I figure we go through telegrams together I tried to save some of them um I really want to move the note that Jabass wrote to the edge of of the leap of faith and then when he goes over to read it just fucking shout checkmate and just tackle his ass off if I lose today <laughs> The, it, the, the, this is gonna be building. I love how this has been building for like such a long time, dude. Uh, like, I, I'm so fucking glad that this is slowly building. 
he win or lose? I'm, I mean, I think if anything, I just get to be even more ruthless if I go into a, a darker, deeper solitary. Dear King of Thieves, Sir Jabass. What the fuck? Greetings. <clears throat> Greetings. I am a person who has recently come to Saints Crossing. I am looking for employment, quick payments through work I enjoy. If you would discuss, or rather discuss opportunities through a business relationship, you should see my telegram number below. Dear King of Thieves, Sir Jabass. <laughs> Interesting. Gu guys. Okay. I saw this. Raul D. V. V. The skull will be his. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Gods versus kings. You know, Loki was a god, but many thought of him as a mad god. I guess I wonder what drove him mad, or was he always that way? I know your stint will not be easy. I know only time will tell what Sisica does to you. Strip a man of his will for long enough, he forgets what his will even was. In the midst of chaos, there is opportunity. Perhaps they'll let you have a book to read in there or something, so you're not alone with your thoughts as well. Maybe ask for, like, a Bible or something they think would be good for you to read. The Constitution? Hell if I know. If you need anything done, let me know. Oh. Jonathan, I hate that you're in there. It kills me watching the door down to solitary, knowing that you're in there suffering. Try to distract yourself when you can. Think about Guarma. Peaceful and beautiful it is. Picture it and focus on that. It's the out of this place. I can't wait to be in your arms. That's all I can think about. We'll get through this. No matter what. Ben's have a really amigo. <laughs> I heard that you're in... Out I heard that you're in... I was wondering again. what happened to you. Well, I went out for a cigarette. Try to clear my head a little bit. Are we gonna get this game with poker or what, amigo? Yeah, we can play poker. Ooh. Tell me something. Go ahead. When we were playing chess, the guard came around and he said something. I didn't catch his words. Oh, he claimed you were a snitch. Interesante. See, when I was asking him what the fuck he said, he wouldn't tell me. He just struck me over the head instead. What, what you think about that, amigo? What, I just striking you over the fucking head? The Just guard. about his behavior in general. Yeah, I mean, the, these guards... They just like to fucking, what? They like to tell you what to do, and if you don't do it, they like to fucking hit you. It's because they're protected on this fucking island. You know, Big L, he's been tormenting me and my uncle since I can fucking remember. You keep talking about your uncle, amigo. Who the fuck is he? My uncle was Sam, Sam Bass. He used to... Do business in Saint Denis. He used to have a revolution that he wanted to start. And he slowly, solitary broke him. Slowly, he uh, he went the outlaw life. And I joined him. Was well, not I by his side. Ay, pobrecito. Sorry to hear that about your uncle, amigo. Yeah, I appreciate it. One second, sweetheart. Yeah. I'm going to play poker. If a, if a guard comes, can one of you distract and the other ones come grab, grab us? Yeah. Alright. Thank you. I love... Dude, can I just say? I love that Pepo's playing an un, a, like a dishonest character, dude. It's so good. I told Kaysen's ages ago I wanted to play Dishonest Outlaw after Jabez. It, it's so good. It adds so much spice to situations. <laughs> Whoops.
I have $13, amigo. Maybe Here. we can play for that much. I'll give you $37 if you want. I will not refuse, amigo. Yeah, Such I mean, you won chess so anyway. See, <laughs> see, si, see. Si. Let me get back off the table. Mucho gusto, okay. amigo. You're so generous. Well. You must be swimming in the dollars, amigo. Well. I don't know. I figure. <laughs> Shit. I figure the way I look at it. <laughs> by the time I use all my money, I'll probably be dead anyway, so. $37 and you beat me in chess fair and who gives a shit? You're planning on dying so fast, amigo. Nah, but let's be honest. Most people, uh, the things that we do and the violent tendencies of a man tend to lead to a death. You gotta be realistic there, Edgar. You're speaking as if you already have one foot in the grave, amigo. What are we playing for? Let's up the ante, the stakes. Alright, what do you want to play for? I will warn you. I'm way better at poker than I am at, at chess. I'm sure you are, amigo. But it come down to Lady Luke. Sometimes. Whoever have the better cards is gonna be the one that wins, amigo. Well, that's very true. It's also about playing your cards while having nothing. See, like, I have a six and a three of diamond. And that's why I'm giving you a uh, pot for this one. There's definitely strategy in poker, but there's a lot of luck as well. See, I don't lie about my cards. And everybody thinks that's me lying, but I don't lie. Even in poker. I won a poker championship in Guarma by not lying. Won four horse deeds and $4,000 that way. You have four horse deeds, amigo. Uh, yeah. And you still have them on you now. <laughs> I do not have them on me in Sisica, no. Not in Sisica, but, but yeah, I'm sure I still you have them somewhere. So, so basically, I have the last horse ever born to Guarma on Sisica. I mean, I, I'm, I back at the, on my fucking horse. And then, uh, the deed to that. I think it's in the Van Horn stable. Then I've got the, uh... Tommy Two Snakes' his horse, because he played. But I traded it to Aurora. It was called Nuts, was the name of the horse. Uh, so I've gotten the horse to respond to Januts, so she can ride Januts. <laughs> that was a bad joke. And she gave me a Hungarian half-bred, which I've traded a Hungarian half-bred for three Mustangs and a Northfolk Roadster. Interesante, amigo. You a proper businessman. I am a proper businessman. What do you have right now in your hand? What do I have right now? I've got a two and a six. So I've got a... If a five comes down, I've got the straight, but obviously we would all have the straight there. But I've got the six as well, which means if a five comes down... I've also got a pair of twos. There's a third spade out there. Interesante. Do you have a flush? I do not have a flush. Then maybe it's wise for me to bet. Maybe it is wise for you to bet. Since I have nothing. Well, of course, I'll, I'll throw two dollars in to see how you play. I figured you had a three or a four. <laughs> look at that, look at that. Do that make me champion? Well, you want a hand? See, si, see. Si. How long have you been living in Tea Landing, amigo? Ah, uh, fuck. Probably two months. But a lot of that time, I was at war with the Dicenzos. Properly running in about a month. Are you the one that made all the fucking rules in that place? Uh, fuck the rules. There are no rules there. It's coming from the leader. I, I heard that one of my people tried to say some sh shit like you can't do anything there. 
not disagree with that. Do you know which one it was that said that, amigo? No, I do not. I personally, the way I look at it, rules ain't for the fucking West. Sure, you should probably avoid doing something in the place I run out of fucking respect, but there ain't no rules. Respect, amigo. That's right. And what the fuck does that mean? Respect. Mean respect. See, I wouldn't walk into, let's say, Fort Mercer and just gun down a random person there because I have respect for the people that run Fort Mercer. But I have no respect for the people that run St. Denis, so I'll gun a bitch down in the middle of St. Denis and leave it for them. Did you win that with nine high? <laughs> exactly, amigo. I have, well, I had eight high. You look like you're not a good poker player. It looks that way. Almost even worse than the way you play chess, amigo. That might be right. And what's gonna happen to all your children if you stay in Sisica forever or something oh, happens to you? I ain't gonna stay in Sisica forever. I'm just gonna lose my mind quicker. Quicker than I've already been losing my mind. There is a little pendejo that I met in Thief Landing. His name was Julian. Is this one of yours as well? No, he's not one of mine. He does a lot of work in Thieves, but he ain't one of my gang members. Interessante. And how would you feel if Senor Julian went missing, amigo? Is that gonna make you cry? No, I'm not gonna cry. He's got some good ideas, he's got a decent head on his shoulder, but at the end of the day, the fella ain't one of my people. It's my own that I care about. Two dollar amigo, what the fuck are you raising for? Well, I'm raising my hands in the air. Interesante, interesante. Do you know why you can have this one, amigo? You can have this one. Yeah, that's right. I figured, I mean, I got the queen, so... You know, this one did a lot of talking last time I saw him. Mm. Julian? Si, 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 si. In what way? He started naming a lot of pendejos. Started talking about the East. He started talking about the West. I've noticed that most men, when they're backed in a corner and they feel like they've got nowhere to go, they run their mouth naming names that people they think might possibly care about them to try to get them out of situations. Quite frankly, I've had people come up to me several times saying that they were going to get robbed and they claim they do business with me at the end of the day. I don't give a fuck if you do business with me. Don't throw my fucking name out there. See, see, see. It seems to me that your home is in the West, amigo. You said you don't like the pendejos in San Denisio. Say that one more time. I said your homie sound like he's in the West, no? Yeah. It is. And you don't like the pendejos in San Denisio? No, I do not like the people in Saint Denis. But you took in business, amigo. Yeah. Where is the business in the West? It's nothing but dirt. There's it's nothing but cactus. I heard other things, amigo. Well, you hear that there's business to do in the East. I can see with my ojos, amigo. Hmm. You see all the big buildings, amigo. The chimneys, the trains, the docks. That's big money, no? Industry and whatnot? No, there's definitely money in industry. I'm talking cultivation. The way I look at it, selling weaponry, selling liquor, <laughs> shit like that, you don't need to be in some fancy fucking building out east. And don't get me wrong, sure, there's a lot of shit out east. Chimney smoke, fucking trains, fancy shit, whatever the fuck you want to say. But what, just because I ain't living in a mansion don't mean I can't do fucking business. 
You know, Mr. Julian say something that really caught my attention. What was that? Right before... Just do a little pop, man. I got all you. Six dollar, amigo. Tell me what you have in your hand. Well, I do in fact have something. Okay. And since I have nothing, I'm gonna let you keep it, amigo. Right. You can have it. And a pair of threes. I got a you. I would have took that one. <laughs> Mr. Julian. Yeah. He says something about the East. He was actually boasting of pushing out some pendejos named Taipanis. Hmm. Pushing he them out of the East. No, he ain't pushing them out of the West. Pushing Taipan out of the West. See, he was boasting about it. And it occurred to me, senor, why the fuck is anybody from Taipan coming out West anyway? They've been coming out, they've been going out west for a long time because they like to mine out in Gaptooth because they have some mining company out that way. And this is the problem for you. Hmm. I think a lot of people in the west, it ain't just myself, have problems with somebody from the east coming in, mining up a bunch of gems and getting the fuck out. What did you expect him to do, amigo? There's plenty of caves in the east. Interessante. So tell me why the fuck would they come all the way there and risk the danger of running into Mr. Julian? <laughs> there, there must be something very nice in the western caves. You don't know what's in the western caves. I'm not a miner, amigo. I'm a bandolero. Sure, but if you're a thief... You, you like to rob people, I'm sure you know. I'll tell you either way. Is that what you are, a thief? Yeah, I would say I'm not above thievery. Is that what Julian is, a thief? Be honest, quite frankly, the only things I've seen from Julian is he, he does a lot of business and he does a lot of moonshine. That's the only things I've really seen from him. Tell me if the Taipan pendejos decided to come to the West and work out some sort of deal where they give a percentage of their earnings to Mr. Yabas, would you still have a problem with him? I would no longer have any issue with the Taipan coming out that way. Interessante. You really are a man of business, Mr. Yabas. I am. It seems like some of your underlings think a little bit differently. Say you're Joseph, for example. All right. And how does she think? She was doing a lot of talking about family this, family that. Steve landing this, Steve landing that. Not caring about business this, not caring about business that. How would you feel if she were missing, amigo? Would you be, sir? Uh, if one of my gang members went missing? <laughs> yeah, yeah I'd, I'd have an issue with that. <laughs> look at that, look at that. A proper straight, amigo. Is that so? But how proper? Ay carayo. No so proper at all, amigo. He said you don't have a gang. No, said your Edgar have no fucking gang. Edgar do whatever the fuck Edgar want. It's like 
take jobs? Do you have like a do you have a partner? Do you have anybody you work with? See, I have some partners, amigo. More than I can count on my fingers. Who are your partners? You don't mind me asking. Will you see? There are a few. However, I don't know if it's wise right now to tell anybody about them. Fair enough. You see, one has to protect his interests, his prospects. He has to be discreet. I will say I'm a little pissed fucking off that they're all outside and I'm in here. Yeah. That it girl went down and they're outside counting the money. I wonder if the money's still gonna be there when I get out. Do you trust your partners? Trust them, amigo. The only pendejo I trust is myself. Fair. I mean, even in a gang, you can't always trust people. I trust a pendejo to look after his own prospects. That's it, amigo. There's no familiar here. There is no mama and papa. Every pendejo is looking out for himself. Glad ten I want me that. Look at that, look at that. You are very bold man when it comes to playing cards. I am. I can see you like to take risks, amigo. Yep, I do. I like to take risks in general. See, I don't believe in discretion. No. Unlike you. Did you I say just that like now, to put amigo. it all out on the table. And I always have put it all out on the table. It would if something on the table looked desirable to someone else. You know what's gonna happen then. I'd assume there was something desirable on the table between two people. Somebody wanted it bad enough to kill, then I'd assume there'd be iron drawn. Sometimes not even that much, amigo. Sometimes they take a lot less just to take something. You turn your back. By the time you turn back around, that the stuff is gone. But there are a lot of selfish people in this world, you're right about that. A lot of people that only care about their own uh, desires and their own wants. Is that what you are, amigo? I've spent my whole life living for other people for the most part. Started living for myself recently. Living your life for someone else. That's right. That sounds like the life of a pendejo, amigo. Just being loyal to the people you care for. And said I was loyal to my uncle. Until he died. And what are you loyal to now, Senor Yabas? Myself. My people. Even if they piss me the fuck off sometimes. Look at that, look at that. Taking the risks. That's right. Hmm. I have a feeling you're bluffing again. And I'm tired of putting down my hands. Hmm. Well, I'm not bluffing. And I'm a man of honesty. But the question is, do I have the seven? Do I have the four? Do I have the king? I think you got nothing, amigo. I do, in fact, have something. You have nothing, amigo. I've not lied to you once, and I'm lying not, to you right now. You're not gonna trick me five, ten fucking times. So here's the thing. You could have me beat. You could very well have me beat. But... Even if I lose, I'm still in. Are you sure about that? Yeah. Look at that, look at that, amigo. You had the seven. See, I had the king. 
I figured you had the seven based off your bet, but I ain't gonna back down. I, I figure I now I have a lot more than you, amigo. That's right. I figure this is also a very good time to say, you know what? It's enough for me. <laughs> You're not gonna bust me out? Okay, okay, I'll play one more hand, perhaps. <laughs> I'm not like you, your boss. I don't have a big gang and pendejos paying me left and right. I'm just a poor pendejo. With nothing in his pockets. Alright. So you'll play one more hand? <laughs> Maybe after this one. Ay, <laughs> carajo. I play one more after this one. <laughs> Look at that, amigo Pocky races. Yeah, I've also got pocket aces. I got I you. You know I don't want to come down from the beautiful number seventy one, but just for you, one? amigo. Just for you. Just for you. Oh, I appreciate it. Just for you. Look at that! Look at that! Full house, amigo. You got the full house from pocket aces to see, a full house. Oh, see, okay. see, see. Of course, of course, amigo. Well, you know what's funny? I wouldn't bet if I were you. <laughs> I tried to warn you, amigo. Because I like you. I'm trying to look out for you. You know, look. Maybe I just feel bad for you. Okay, okay. Don't say I didn't try to help you, amigo. It's, it's fine. Oh my god, you got the four too? Look at that, amigo. Give me the money, give me there the money. There you go, there you go. It's a fun game. Yo, Colonel, what up? Just another day in the life ahead, girl, amigo. There you go, now you got how much? You, what, you had $10 to start with? I got no money, amigo. $10 to start with, now you got, what, 100 I have nothing, I have like $20 in my pocket. Yeah, I've definitely got nothing. <laughs> Yo, Colonel with the 10 bomb. Takes cash in the trousers. I would call that a nice productive night, amigo. What are you thinking? Oh, yeah, no, it was nice. Tell me, do these pendejo guards get paid well enough? Hmm. They seem more loyal to Big L than money or anything else. When is this game gonna happen? I would love to have a first row seat to it. Probably about an hour. Maybe two. I got a yo. And if you win, what is gonna happen? I'm out of solitary for good. And if you lose? Well, right now I'm allowed visitors in solitary. And I can walk and I have a bed. Uh, but they're gonna take me, uh, gonna take me further down into the solitary. Basically, yeah, I'll show you. Come walk with me. See, si, see. Si. If you go down to the bottom of that tower, that's where solitary is. The solitary cell I stay in. Now, the solitary cell that my uncle used to stay in. And the solitary cell that. And what happens if you've forgotten in there, amigo? And you completely lose yourself? Ah. Oh. Do you know what happens when the... Chess, I guess. Do you know what happens when the Papa Wolf disappear, amigo? Hmm. You ever read The Art of War, Edgar? Perhaps a few times. If you appear weak, people attack. See, si, see. Si. 
maybe on the outside looking in, I have a very vulnerable bishop. Maybe when you take that bishop, you lose a lot more. See this? This brick building. See, I'm going looking right at it, amigo. You, uh... This is my new cell. If I lose. Now we wouldn't want that to happen, would we? Well, I wouldn't want that to happen. I don't really think it matters to you. <laughs> Are you sure, amigo? If something happened to the Papa Wolf, who gonna be looking after all the cubs? <laughs> well, luckily I don't really have that many cubs. Luckily I have full-grown wolves that can defend themselves. It's funny because every time I go to landing, they always say, you boss this, you boss that. What are they gonna say in the future? When your boss disappears. Probably whoever takes a uh, shot at the uh, area when I'm gone. See, si, see. Si. Tell me, don't you think Edgar can take a place like that? Take a place like Thieves Landing? See, si, see. Si. Well, I think any, any Muppet with a gun has a chance of killing anybody. You have enough Muppets with guns? Well, maybe. Muppets. Is that what you say? Something like that. Tell me what the fuck is a Muppet, amigo? The fuck is a Muppet? <laughs> si. You don't want to be a Muppet. It's like the worst thing you could be. The only thing worse than a Muppet is a shit shoveling Muppet. Oh, is that like a cabron, amigo? Well, what's like, a pen like a pendejo. What's a pendejo? A pendejo is like a son of the beach, amigo. It would be like if a pendejo. <laughs> and a townie had sex. <laughs> and when the it... townie and a pendejo had sex, a muppet came out. I got you, amigo. <laughs> These don't sound so good. And then if that Muppet had to shovel shit for a living, that would be the worst kind of Muppet. See, si, see. Si. <laughs> it would be terrible to have the landing fellow Muppets, don't you think? Yeah. They d I love how he asks us. Tell me, when is your release day, Senor Yabas? Uh, well, sometime in the next, uh, I think, midway February, whatever I fucking year. I got you. But, Big L always threatens to keep me longer, so probably not until after that. Aren't you worried, amigo? You want to know something that's funny, Edgar? See, tell me, I always like a good yoke. I have a lot of very violent and ruthless wolves in my pack. And I'm the one that is a bit level headed nowadays. You see, I used to be the uh I used to be the bloody one for my uncle, but now I have lots of bloody people. So I'm not too worried. Like who, amigo? Like Yossi. Oh yeah, she's one of them. What about the other pendejo, the eavesdropper? <laughs> the eavesdropper? See, si, this also the one that's very scary. The old man is, uh... He's, he's a good fella. But you heard about that, amigo. I did. He was talking so much of his honor. But he was belly down with his ear to the fucking wall. Like a little cucurracha, amigo. He's just looking out for Josie. Exactly, she cannot look up for herself. 
Well, people are gonna have each other's backs, Edgar, at least when you're in an outfit together. See, that's the thing. You're in here right now, and you're worried about your partners on the outside. There's there's no loyalty there. I'm no worried, amigo. Maybe not worried, but... <laughs> it's not the best term, but you're still thinking about it. See, the thought see. still crosses your mind. I think I'm most worried. people in my outfit, the thought don't even cross their mind, because they know that each other are going to have their backs. I'm not worried about my partners so much as my... my prospects. Hmm. However... I think those wolves, without the wolf leader, resemble a pack of pussycat, amigo. Maybe Julian was just the first domino, amigo. Maybe. What are you thinking? Maybe Thief Landing gonna turn from a place to raise a family to something a little bit different in the coming future. Well, I'd, uh... I'd say while the Papa Wolf is away... Yeah, come in and find out. See, si, see, si, see. Si. You just see it right now, amigo. It's a great place to have a picnic. Hmm. See, eventually all my people will be out, even if I'm not. I think you will find that your people are going to start looking for other things. Maybe a new Papa Wolf. Maybe. See, see, see. You know, you spoke of the Art of War. I want to show you or tell you something else that I heard once. Mm. He said the more he spoke of his honor, the quicker we counted his spoons. What do you think about that, amigo? The more he spoke of his honor, the quicker you counted pawns? Is that what you said? Spoons, amigo. Spawns. Spoons, spoons. Spoons. Silverware. I got I you. You're sitting at the dinner table and this pendejo is talking about how honorable he is. And then you're just robbing him blind. Exactly. Hey, this pendejo talking too much of honor. Go see if he stole something. <laughs> Think about it, amigo. Think about it. A lot of wisdom in that sentence. Sure. I mean, there's also just... You can flat out say honor gets you killed. You can say that, amigo. There's people that deserve honor, there's people that don't deserve honor. I've slowly realized that in life. You know, he's really funny with this Julian. He was talking about hurting somebody. However, he had these funny little stipulations. And not just Julian, some other pendejo as well. They're talking about killing someone. And they're making little... Little fucking... Uh, Disputes over where they should they stop him from the front, from the back, whether they look in him in his eyes or in his fucking ass. What difference does it make to killing a pendejo? If someone gonna come after me and take my life, you think I give a damn where they looking at? Well, you know, I'd hope somebody ain't staring at my ass before they kill me. You never know, amigo. They might be looking at it right now. I'd hope somebody ain't looking at my cock either before they kill me. I'm sure they're looking at that as well. <laughs> Time for me to go see if my partners remember me in the Telerama. Alright, sounds good. Yo, what up, Slappy? Did 
you win? No. no. Really? Oh, I was playing dumb, to be fair. I knew we had the seven, but I still went all in. Why? I wanted to see if I was right. Oh, thank you. <laughs> About what? What you have all the time? See if I read them correctly or not. Yeah, it was only like fifty dollars. I had to give them thirty-seven dollars from to even fucking play. <laughs> no, I wasn't too worried about it. Were you right? What was it? Said, so, were you right about him? Yeah, I, I read him on the seven. Yeah. I mean, even if I won the entire hand of poker and beat him completely on the table, I would have made thirteen dollars. I know. <laughs> so I was—I didn't really care too much. Fella had ten dollars to his name, and I'm sitting over here with fifteen hundred bucks. Alright, I got 20 potatoes for when they try to make a stick. 20 for you, 20 for me. The fella... The fella might try to make a move. Eventually. What do you mean? Just the way he was talking. He's the one that went into thieves, kidnapped Julian, and forced him to fight or something? No, nah, that's why he brought up Julian. And Josie threatened him, I think. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really care about Julian. The way I look at it is it's our gang against everybody. To be honest, I think Julian might be starting his own thing based on a couple telegrams I got from him. He was asking me about Lottie. Is that a medical bag? Yeah. What if it's fine? Do you have one? I do. Surprising. You yeah. can always just surrender. <laughs> midway through. When will I ever do that? Probably never. I mean, you tried once and I hit you. Mm -hmm. Are we going to do it on the bridge? Yeah, why not? Alright. Alright. Ready? I'm ready. Oh, really? Mm hmm. You're that confident? I am. Somebody's gotta knock you down a peg. Away from the side. All right. Good. Yeah. You're looking a little rough, huh? 
Yeah, I am. What about you? No, I'm okay. I don't think I've ever beat you when I've let you get a hit on me first. I think you'd learn. Yeah, well, I mean, I want to try to beat you one of these days when I let you get the first hit. Just can't let you get too cocky before this chess game. You okay? Yeah, I'm all right. I'm all right. Let's not make it. 4-3 me. Sounds right. I mean, I gotta keep letting you get the first hit in. That way we could at least get back to like 6-6. Six, six. Oh, we did a fun, a fight for fun, chicken. I let her get the first hit for free. She fucked me up. Oh, you were not, uh, you were not doing okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was hurting a bit. All right. Just gonna let you to know that. No, no, no. We did a fight for fun. food badly. Here. Nope, 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 nope. Trying to think what what do you have? What do you mean? Why are your pockets so full? Well, I've got 250 rounds of rifle ammunition. I've got 200 rounds of Why gun ammunition. I have seven gun oil. Toss uh, your fucking rifle. No, 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 no. That's precious money, sweetheart. I'm pretty sure it's five cents a rifle round. You, know you should toss at least is? the handgun. That's even worse. Handgun ammo's cheap. It's ten cents. Yeah, rifle ammo's twenty five cents around, I think. Yeah, but I love my handgun. How about I'll get rid of that. There you go. I tossed I think I gave my ammo to Speedy actually.
Yo, Peppo, thank you to raid, baby. I really love getting to interact with you, dude. I don't know, they just didn't take him from me, man. I love Edgar, bro. I mean, I was loving playing Ralphie, man. Oh, it's I love the, the bank jump that we did. It was so good. Hoops and Hoop, Hoop and I were talking about how funny it was. We went back and watched your POV of the bank job. I wish one of us were streaming, dude. Dude. You're gonna win this, right? Yeah, I hope so. Dude, neither me or Hoop were streaming, Peppo. But we both came out of the after we left the bank, dude. It was insane. We we leave it. We leave the bank, get on the hostage, and like eight lol ride into town from our perspective. And we walk, we ride past them, and Hoop and I both scream on our golds. Well, I figure martial law. There's a bank being robbed. We were told to leave, <laughs> and just all the law go past us. <laughs> it was fucking hilarious, dude. All right, dude. I need food. <sighs> Who do you think he wanted out of the group? Uh, well, he said. He said not you, but he used her. Uh, and he seemed to know who Josie is. So I'm assuming Josie. It, did, it sounded like he didn't know who Rebecca was. Sounds good, Peppa. Thank you. Yeah, I was I, I, the last person I played that actually knew a lot about chess before I played you. He basically said go for center of the board. Try to take control of the center. So, have a have a good luck with training. Let's see, I gotta respond to some telegrams. Sweetheart, I gotta respond to some telegrams. Take your time. Sweet. Max's telly, no clue. All right, let's see. Sure, Siska, you want to even see this for a while, but I'm hoping you still remember everything you have out here. Everything you have to live for still. I hope you're okay. Love you. Yeah, Mills sent a really sweet telegram to you that I read. I'd say I hope you're doing well, but I know how that place is. I hope you don't lose lose too much of yourself this time around. I'll see you when I see you, Mills.
Oh, guns versus kings. John B. J. Boss, John B. Ruth, John B. Figure, woohoo. I like our little telegram sessions with Jesse. I'm not even responding to this guy. Around, where is everybody? <laughs> Good one, Ronnie. Telegram.
on the table, really? You gonna dance? <laughs> yeah, you should shut up. I have some dollars. The only thing I do on this table ain't. What? Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, um, Rudy keeps talking about something called back shots. Do you know what that is? <laughs> Ask him. I did. He wanted to explain it, and then even, even though the the old men in the group said that I should ask someone else. Ask your aunt. <sighs> when I'm asking my uncle. Well, you can ask your aunt. Also, this ain't fair, sweetheart. You're sitting on my left side. I'll do what it takes. It's nice to be out here. It's actually get to sit and talk to people. Telegram. I told you I slept watching the door down to solitary. You know, there's a chance if I'll beat them, they'll just drag me back to solitary, right? I know. Don't ever expect any of this to go smoothly. You know, it's never worth taking a deal with him. Then why are you doing it? Because I took the deal with him the first time. So all I gotta do is find one deal. A single deal. I can find a loophole. I'm already down this fucking pit of despair of deals. Like I said, no matter what he pulls, you need to focus on the game. You know, uh, you be willing to risk it all for freedom. What do you mean? I'm just asking. Is there ever really freedom? did have this plan. I would argue it's probably would be labeled as schemery. <laughs> Gotta be a schemer to fight a schemer. I was thinking if he beat me 
killing him. <laughs> or having somebody else kill him. And before he could tell anybody else, I'll claim I won the game. I think Edgar would kill him for money. Seems pretty motivated by money. Maybe. Have you ever thought about putting a hit out on him? I've always wanted the satisfaction of doing it myself. If I lose, there's still the skull deal. Both of us know the result of that deal. Of that deal is Mexico. Such a stir, bro. I'm hoping somebody gets uh, eventually wants to leave the gang chat one day. I talk with with uh, Edgar. It made me just realize how spicy it would be. Uh because I, do you want to know the do you want to know do you, do you want me to really raise the stakes of how spicy it was? Don't you bastard. Can't wait to hear the comments on that one. Uh, selfishly, I think it would be really sick, but it's more of like a it won't happen thing. 
I highly doubt it happens, truthfully. But, uh, the best part would be, uh, I'd use my final say. <laughs> I'd finally f use my final say. And I think it would cause so much dissent within the gang. If somebody wanted to leave, and they were okay, everybody was okay with them leaving, and I final say it and then fucking shot them in the head in front of everybody. I think that shit would be so fucking so anything spicy. you want to do while you're at least out for now? <laughs> I just, I think it'd be so spicy. I'd be so tempted to do it just based on the spice factor, bro. got dice. I do. How many? Three. You wanna give me one? Yeah. God damn it. So, Uncle Aura? Yeah. I just got two telegrams that are kind of interesting. Um, one, remember the Benjamin situation, the man I kicked out of Thieves for snitching to the Dicenzos on everyone? Sure. Yeah. He was found apparently in Thieves by Isaac and Zip, and they shot him and removed him from Thieves. Isaac and, and Zip? That's right. Isaac telegrammed me. Because Isaac was, I mean, yeah, Isaac was around when we were talking about it. But I received a telegram from Isaac saying he shot down Zip, or Zip and him shot down the Benjamin who was snooping around thieves. They apparently tried to question him. It wasn't very detailed, but they shot him down. Regardless, he was back in thieves, and I told him not to be. And he thought he could get away with it, I suppose. Anyway, um, also... The CC situation, I know you guys don't really care, but Moon telegrammed me saying she's out of their group now, and we can do what we like to her, or something. That's uh, between you and James? Yeah. Letting you know, because I know Josie mentioned something. Okay. Yeah, it's between you and James. Okay. So they let you go. Nope. I got a three. <laughs> God damn it. Got a four. B bullshit. You got a one and a three the first time you rolled. Yeah, and I would take the three, so then I rolled again and it's four. Alright, so you've got a four now, okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, and I've got a two. You won the first hand. Okay. Alright. Ready? Yep. Five. Are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> okay. Alright. You alright? I, I think I'm gonna lose today. Maybe just all your bad luck's getting out of the way. There you go. C one one. I'm done. <laughs> Stupid 
of a sort loser. I just made 50 cents. <coughs> Off my dice that I... Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. You know, I dug those dice up myself. Oh, wow. You have a dollar on you. Mm-hmm. That's right. But I'm keeping my dice and my 40 potatoes. Well, you want to play a game of chess? Might yeah. as well just get in practice. All right, here we go, chat. I was kind of destroying Aurora and Chess earlier today. And then I got my ass kicked by Peppo. But I, I feel like Peppo actually knows how to play. All right, you ready? I'm ready. I'm gonna try to play a lot different than normal. That's not what I meant to do, but that's fine. Very easy defense. I, I think I could still do this, though. Depending on our next move. If she doesn't move... Okay, hold up, though. Checkmate. What is your name, prisoner? Holy shit, I did not expect that. Are you trying to scam me, prisoner? Uh... I'm gonna go make sure... I'm gonna go make sure he understands what we're doing. Before you keep playing. Okay. All right, prisoner, your identification is 242. Prisoner, what is your prisoner number? 242. All right, that's good. What do you win here for, huh? What, what? Oh, wow. Well. You've done a lot of interesting... Like, you said you're a scam artist. I see bank robbery on here. Yeah, well, uh, scam artist and also upcoming bank robber. I forgot to add okay, that. Okay, yeah, okay, that's fair then. Mm, all right. Moonshining. Yeah, yeah, that was me. Okay, so are you also an upcoming moonshiner? Yeah, why not, eh? Okay. You also kidnapped a deputy, I see here. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, yeah, well, the, yeah. you're just a fucking criminal then? <laughs> like, I don't think there's no, really the greatest... something 
Shut up. No. Don't you fucking inter- Don't you. Don't you dare fucking interrupt me. All right? Yeah, right. You know what? Drop down and give me five sit-ups. What? No, that, what, I didn't, I didn't five do fucking anything. sit-ups. I didn't even do anything. I, I didn't even do anything. Are you, are you like, questioning me? Yeah, all right, all right, all right, all right. Fuck. <laughs> the f- I said yeah. fucking sit-ups, not burpees. Yeah. <laughs> Prisoner, what is your yeah. name? Uh, Jabaz. I'm usually in solitary. Okay, well that's good, I guess. But I didn't ask you where you fucking normally are. You what your name was, didn't I? Yeah, I'm just giving you information. Fuck. Okay. Fuck. Oh shit. So, give me more information such as your name. Jabaz. Yo, J- what up, J- John? J- Jabat. Yes, if you what look at Jabat, I should come. It should come up. Is that like nobody else has an issue with it? Uh, fucking hell. No, but like, what kind of? Is that like French? No, I don't think so. Is it short for something? Yeah, I think it's what you you. Yeah, it's what people call me. Oh, your actual name is Jonathan Divine. Divine. There, That's that right. that makes a bit more. So. Yep. How'd you get the nickname Jabas? You want the full story? I mean, just a fucking short answer would be good. I'll give you the short answer, but the full story. Uh, I think it was my second day. I was going to meet my Uncle Sam Bass, and I walked into... He used to run a Valentine bar. I walked over there, and somebody said, Oh my God, that Sam Bass's nephew? That must be Jabass, because they knew my name was Jonathan. And it stuck well, okay, ever I, since then. Okay, that makes sense. All right, there you go. That's it. All right, what is your prisoner identification number? Uh, I believe it's 463? Oh, incorrect. Five sit-ups. All right. So, are you watching this? Look at that. Yeah. Excellent form. All right, that's one. All right. (laughs) One. That's it. That's it. Feel the burn. Perfect. Okay. Now you're doing push-ups. That's what I like to see. Yeah, I'm transitioning keep, the sit-ups into push-ups. Keep doing push-ups. God, yep. you do right. excellent uh. cardio. Uh. Okay. All right, that's three. You two, get the fuck over here. Don't think I didn't see you. Okay. And uh. that was five. Excuse me, Pink Man. It's fucking bullshit. All right, all of you against the wall, if you please. Hey. Sit up against the wall. Guard, I was gonna. You get a bit, you get a bit of could, shit on you. Prefer- yeah, it's it's mud. Do you prefer? I got a question. Do you yeah, prefer shit, guard or do you literally prefer name? Literally, I prefer guard. Guard. All right, up against the wall. Go on. All right. Uh, Big L has allowed me out of solitary because I have a chess game against him today. Amazing, truly amazing. Yeah. All right, my name is Guard. Mister, Shut the fuck what's up. What's your name, Mister? Oh, did I? Did I ask you to speak? No, did I, I asked you to interrupt me. No, that's why I'm asking. What's your name, Mister? Right. Well, maybe if you me- let me finish my fucking sentence, I would have told you. Oh, you didn't okay, think then. of that, did you? No. I ain't. Can I ask a question? Right. Is that prison number four in front of me? That is, isn't it? Me? Who? Prison number four. Mm, I'm two eight six, but yes, four from last night. Correct. There we go. Prison number four. See, and she called me guard. She knows how things work around here. My name is guard. When I ask a question or give a command, you will respond, yes, guard. Is that understood? So, so quick question, mister. Oh, my <laughs> yes, fucking no, I'm just, I just got a question. So, hold on. Did, did your parents name you guard or something? <laughs> okay. Prisoner, unfortunately, let me just check here. Yes. Let me just have a look. Unfortunately, your uniform does not uh, adhere to the standards of the penitentiary. You're going to have to get changed. Can I have fifty dollars? Yes, you can. I will give you a, a prison stub. This way. The rest of you stay against the wall. Now, prisoner, I want you to turn around. I want you to look at uh, that yeah. one to the left of me. You see his yeah. uniform, white and blue, yes. standard boots? Yes. That is what you're going to wear. Is that did understood? You say, did you say blue? Is that not blue? I'm a bit colorblind. So. It's black. That's black. It's black. Oh, well, good. It's really That's dirty, yeah. Okay. What, quick question. Do I have to be exactly like him? Yeah, sure. Why not? 
Okay. Get matching hats. All right, prisoner. Up against the wall, you two. Tessa. Yeah, I have something for you. Hold still. Me too. I can't. I can't get out of here. I can't get here. Get some. I made you some potatoes so you can eat. You're welcome. Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. The fucking alligator. It attacked me. What? The, the, the fucking it's alligator. Real? I saw it. It's real. It attacked me. It chased me through the yard. It's fucking crazy. It, that, that big guy commands it. The, the mustache big man. Never the big seen the, the, the the L guy. Long the cat. The, the L. Something L. The the boss. The big boss. Big he commands L? it. And he, he commanded it. The L guy. Got it to attack <laughs> me and it was chasing me through the freaking fields. <laughs> oh god! Not the L guy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm alright. Couldn't catch me. No one catches Dazza. No one. I mean, they kind of did catch you, Dazza, <laughs> you and Jessica, L but guy. I get your point. I mean, it, I had some dust in my eye, and that, you know, was at a disadvantage that day. Alright, prisoner with the blonde hair, what is your name? Name's Aurora. What? Aurora. You're named after the basin? Yep. That makes sense. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, your prisoner ID, do you know it? I do not. All right, your prisoner ID is 951. What is your prisoner ID, prisoner? 951. There you go. All right. Prisoner, you now be referred to as prisoner number six. It is up to you to remember your number. Is that understood? Can't you just call me Dazza? That's my name, eh? I think you'll be prisoner numbers? number six. Is that You're understood? Right. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just have one question, Mr. Guard. Oh, my fucking God. The next person I... who answers a question, right, with another question, is going to get fucking smacked, okay? It's really not that hard. You say, yes, guard, you shut your fucking mouth. Yeah, right. What was that? I said, y yes, guard. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, prisoner number four, you are still prisoner number four. Understood? Yes, sir. Yes, guard. All right. Prisoner number, uh, what, what, what am I up to here? Seven. Six. Shit, six. No, he's six. So she be... No, no, yeah, he's six. You're, you're seven. All right? Blondie, I'm talking to I, you. I thought you said I was nine, five, one. No, you're six. All right? You get two numbers. Wait, what? You get two numbers. I like to complicate things. Is that an issue? Not at all. There you go. All right, that makes you number seven. Understood? You said she was seven, and then before her, yep. you said the other guy was six. So how am I, I, I also two seven? Two. Yeah, right, you're eight. I'm eight, so See, she's I'm, seven. I'm testing your okay. memories. You're all, all right, doing perfect. great. I'm seven, okay. Okay, so you're seven, Blondie, and you're eight. Understood? Yes, guard. Oh, they were, you're a, you know, for a fella who's been in isolation this long, you've came out exceptionally smart. You'll get ahead in here. Oh, uh, Booker said I was a good inmate, so. There you go. That's what I like to hear. Good inmates make good guards. Good guards make good times. Good times mean prison is in a fucking shithole. Guard? Right. Yes. Uh, Big L's only let me out of solitary for a chess game. And he said I could have time to practice before the chess game. Because I don't know how to play chess. Do you know how to play chess? I guess. Would you be willing to play me in chess? Hmm. Sure, why not? Oh! Alright. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect... Alright, the rest of you, though. <clears throat> I didn't I'm expect that. I'm something a bit odd about all three of oh, you. Oh, shit. Thank God, finally. <laughs> hair. Why do we not have hair inmates? I don't know. Because you guys are insecure about your hair, that's why. And you want to cut ours. That's an incorrect answer. Hygiene and lice, I guess. There we go. Hygiene and lice. See, I always knew prison number four was the smartest one of the bunch. Now tell me prison number what? Six. Uh, Is it? Is it six? Yeah, yeah. Do you have lice? No. I don't. Th I don't think so. Mm. All right. Uh, prison number seven. I need you to inspect prison number five's 
six, whatever the fuck number he is for lice, all right? Prison number six, and please what? just take a seat. What? Why? What? Because you, look at look at you. Out of everyone here, you're definitely going to be the one who's got lice. What makes you say that, huh? I mean, I, I'm just going to look at you, mate. Oh, God damn it. All right, get to it, prisoner. All right. Use your hands. Can you take your hat off? Yeah. I don't see anything. Mm, dig a little deeper. You're not going to see lice as you think they're microscopic. You've really got to comb your fingers through. Actually, you can see lice and their little eggs. They look like the rice grains. Exactly. But not from that fucking little touch. You might as well just blow in his hair a bit. What time, prisoner, were you meant to have this apparent chess game? I was just told at some point tonight. Some point tonight? Well, that's very fucking open-ended, isn't it? Uh, it is very open-ended. Prisoner, do you see anything? No, oh, there's something in there. What? No, there oh, what? What? Something moved. Oh, something on. moved. Oh, oh, just no, hurry no, up, no, move it. No, no. We don't need a life no, in this station here. I, I don't, I don't want to go to the barbers. I don't want to. No. Ew, wash your hands. Something's no, moved. No, I didn't do anything. No, don't take my hair. All right, the rest of you line up towards the barbers. Oh, right fuck. There. Just you grew. You're on the wrong way. Move it. No, oh, right. yeah, I'm there, I'm you're there. going the wrong way. Oh shit. Stop. You can't get back into general population. No! Prisoner! Oh, he is fucked. <laughs> yeah. If we hear a gunshot, he's dead. <laughs> Most likely. Sorry, I had to jump in the water. Uh, he's making us shave our heads again. Of course he is. As a dazzle. Bugs. <laughs> Maybe that will distract him for a while. This way. You try and run and you get the bullet to the leg, don't think I can't shoot it off your head. Or, 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 or the rest of you this way too. Stay doing... away from his hair. Yeah. Oh God. There must be some kind of thing which will make you something. You know, if you don't pay my hair, I can, I can, I can, I can work extra hours. You're lucky I'm not fucking dousing you in gasoline and light the match, okay? In you get. Yeah, all right. Come on, everyone in. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna be scared of just the little mites that are running around in his fucking scalp. I mean, you were around. You know, you can get lice just from hugging someone and you were pushing him. I'm pretty sure you might have some. Alright, prisoner, I don't need your fucking educational guesses today, alright? You're right. Alright. Fucking hell. Like Do you see how much dirt like is in his hair? No, it's a, a worm or lice. I'm not sure. It's, I mean, it might be lice, but it also could just be a fucking worm or something. Or a beetle. A ton of fucking dirt oh, in his hair. It. And mud. Oh. Sorry, sir. What are we getting ourselves up to? Oh my god. Oh, oh hello. Oh, look. We may have a lice infestation. Ah, oh, lice infestation. In my prison? I don't think so. It wasn't lice, it was just a fly, alright? Alright, I washed right, my hair on. three weeks ago, it's fine. Yeah. Are you sure? Drop what? your pants, we're shaving everything. Oh god, oh god. No, no, oh, no, no. Okay. Yeah. I'm a virgin, no, I can't Back over see here, you guy. heard him. No. Don't you dare. Alright, you run, you get the bullet. Yeah. Now, Rory, you might want to come over here. 
I'm just kidding. It was a joke. Yeah. Fuck. Get me out of here. Oh, okay. Get, get the fuck out of my office. Yeah, all right. I'm, I'm leaving. Yes, uh, yes, Mr. Excuse Guard. me, uh, Mr. What happens? Be your name. Guard Enrique. I Pleasure thought that was Enrique. Uh, ple pleasure to meet you. My name is also Guard. I'm sure you can see my actual name and things, but I don't give precious my actual name. It gives it power. Guard it makes it way easier. <laughs> exactly. See? Perfect. So, obviously, uh, we did have a possible bug infestation uh, in that inmate's head, which means, obviously, all these three others have to get snip snip. Ah, yes. We cannot have the follicles, for they can be used as a weapon. Exactly. Oh, and and I good. need some motherfucking socks. So, who's next in the goddamn chair? Uh, this inmate here has been uh, let out on special occasion as he's meant to be participating in a really uh, chess well. match of shorts. Uh, I warm. see. Yeah. Wow, you have uh, a lot of face pubes. They're going right now. Sit down. Yep. Yeah. I've been in isolation. Down I ah, have isolation. Yeah, I'm the, I'm in solitary every time. Okay. I'm oh my god! Oh god! What? Sorry, sorry. <sighs> now here in Sisaka, you would oh, think, oh, he has soap. Oh, look, he has a cup sitting right here with a little foamy brush right here, right? <laughs> Am yeah, I going to use that? Fuck no! no, no I'm spitting not. on this goddamn razor and I'm <laughs> cutting your hair. <laughs> All right. Get, are you gonna inspect it for like lice, or are you just gonna cut it? Cause I have my head shaved. Okay. <laughs> no. For this, we are shaving your head, and then we are shaving your face, and then we are shaving your eyebrows. All with the understanding that I am going to go through it, hair by hair, and using it for my coat, as well as my pants and my socks made Fair of enough. human fur. Fair enough. It all comes off. You are going to be balder than the day you were born. No, I'm usually this bald when I'm in Sisiga. If I had it my way, I shave your nipples as well. All right. <laughs> Not off, but I mean like you know. Yeah, I know what it. you mean. Yeah, no, like, I know sometimes you, you know, mean. like yeah. you get those really intrusive hairs. You know, like yeah, you gotta get rid of those. Yeah, yeah, of course. You know, some people are like prescribing to pluck them, but I feel like that just is like torture. You know, like I just go ahead and shave it off. You know, it's when a lot I easier that a, way. When I was a boy. I, my nipple hair is richy, so I scratched myself and I chewed my thumbnail at such a sharp angle that I actually ended up cutting open my chest and leaving a, a scar for the next 20 years right below my nipple. A straight line. It looked like I'd been stabbed, so that's what I told everyone. You know what? Thinking about that, it's like, you know those envelope-style pockets that you have on jackets and such? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that kind of reminds me of that, and like the little yeah. latch is your titty. You know, like, there you go, man. That's nice. Good on you. Yeah, of course. A little he, scar underneath your nipple, like it's like one of those pockets. So there you go. You uh, you gonna shave my head next? Fuck yeah, <laughs> I'm going to pocket. shave your head. Head's going too. It all is just straight down to a stubbly stubble. Yeah, yeah, of course. <sighs> Hold on, I gotta put like a little bit more spit shot on this uh, razor. Here we go. You can get the there top we now. Are. Oh, all of it. It's oh, all coming off. I want to see scalp. Beautiful. Look at that. Smooth smooth as a baby. I'm going to just give you like a little... There you go. You like that? <laughs> right. No, right I there. do not like that. Well, you got it. And that's your life, okay? All right. Now the eyebrows. I don't... Goodbye, eyebrows. All right. There you go. <laughs> you have now... to take off my eye patch if you need to get the other one. Nope. We're going to just leave that because I don't want to <laughs> see your fucking vacant hole. Okay, so you're just gonna shave the one eyebrow? <laughs> yeah, so that's why you have a little bit of character, you know? All right, man. That's yeah, fun. if you want to, like, give someone the eyebrows, you can only give them one eyebrow, and it's your bad eye, so there you go. Yeah, no, uh, that makes sense. You charm them. You charm the fuck out of them. Next! Blowing up a third five? Yeah, that sounds fun. Uh, Damn fella. Now uh, the partner. They saved you up real good. Yeah, they they said if not everybody goes in there, they're <laughs> they're gonna punish you. <laughs> he said hey, they got me the other day. Yeah, they said they're if if you don't go in there, they're gonna punish you pretty much. Well, oh, here he comes. He's getting everybody. So 
Oh, oh hell. Growing numbers every day. All right. Bald check. Bald check. Already bald check. Yes. All right. You see that? That's a bit more up to standard right there. Who the fuck is this? See, I told what him. What's your name, mate? I, I told everybody this is superior haircut. You know, what about eyebrows, though? Everybody's got eyebrows. What is your name, inmate? Stop eyeballing me or I'm going to poke them out. Hey, you call me Peaches. <laughs> All right, well, that's not what I'm going to call you, but you know, good to know. Do you have an actual name instead of a fucking fruit one? Oh, hell, it's Stelio, partner. A what now? <laughs> Stelio. Stelio. How do you spell That's that? That's right. How do you think it's spelled? I don't fucking know. That's why I'm asking. You question with another question again, you're going to regret it. S-T-E-L-I-O. I ain't sure which name they got me under right now. Is your surname uh, uh, Contros? That's right. Wonderful. Contrast? Do you know your prisoner ID? Prisoner ID? No, I do not. It is 587. Prisoner, what is your prisoner ID? 587. There we go. Looks like you do have a brain between those ears. How good. Hey, Mr. God, they never told me what my prisoner number is. What is it? What? What's your name, prisoner? Uh, what? Rude boy Rudy. How do you have hair? He wanted to style my hair more than cut it. June 2. 602, Rudy. 602. What is your ID? I like now I've been fucking wearing a corset. Okay. I think it's chess. Oh. You know, sometimes I wonder if there's more of us than there is uh, these damn guards. Why? And they, they <laughs> let y'all braid your hair and shit? He said uniformity. They let you keep mm -hmm. your hair? That's not fair. That well, yours had like a hair. worm in it. What? No, it didn't. Because of you, we They're... all had to shave our heads. When I checked it a month ago, it was fine. That's disgusting, Dazza. Why? If you got a lifey hair, stay away from me, motherfucker. I don't have no hair no more. Just don't hug him because it's That's contagious. Alright, which one of you has the uh, pubic lice? It's the pubic lice? It's the... It's, it's, you saying... You saying it's, like, it's Rudy. It's Rudy. Yeah, yeah, it's, the right you, it's the guy behind you, Enrique. It's the guy behind, behind you, Enrique. This guy right here on yeah. the chair? No, mm -hmm. to my right. It's, it's the both yeah, yeah, it's him. Right. So you want the itchy crotch here, huh? Itchy crotch? Yeah, you're the one that has the itchy crotch. Are you going to save my crotch or something? I mean, we do have ointments and such that I could prescribe to you. I am the medic as well. <laughs> See, well, I would take it, but in reality, that fella right there is the one with the itchy crotch. That, that okay, one was well, the one this is what crotch. I'm going to do, okay? Yes. I'm going to prescribe to you a healthy dosage of acetone. It's used specifically to get rid of nail polish, but I'm pretty sure it's going to burn off something for okay. you, okay? Perfect. I mean, could, could everybody get some of that? Because I'm assuming everybody got that now. No, just you. Who the fuck are you? Just you. Oh! If it isn't my arch enemy. Thank you. Well, well, well. The fuck you looking at? How are you? How do we get to your left hand side so you can see me better? How are you? been a while well 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 yeah come make them make them look at this all right you're supposed to have my back doyle you're supposed to have my back you motherfucker oh. i got a goddamn demerit point over you you son of a bitch <laughs> yeah you fucker that didn't that didn't take long god damn it huh remember said fucking reporters up in here in fucking sisica island because of you you fuck! I think that's meant to be on the inside. I'll make you clean that up, you son of a bitch. 
No, we should get one of the inmates. Prisoner number seven over here, please. You son of a bitch. You were supposed to have my fucking back, asshole. I did have my back. No, you I didn't. For I did. You did have my back. I asked for prisoner number seven. <sighs> yes. What happened? With, with prisoner number seven. They smacked his ass on the ground, I swear to God. Why? Because he deserves it. Can I fist fight people so I don't have to dip my dick in acetone? It is not up to me. Can I offer it to him so I don't have to dick, flip, dip my dick in acetone? Stop offering to inmates what and prisoners fuck? and guards to stick your dick in anything, okay? I'm not, I'm not trying to stick my go dick in anything. Go with the others. Go on. Go on. Go on. Hurry up. All you had to do was keep your fucking mouth shut. Yeah, and you know what? You didn't keep your mouth shut, asshole. I did keep my mouth no, shut. No, you didn't because they came to me with info, motherfucker. You were the only they other one that up. knew. They made it up. Did they make it up? Prisoner. You want to know what they told me? <laughs> What'd they tell you? How about instead of knocking me the fuck out, you talk to me? What the fuck okay. are you talking about? They came to me saying that you came to them and gave info that only you would have known. I, get, I had to do a report. I said that the fucking rumor call is. Yeah, I said that I gave you some it. fucking breathing room uh, while no, your cell was hello, being cleaned. No, long time no see. Oh, hey there, Mr. Enrique. How's it going? You know, nothing, you know, no trouble. You just beat this uh, prisoner to the ground as usual. He's been, okay. a, he's been a bit of a uh, nuisance. Okay, all right. <gasps> we have a new doing? medical procedure. If they do happen to have lice of any sort, we pour hydrochloric acid on it, okay? No, oh, sounds good to me. Sounds oh, good, good to me. Good, you good know, this one might have lice, to be honest. Is that, what, is what is that? What is that? I think that's blood, Doyle. <laughs> ah, you're Doyle. Why is this guy not in solitary? There's a he chess was, uh, match or something like he, that. Yeah, he was granted special permissions to be out of uh, solitary confinement uh, by the warden special himself. Special permissions, eh? I think it's because he told a whole bunch of crimes that he swore he never would, but I don't know. You know, that is up to par. This one does talk a lot. <laughs> Which is not going to be very good for chess. I mean, you can have a conversation while you I'm in chess game. You fucking your back, motherfucker. I bet you couldn't even play chase, all right? I bet you could beat you with my eyes closed. I bet you. Give I it a try. I bet you hands. I could beat you with my eye closed. You I know what they it. call me? You're already halfway there. The breaker of chairs and the checkmater, all right? The checkmater? That's right. All I do Fuck is you. checkmate. <laughs> I don't get it. You know what yeah, I, I, think, I think you know what you're looking like? Do you looking like to me? Like what am I looking like, huh? Don't you're really looking work. like nothing but a washed up stalemate. <laughs> oh, is that so? <laughs> That's right, fella. You know what you're looking like? What? You're looking like. You're looking like you're about to get checkmated in four moves, fella. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, uh, well, like you're all in for a treat now. Uh, there he is. The chest mess for Jonathan Divine Saturday begins in 15 minutes. Meet in the courtyard. No, no matter what. Hi, Daddy. All right, Focus Prince, on the game. Him, get moving. Uh, where we headed? Splendid. Thank you, the 50 the bomb. Not, are you deaf? Yes. Okay. okay, well, that makes sense. I don't know. I don't know. All right, get moving. We're doing hard labor for 15 minutes. I want to talk with you, Doyle. I want... No. I want to... One on one. Don't you dare smack someone, make me have to drag you away for the solitary for 15 minutes. I'm not gonna smack you. Don't you dare start beating the shit out of this guy to my left. I'm not gonna beat the shit out of Rudy. <laughs> Don't you dare horribly <laughs> maim and almost murder this man to my left. I don't even think that's possible, fella. What is it? Cause I'm the best goddamn fist fighter around. You're the best fish fighter around? Yeah, I got hands. I'm, I'm fast. Nah, you're not. Marquis Frazier you? has you beat. Marquis the bum. He's the world champ. He's the bum. <laughs> All right. I'll be able to you're take the best on Marquis. fish fighter, then. <laughs> Does that, motherfucker! Oh, he swung. <laughs> he swung and missed. He swung and he missed. <laughs> and it's the same like the best fish, fish fighter, fighter at all. Ass. You want to see the best fish fighter? <laughs> Oh, that's oh, 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 my oh, oh, my oh, my oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh god! Holy fuck, he can definitely take a hit though, I gotta give it to him. <laughs> Damn, he can. <laughs> He's bleeding right. from his fucking skull! Rudy. Oh, 
All right, well, you get what you get. You don't get upset. The rest of you this way. Come on. M-A-C-K-E-Y-D-O-I-L-E. Who's the guard we all despise that beats you down to the ground? All right, move it. My goodness, wait for my chess game. You got 15 minutes. In that 15 minutes, plenty of potatoes can be picked. There's never any of a shovel. All right. I, I don't have yes, a sir. shovel. I'll fucking get one then. I got potatoes for you. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna kill Boy. No, you're not. Yes, I am. I'm trying to get yourself killed. I should be doing it the way you killed that other person. All right, she made it. Like a rainbow. All right. Now, there has been a shortage in the kitchen recently due to a rat infestation. All right, you all have five minutes of straight digging. Whoever comes out with the least amount of potatoes is going to have a hell of a time. Understood? It's going to be Josie. I said he's not fucking understood. Yes, guard. Yes, guard. Yes, guard. More. That said yes, guard. There you go. All right. On the count of three. Three, a two, a one. And get digging. Get digging, you fucking morons! Quick! Oh no! I'm struggling here. Yeah. Potato. Um, I, I, we, I think do we there's a, I think there's a storm coming. Everyone, bunk it down. Oh, do, we, do we still have to call out every time we potato? Oh wait. Potato. Really potato. Yeah, yeah. The shovel's just really light. Oh, really okay, the shovel's really light. I will potato. move around a bit. Potato. Uh, potato. Alright, that's it. Keep calling. Potato. Around. Potato. Worm. Whoever gets the least amount of potatoes is gonna have a fucking shit time, I'm telling you now. Potato. I want you all to sing something while you potato. do it next 60 seconds. Start singing! Potato. Hot potato, hot potato. There we go. She's digging, a, digging a potato. That's that's crazy. I'm digging a potato. Potato. That's right. Potato. That's Keep digging. I you dig sorry hot excuses for potato picker. Drew a mustache with your finger and your fecal matter on my painting. Potato. Don't you sit there and act surprised. Potato. I'm going to find out who it was. And until I do, the chess match is not happening. That's disgusting. Potato. <laughs> Execute them all. Potato. Not damn the people that put the poop on my face. <laughs> Potato. I have another three minutes of potato digging, sir. I told them whoever gets the least amount of potato. potatoes is going to have a horrible fucking time. So Good. There, we, do, we do have a shortage due to a rat infestation in the uh, kitchen, sir. And then execute the rats, too. What, hey, sir, how, how would you like that? Potato. Or just for me to shoot them. Shoot them. Potato. It seems like a waste of ammunition, sir, but I'll do so nonetheless. Excuse me, I didn't hear you. You said what? Potato. potato. Say it fucking louder. Potato. I didn't hear you. Potato. All right, good. Potato. Potato. 
Why have all the potatoes over there? I think all the potatoes are over there, yeah. Oh, potatoes! Potato. I have no idea. Potato. Sir, how are you doing? I'm doing like I have an execution to attend to. Is it an execution? <laughs> Potato. Potato. What? I Potato! You. Potato! <laughs> What about you two useless ones over here? What the fuck are your potatoes, huh? Uh, I have five potatoes, sir. Five? Yes, sir. What about you, you dumb one in the stupid fucking little sock <laughs> on your head? I have six. I have six. Oh my god. Alright, what about you, you one-eyed fucking rat bastard? I got 14, cunt. Alright. What about you, hair? I got 11. All right. Five, you better fucking pick it up. <laughs> Bring the inmates to the courtyard in five minutes, all right? All right. Five Top minutes. of the hour. Top of the hour. Top of the hour. What? You ready? Potato. Good. I'm, I'm excited. Potato. What? I, it's win-win for me, man. Nah, I got it. I, it's definitely not win-win for Jabaz, but it's win-win for me. All right. And some fire roleplay that comes out win or that? loss. I have to make it obviously clear. Last time I was surveying a group of people in this Potato. field, I murdered. And by murder, I mean rightfully did my job and did a righteous killing. Of a female inmate. Ain't that right? Sure is. Inmate. Then you tried to blame me. After you fucking drove a pickaxe through her skull. Potato. Yes, and you tried to blame me and get me Potato. in trouble. You know why our plan didn't work, by the way? Potato! He's, he puts blueberry in the fucking Yeah, game. if you would've known that, we could've gotten away with it. We could've just said it was a different gator. I, I know, but you fucked up bringing blueberry into the equation. All you had to say was it must've been a different gator. We, you know what you had to say? You know what we could've done? We could've just done my plan and threw that bitch in the water after we killed her. I'm not hiding the body. I got 15 potatoes. And now I have to sit here and fucking do babysitting duty in the fucking fields. Making me do my job. Potato. We could have been eating steaks, smoking cigarettes. Looking at pictures of nude people. I was going to no. sell you a navy. <laughs> Just gotta get this. From the Kenko Mango Kid. From the what? The Kenko Mango Kid. The fuck is the Kenko Mango Kid? Cucamonga? This, that's it. Potato! Potential friendship with inmate Jabez over. Friends with Cook Kanko Mango? <laughs> now. <laughs> now you ain't nothing but scum to me, alright? He's the resource. Walking, talking potato factories. <laughs> You could have been the warden. 
the oil. Yeah, I could have. You're never gonna have enough money to retire now. You're never gonna have enough money to retire now. You know who's next in line now? Yeah, Booker. Booker. Because of you. Because of you, motherfucker. Because of you, motherfucker. All you had to do was just take responsibility, gotten executed. No more to worry. <laughs> you couldn't even finish that with a straight face. You laughed. <laughs> yeah, I laughed at the thought of you being executed. Potato. Who do you care for most in the world, huh? Mm. Why does it matter to you? Just tell me. Myself. <laughs> Alright, good. Because after you die and you shit yourself, I'm gonna smear your own shit in your face. Have you... Have you smeared it in your face just when you cared about it? <laughs> <laughs> what what I if I, what, I if that works. what if I would have answered somebody else? Yeah. I would have smeared you shit in their face. Oh, okay. <laughs> Man, another no, potato. Potato. Another fucking potato. All right, let's get moving. Right. Come on. You want to stand in the fucking field all day or are we moving? <laughs> nice even line or I'll do you like I did Rudy. Which one of you is dying? None of us. Not oh. yet. Is that a warning shot? Yes. Okay. Warning shot. I do like me a good warning shot every once in a while. But I usually point it at somebody. You know, what is your accent? I love that accent. It's very nice. I'm from Sweden. You know, we used to have a Swedish inmate around here. Look, they made bend the knee. Go. Up against the wall. Go on. Get over there. On the wall, inmates. Moving. You worthless pieces of lie. I don't know anything. You know what? You know what? Big face, I think, I think they. Uh, I think we should do a check. We should do a check. Do a check. Check their pockets. All right. I'll start at this end. You start at the other end. Hands up. Face the wall. Hands up and face the wall. Routine check. Come on, prisoner. What do you got? Hey, what's this? A jewel pouch. It's potatoes. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. <laughs> A single berry? What the hell's up with that? Uh. The fuck you dressed up as Jack Kettleman? Contraband. No, I'm just wearing a hat because I'm bald. Alright, next. <laughs> Where the fuck you have these bullets? I don't know. Do you want I'll throw them? them away? Yes. They all have you want me to just keep throwing the bullets on the ground for you? Is that easier? Yes, Why keep throwing your bullets to the ground. All right. That's all the bullets. Jesus Christ, what the fuck is with all these bullets? Keys. What are these keys? Give me those. I, I really I have to use a Cigarettes? Digging. Contraband. Sure, they just got there. They, they come up and take us. Yeah, well, they're mine now. Can I use the restroom? All right, all right. Go I mean, on. honestly, what are they going to do? Yeah, Throw it at us? Can, you, well, can I have snappy. those keys back, please? Keys? They're just oh. rusty old keys. They don't do shit. Of course not. Yeah, they're kids. <laughs> yes. Those keys are mine now. <sighs> Which way? Where is he? Stay All strong, right, Enrique right. says face the wall. Where is he? Enrique strong, says put strong. your hands down. 
You should be listening. I don't see them, idea. You see him, mate? He was uh, right there. I think maybe the guards took What him. did Enrique say? I oh, right. told you I don't know nothing. I what didn't know nothing. <laughs> what did he say? Is one of the box? He was listening there on it. Oh, okay. All right. There we go. Enrique says turn around and greet Mort. Mort. Howdy, hey, Mort. What, Mort. what the Mort. fuck oh. is that? What? Howdy, Who Mort. Yeah, go grab yourself. Who the fuck are you? Hey there, Who's fat that? fuck. How you doing? Hello, this one. Who? You just wish to see me. You know what? Is he now? Who the hell yes. is this guy? I'll have you know I'm the only person to disrespect Morton this goddamn penitentiary. Not my guards, not my prisoners, nobody. Me. Ah, uh, he's fucking kicking me. Someone. You got a problem, hey? Uh, uh no, no happen? problem. You sure? Mister? Can't do this to me. Hey, no problem, mister. Yeah? Being. Okay, well that's good, isn't it? Because if you did, well, you'd be having a knee problem as well. <laughs> okay, Mort. All right, Mort. All right, put that damn thing away. Nobody wants to see it. All right. I told him he's the greatest worm in the class, but he, he's refusing to accept it. I'm just trying to enlighten him. Well, unfortunately, we have been derailed from our original plan because somebody decided to smear shit upon my Feel upper like. lip. Not physically, but on the paint and on my walls. Government property. Day. My government property. So. One of you knows who did it. Start talking. And while you're thinking about talking, I'm going to hold up my special listening device. So think. Oh, hell. I love your special listening device. Come on, y'all. Just who the hell did that shit? Tick. You know, if they don't Talk. answer, there's always these lanterns above them. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> we got the rest of the day for you to answer. All right, mate, this way. Line up on a wall. Uh, uh, sir, are, are we sure it wasn't that uh, uh, feller there? Or are you yeah, trying to insinuate that Mort? The head shit of my penitentiary would take his fecal matter and spread it amongst the upper lip of my painting. You think he has that much disrespect for me? No, I have raised him since he was a little spud. He respects me because I have given him life. I have given him purpose. <laughs> he would never do such a thing. So how dare you even attempt to assume? Well, well, well maybe it wasn't so much disrespect. But maybe he was just playing arts and crafts. Arts and crafts. Do you think he's capable of arts and crafts? <laughs> uh, I sure hey, you want me to answer that one. Yeah, you better think about your answer real hard. Do you think he's capable of arts and crafts? <laughs> uh, I, I suppose even a young child's uh, capable of it. So. Incorrect! He is oh, capable oh. of shit! <laughs> 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 oh my god! <laughs> Damn. I figure. <laughs> I figure. <laughs> None of you wants to come clean, huh? Your moral code, huh? <laughs> Little outlaw code of yours. We don't snitch on nobody. No. Well, well, gonna be, I don't know what's happening. Your code's gonna bring you together. All of you. I'll stuff every single one of you in one singular hot box. How's that? I don't know you who don't the fuck did it. Do you? I don't know who did it, and even if I did, I wouldn't tell you, Lawrence. Of course you wouldn't. Because you're a piece of shit. Lawrence. Hey, it's Big L. Warden to you. How dare you. Let him have his day. This is the last day of sanity for him anyway. <laughs> oh, <I think> <laughs> Any rationality this man has about to go fucking 25 feet out the window. But just like my uncle, right? Worse. At least he died knowing his name. I'll be surprised if you remember yours. 
<laughs> oh my god. Well, you have caught my bluff. It is unfortunate for me that it is physically impossible to stuff every single one of you into a singular hot box. In fact, I want to get this fucking game on the road. So, here on out. If any of you prisoners cause any, it's such a little bit of a ruckus. There won't be a hot box. There won't be anything. You will be on that gallows uh. and you'll be executed. If you try to give any outside assistance during this match, you'll be executed. Do you understand? Uh, well, what kind of match? This is a the yes or no chest, question, inmates. Yes, yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> I told me if the howdy. Good. Now let's gather. Well, you heard the loot. Oh my god. Uh... What's going on? Move it. I didn't ask you to speak. You shut the fuck up. You sit down. <laughs> <laughs> I like this new guy. You're all ah fucking. Okay, but if he loses, he doesn't get a bed light or anything. Checkmate. I win. Hello. Hello. All right. Here we go. So, how much have you, uh, how much have you been playing, uh, chess for? How long have you been playing chess for, Big L? This is my first day. <laughs> no way. In fact, I'm so confident that I don't even know to, need to know the rules of the game. <laughs> Piece goes forward, one goes left, one goes right. I'm sure I'll figure it out. <laughs> no way! Oh, another guy. I'm <laughs> good. I'm going to send it to. All right, let's get these pieces set up here on the board. Believe the little castle boy goes here, little horse man here. <laughs> this little priest fella goes here. All right. Doesn't even know what they're called. I think he's got him. You know what he's trying to play? You don't fall for it. Are you, uh, are you ready? Yes, I am. I'll move D4 with my pawn. <laughs> my eyes aren't working there. Um, hold on, something's happening. Hello, this is Big Where did you move? I don't see it. Uh, you didn't move a piece at all. I, I moved to E4. <laughs> Hold on, let me adjust my eyes. <laughs> Scuff. Ah, there we go.
That's an interesting mm. opening. A very interesting opening. I'm gonna go to I C4. See, I see. Oh. I'll move my bishop to C4. Now these little horses, they go with like an L shape, like my name, right? That is right, yeah. Now is that two up, one right? Two, yeah, two up, one right. Well, I guess my horse will go there. Damn it, he's the he's defending it. Actually, wait a second. The, the, uh, I'm g oh, he's yeah, he is defending it. Fuck. Fuck. All right, I'll move my horsey there then. That's preposterous. Now the horses are having a standoff. Well, I guess. Yeah. What do we do? I mean, do we have some kind of like a jousting match now? No, no. You just you move another piece, Lawrence. Well, all right. Well, if I can't joust you, I mean, I guess I'll, I'll go in L again. I don't know if that, that is that is my name after all. <laughs> Fucking Christ. I'll move my pawn up. Hmm. Well, my horse is in a lot of danger. Well, that's right. I don't get it. What I think my pawn will take yours and my horsey, horsey will take your pawn Hey, my horse will take your priest. Oh, I did not even see that What oh fuck Time load to add more pressure. Yeah, it would be fun. I don't even know how to set up the uh I don't even know how to set it up on uh, oh son of a bitch my horse is in danger. Well, that's right. Castle over there. Oh, hell. Damn, motherfucker, you really just swallowed that shit all goddamn. Jesus Christ. Two little pieces of meat in the middle. He just built different, man. Showdown for the ages. <laughs> Although I don't know how they're going to battle. They have such short little arms. In fact, I don't even think they have arms. No, I don't think they do have arms.
son of a bitch, bro. This son of a bitch knows what he's doing. <laughs> I can smell everybody's fear and intensity in the air. <laughs> it's palpable. Good move, Shari. What might be me? Where's that spiky fellow going? Why's he running away? No, oh, he's running away. He's taking. He's taking. Uh, he's getting fortified. Oh, the blunder. Okay, so we we really just we we're just we're really just playing for for weights right now, huh? We're we're literally just taking our sweet time. <laughs> yeah, okay, you're right. Well, that that fella just looks like he's just a little bit too pompous for me. And then you're going to do something about it. Is that a prisoner up there? Wait. That's a god. Inmate. Inmate. <gasps> What's he doing? Who's up there? He can't be the cow. I can't tell. I'm here. He's a ginger. Oh, then probably. You know how many gingers are here? A lot. My little man advances. Oh, come on now. Come on. <sighs> so I could re I could retreat here. But he might bishop me, but I can take his bishop. So we trade bishops at worst if I do this. Or I take his bishop now. He takes my All bishop. Bonus. It the rocks. But then he'll eventually take this. So I'm gonna do this. Him. He might take it with the queen. What's your name, inmate? The fuck did you just call him? Hey, James. Yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Isn't this book his dog? <laughs> isn't, this, isn't this book his dog? That is CD. Maybe. Come on, get a little. I think it is. I think it is. It's a little pup. He's got to take my bishop. Son of a bitch. And I take your bishop. Right, back to the tables. Go to the tables. Oh, look at that. Get over. Get over. Whoa. Come on. Hey. How could I not see this coming? <laughs> He's throwing, bro. Hey, boys. We Are got you another way. We got a family relation to watch. Are you thinking 20 steps ahead? No, I'm not cheating. Cause that would be cheating. I was you only taking eating. one or two steps ahead. That's I'm not rules. cheating. I 
find myself in a pickle. It's quite the pickle. Yeah, it's not a tasty one either. No. I don't like pickles. It's my only move. If I go here. Dude, what's going on? Hmm? What? You would. I'm gonna fall back with the bishop. Naturally, of course. It's your uncle. Yeah, I know it's my uncle, but why are they playing I'm the game of chess? Mm. Oh. Hell, I can't just sit here and watch this damn game. Go? Don't fall asleep. Where's he gonna go? <laughs> what the hell was that, Morton? <laughs> you haven't stopped breathing again? What the fuck? Let's see if I can check my telegrams. Wait, is that even Mort making that noise? Who's making that noise? Get <laughs> me. Good lord. Go in a bush and shit or something. <laughs> Oh, what the hell did you if, do? Oh, I see. If you're getting ready to take a sip, yeah, yeah, yeah. you better hope not. <laughs> I already am hoping. I'm hoping that. Why? As long as it ain't on a paint. Mort, get it out of your mouth. Is it a rat again? Uh, thank you. What the hell is that to Did we go down the wrong pipe? Yeah. Okay. You make your move, Warden. Oh, yes, I'm wide. thinking. Are we sure it's not a crocodile? Why did Don't you, you see how many pieces are on the board? Don't you see how many moves I have? Holy shit, there's like 42! Yeah. See, I don't know much about chess. I mean, I can move that pawn up, 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 I can move that horse to the left, I can move that horse to the right. I thought we weren't allowed to think like 25 steps ahead here. That's not ahead, this is the current move. Okay. What are you, an idiot? I can move the king left, I can move the king right. I could make the king smooch the queen right next to each other. You could do that, that's right. Platonic relationships only! You could also, you can move the rook one over. You can move your rook to 8H. You would like that, wouldn't you? Well, I don't rook? know how I would feel about that. What's a rook? The right, rook's the castle. By yourself, huh? Then why don't you just call it a castle? Well, you can move the castle to H8. That's right, go to the fucking... You're going over everyone else, all right? Go to the tables. How about that, Lawrence? If you're so confident, move that castle to H8. I dare you. How about a test... Your greed. I have no idea what the fuck is going on. Jesus Christ. How about you uh, move a pawn, Lawrence? And we'll test my greed real quick. Can't do that, unfortunately. You see, the battlefield is strewn with hunter's traps, and once one of those pawns move, unfortunately, he could uncover one of those hunter's traps, and then BAM! His leg's gone. How's he gonna walk forward anymore? On one leg. That would be hopping, not walking. Well. I suppose. You said you want to test my greed. And I'm a greedy man, Lawrence. 
Very greedy. Bet you are, you fuck. Wait a second. What? What? He's got to have some ulterior motive. He can't even... What? Excuse me? So I... I take this. He takes this? What a genius place, sir. Good job. <laughs> huh. Man, imagine how much of a ballsy motherfucker I'd be if I just take his horse right now. You know what? I don't give a fuck, man. I gotta play like Jabass anyway. <laughs> fuck it. Wait. Hold up. If I do this, what happens at that point? I do this, he can move this here? Ooh. Interesting. This is very interesting. I'm taking the rook. And we'll see how he responds. Fuck it. Because even if, even if I can get the bishop out. Oh! Take the bishop. Do it. Take the bishop, Lawrence. Take the bishop. Take the bishop, Lawrence. What you gonna do, Lawrence? Oh, fuck. Know what you could do, Lawrence? You know, I see it right now. Know what you could do? <laughs> Lawrence. <laughs> He's not responding to me. Oh, my team. My team speed crashed. I've been shit talking this guy this entire time, bro. Howdy, Lawrence. With expert analysis of the current board state, how likely am I to win? There's one answer. In. Good In answer, Lord. Big L. How you play Shut chess? up! Who said that? 
Josie. Which one of you? I know there's Me. like four to two nephews back there. Which one of you said it? Josie. Uh, the dog. Damn it, Josie. Give her the hot box after the game. <laughs> I'm accidentally moved. I was trying to see. That's fine. I'll deal with it. No way that could fuck me up. Look at trying to escape. <laughs> the I'm messing. I'm messing. It was me, Big Al. Don't, don't get it with Josie. Don't get it with Josie. It was me. I'll take the hot box. Yes, I'm you will. Aiming, firing. All right. You gonna move, Lawrence? You know you Says could. Says the man who took twenty-four million years to make his last move. Well, it was actually you making the move. You know you could move that that queen. You could move it to to D four. And what? Have your little puny piece of shit pawn take him? Nope. No. A queen I, is not fit to be laid by a pawn. A pawn wouldn't take it there. What do you mean? If I went forward... Oh, wait. Hold on. I did that wrong. <laughs> well, uh, no. If I went to D4, the same situation happens. It's still a pawn. It ain't a pawn. <laughs> wait, it's a horse and a pawn. Two things. The horse can't do shit. What do you mean? It's an L. It's not a big enough L, Lawrence. One to the left, two down. Yes, I wouldn't be able to capture your queen if you moved there. Yeah, he does his bishop, sir. <laughs> hey! Hey, Doyle! I see my error. It's fucking cheating. <laughs> what happened from the outside's cheating? And you said that would be executed. Yep. Mm -hmm. Execution. Who said it? It was Doyle. It was Doyle. Doyle. Your Doyle. guard. You're executed. Death right, tub, dog. Damn it. Good riddance. Uh, can I double check? Give me the rifle. Rest in piff, you won't be me a All right, let me fucking concentrate. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Silence! <laughs> and like Jesus, after three minutes, he was revived. I get some intense music on. Hold up. No way. My queen's feeling lonely. No way. <laughs> Look at that little one. Got the bigger one. That means I win, right? <laughs> that that ain't what that means. I feel like somebody should have explained the rules before I started. Uh, you you, you got to capture my king. That's what you you said the rules. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Liar! Take him to the hot box. So uh, all right. To finish the game. Oh, your your own guard just said I had to finish the game. It's not done yet. You have to get the king. Oh well, whatever he says goes. But it, it, it'd be a little. Miguel, you're not a quitter, are you? In the middle of the game. I mean, quiet. Yeah. Every single one of you.
Oh, that was a fuck up. I finally met a fuck up with a fuck up. No shot. <laughs> I'm going to do a bait here. to a corner who could have seen this coming <laughs> I've got a crazy game plan here I've got a crazy move I'm gonna try to pull off uh okay that <laughs> that was not what I expected. Is that one intentional or? Uh... <laughs> Everything's intentional, dumbass. <laughs> yes, sir. I just need to close it. I really hope he's throwing to go it's two out of three and then he just smokes us in the next game and it goes one one <laughs> listen you son of a bitch, you stay away from me and my little horse, you understand? Yeah, I understand. I don't want you to speak to me or my horse ever again. Okay. I won't speak to it. This is killing me? Yeah, I mean, I'm not good at chess, Mac. I'm I mean, by you. the board state, it looks like you've just almost about won. How can you fuck it up? Let's find out. <laughs> Mac, you should have seen some of the other games, man. If you think this is bad, you should have seen some of the earlier games. Wait a second. If I go here, puts him in a check. If I go here, shit. <sighs> if 
I go here, it puts him into check. If I check him here, he'll have to move here. Or here. Won't be able to move here, he won't be able to move. Guess he could have moved here, technically. Hey, uh, sir up there. His horse. Excuse me. Be able to take here. Shh. Which would be the risk. Or there. Or there. We're there, technically. So if I move here, it forces him to move back. If I'm able to move there, <laughs> if he moves here, that's checkmate. <laughs> okay. Fuck it. Check. It's all over here. He can he can he can get out of this easily. Unfortunately. It, it depends on where he moves the king. Now he can cap this. Oh. We cap this. Hold on. We cap this. I send the queen here. That's checkmate. You've been able to capture my pawn for the longest time, Lawrence, and you just ain't done it. You know that? Yes, I know. It's because I don't believe the horse you know. is trying to protect his master. I don't believe you know it, Lawrence. I see it. I've seen it. I don't. I don't care think about you it. have it's seen it. It's a pawn. It. It's standing there. It has no arms. What's it gonna do? It is just standing there. I don't believe you've seen that this entire time, and that's what's gonna get me to win. Is that single pawn, Lawrence? Doubtful. That single pawn has no arms. We've keep, it, we keep it can still this. kill without arms, Lawrence. What's it gonna do? Headbutt me? That's right. It is gonna headbutt you, you fool. I'm gonna laugh at it. Do it. <laughs> yeah, good job. <laughs> that pawn's right, gonna look. lose this entire game for you. You know it, Lawrence. True. But we always know how deals in Sissica go, don't we? <laughs> well, that's how it goes, and take that pawn. Fine. Checkmate. I've won. Oh, fib. <laughs> Fantastic. Take him to the hot box. <laughs> oh, wait. What? What the hell? Oh, hell. Oh, come on, Big L. Don't be a sore loser like that. 
<laughs> Stand back, everyone! At least it ain't solitary. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Unvomit on him. All right, I don't want to catch go. a bullet. Are you sure? Say yeah, boy, boy. <laughs> I just don't like that abomination touching my uncle. <laughs> Welcome back, Sad. <laughs> did, did you win? I won. Yes, you did. <laughs> what does that mean? This means at the end of the day we win. More Tommy, come on! <laughs> Dead. I mean, let's be honest though. The best part is I can tell everybody I beat you. Yes, you can. And you can also tell them that I beat you on the daily. <laughs> I don't even gotta work anymore. I don't gotta pick potatoes anymore. Oh, yes, you do. I, I didn't uh, specify. This hot box is only for the evening. You're out of solitary for good. Don't worry. The deal is squashed. You won fair and square. However, you step in it sort of out of line and you'll be back in there. Forever? Forever. Forever! Hog. Oh, my God! Forever. Oh, Don't say I'm not a benevolent warden. <laughs> What the fuck you laughing about? <laughs> I'm just doing this for the theatrics so I can watch all of them cry when I walk back in there. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be a model inmate here, you understand? A model prisoner for all of these people so that they can understand what it is to fall in line and be orderly. <laughs> oh yes, I'm gonna use you. Just like I always have. Always a plan, Jonathan. You know, every deal with you's always got a bad side to it. Who the fuck's this guy? Always does. Well, I'm making sure my uncle is fine. Yeah, and also remember Get he's going to the hot box the too. And yeah, he's yeah. also going to the hot box. No, yeah. I thought he was coming to the oh, party. Oh, wants to join him, does he? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. This Come looks on. like a sticky situation. <laughs> Let's go. I put a finger in between your neck and the rope. It's a tip so you don't strangulate. Oh, I think you. Guard, Enrique, make sure that group of prisoners coming over the bridge isn't going to start a thing. Point your guns at them. Make them stand there and wait. I can't wait to intentionally ruin it all. When Big L does something Today, to Aurora. Gentlemen, we have not but one, but two future model inmates of Sissa Component Penitentiary. Because after today, if it's not model behavior, it gets <laughs> worse than it ever was.
told to drag you to hot box. I'm doing that. It's really necessary. <laughs> Javaz is gonna be like, "Don't you ever Just hurt Josie? Sure. I care about Josie. Me? I I'm care about go. Josie. Yeah. I really do, Kappa. I really care about Josie." Please, whatever you do, Midnight. do not do anything Midnight. to Josie. I'm asking you a question. Josephine Adders is to be protected at all times, Mr. Lawrence. Good heavens, has he passed out? <laughs> Inmate? Howdy. Howdy? You doing all right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, what's the problem? You are... I'm, I'm all right. I just, uh... Oh? It's... It's not <laughs> the most comfortable position to be in. Oh, I don't know. Uh, I was asking if you'd been in one of these before. I have. Which one's your favorite? Uh, the one all the way, uh, I think if you're looking at them, it's all the way on the right. This one over here? Looks about right. All right. <laughs> Wait, has your little nephew boy lost his goddamn mind? <laughs> Jesus Christ. He just asked me. Hey, you don't believe this car, do you? You understand? He just said to me, he said, what are you, vengeance? What <laughs> fucking kind of a silly bullshit is that? <laughs> Man, who goes around saying some stupid shit like that? <laughs> hey, what are you? He's... Oh. Hey. Map. Got him. Guys, you carry me inside, not this guy right here. I'm oh, still gonna be guys. bullheaded as fuck, I think. Boy, he's all yours. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. Ah, get away from me! Ah. Oh, Moist, me Moist, breathe it in. Ah. He reminds me of a fish. Enjoy. This man smells like shit. He's about to leave you a present in there, too. <laughs> uh. Don't unwrap it. <laughs> More tie it. Out. He's wriggling. Can't do that. That's not allowed. Mort's tired. Get in there. Ah! I can't believe I won that. <laughs> yeah, that Doors locked. All right. Good. Now, I want two guards to stay here. I want two guards to go apprehend Aurora and put her in solitaire for the evening. All right, let's go. I'll handle Aurora. <laughs> you, you like yours. Aurora, solitary time. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I figured now we pick up sticks. Oh, we should have made them pick up the sticks. Oh, yeah. Well, it's too late now. Why am I here in the first place? I forgot. For fun. For fun. Would you like me to spit in your face for fun? <laughs> Would you like me to shoot you for fun? <laughs> oh, probably not. <laughs> what is this exchange? Hey, uncle. Yeah. You did it. You beat Big L like you said you would. That's right. Don't worry about Roy. She'll be okay. She's strong. She'll be fine. Hey, guards, if you're hearing me, I'm taking a piss. Good. Hey, J Bass, you fuck. Guess what? What? Now that you're stuck in there and I'm out here, wonder how, how we can get that box.
God, it is crazy to me how much your bass looks like Sam without the eye patch when I take it off. The shaved head. Nope. Just letting the RP happen. Does look like Jack. Yeah, with the shaved head and, and the worn down version of our hat, we do really look like Jack. Especially with the coat, too. But I want to use the coat more, man. I, I like these suspenders a lot, too. I, I want to make a, a more <laughs> worn down version of the outfit. I think I shot one in the ace. I kicked one in the fucking side because he, he flattened himself on the ground. And I heard his, his belly hit the floor. All right. Ready for the hot box? Yeah. Can I get out of here, please. <gasps> Fuck. Oh, let's see. You fucking starting a fire near my hot box? Yes. <laughs> what is wrong with you? <coughs> what? Try kill us? <laughs> nah. Me? Never. I've never killed anyone, ain't that right, J-Base? <coughs> yeah, fuck That's you, Will. Bring it in. It will help you think better. Come on, guard. I'll take on the smoke. Bring it this way. Not to my uncle. <laughs> Bring it that way? Okay, we can get another one. <laughs> <laughs> if you insist. <laughs> oh, give me the one that he has right now. Get up. Oh, I thought you meant you want another one. Yeah, it's You're the one that's starting fire next to grass, okay? What happens if the whole entire Cisco's on fire? Because of you. Cisco's uh, made of stone. I see a lot of green around me right now. Yeah, it's green. If it was yeah. dry, there'd be a problem there. Just saying the grass is wet and we'll catch on fire. <laughs> that you didn't just <laughs> I cannot find sticks. Where are you find You know how to Did he just sticks? say the grass is wet so it'll catch on fire? Uh, blackberries. I can help. Holy shit. Find out where I put my pan. I've got a bunch of nice sliced potatoes.
Hey, beautiful day. Hey, Gore, what's your name? Josh. <coughs> it's a dumb name, if you ask me, Josh. It is a dumb name. His, His name, name ain't Josh. Josh. His name's Doyle. That's a much better name, son. <laughs> son. Play the uh, what is it called? Warships? No, I never played warships. Ever play the game where you act like a decent human being? I would like that one. <laughs> All right. Let's see. If your hot box, you know, if your hot box was like a chessboard. Let's see. I'm gonna guess that you're someone near. Uh, Good news. We found more six. sticks for a fire. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's way better than the game I was able to play. What game are you about to play? What are you gonna do? I was gonna just like uh, think about it. He's like uh, his whole thing was like a chessboard. Mm -hmm. I was gonna like shoot holes through it. Oh, guessing like do, where he was. What we could do is play uh, tic tac toe with a rifle and a pistol. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And I thought I was bad. Watch. Now, I thought I was some sort of monster that crosses made. Boy, oh boy, was I wrong. No, 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 no. The real bad monsters get a paycheck. <laughs> That's right. That's right. They sure do. I also wear a lot of blue. That's white. right. Don't forget the That's white. Right. And look damn good. And the black. And we all wear matching hats, except for a few of us. All right, we get it. You gotta earn a unique hat. Okay, you're right. Or steal it. Or both, you know. Well, it's not really stealing, but, you know, they leave it. Come on, is hot box really yeah. necessary? Come on, <laughs> we can have more fun with us outside the box. Right. <laughs> I mean, we could. We could, exactly. I don't think you would like it, though. Man, you're on charge. Why are you listening to Big L? You see, this is a luxury. You know, there was another inmate that said things like this to me. And you know what? I believed him. All right. I thought, you know... My job is to watch after these people, like, you know, make sure they reform. Maybe I could, maybe I could bond with an inmate. Maybe we could become friends. <laughs> sure can. I sure, sure can, sure can. And then once upon a time. Ooh, my fire's hot. Oh, jeez. Uh, another inmate walks up, finds me and my inmate friend. We're talking, we're being civil, right? Then fortunately, that other inmate that walks up is an evil little woman and has to be murdered. <gasps> right? Has to be put down. Damn. She's sick. Uh -huh. She's rabid. Right? And then that inmate tries to convince you that it's a real bad thing and you gotta hide the body. Right? Well, then at the first chance that he gets, that inmate fucks you. Wait, that was job. you? That was you that killed by somebody in Cisco? <laughs> That's right, motherfucker, and I'll do it again. That was you! <laughs> motherfucker, she came at me with a knife! Man, they were trying to put that shit on me when I got there. That's a nice story. It is actually. I got I, I got the merit taken away from me. It was really bad. That's sad. <laughs> I mean, Man. you would expect, right? I'll be honest. Oh, I can barely breathe. Okay. Can you just okay. Like, the wood has holes in it. Without the fire or something. It's dark out. You know, there's a bucket underneath. You may smell that. Yeah, you smell a bucket. There's Probably something fresh the in there. Don't be all right. I didn't refer to the gator, by the way. I would rather inhale fire smoke than shit. Okay, well, you're in a good place for now, man. <laughs> Actual question. Did anybody feel the, feel the gator? <laughs> that didn't. I sure didn't. No, I, I haven't even received it. Oh, boy. Uh, Big L's got it locked away. No. Oh, well. 
He releases it only when it's, uh, you know, a, a bit of a problem. I know. I tell you what's a problem. In fact, you're trying to hotbox this in here. At least the fire is not inside. We could have put it inside. I want it. You know, I'm thinking about it still. Contemplating it. At that point, it would be... At that point, it would be an execution. It's already right? there. Be like a... Yeah, kind of... Bit roast them. Ooh. I like that a day. <laughs> you know, Mort has <laughs> probably liked it. people before? Mort has. Mort's flat out eating the prisoner. Really? Okay. Yeah, well, that's yeah, good for him. Wait, eating? Is he still eating it? No, no, no. He, like, he is, he, he's eaten. Like, Ian. Like, he, he's, he's devoured he's the entire eaten. thing. Okay. The past yeah, yeah. In, in past. Past tense. Already done. Yeah, yeah. Bones. yeah. Is that the abomination's name? Morty? It's Mort. You have to get it right. It's Mort. Short Mort. for Mortigan. Mort, yeah, think of like Mort and then Mort. This one's quiet. Are you dead in there? No, I think Sean to no, breathe. he's smart. He's trying okay. to conserve his strength in here. Oh, he's got his face in the gap here. It's somebody else. Yeah, he's getting ready yeah, for that big day tomorrow. <laughs> I mean, that tomorrow. big day tomorrow. Big L's got plans for you. How many times has this fellow been in Sissica for a long time? To be fair, he used to be an easy find. He was locked in solitary the entire time. <laughs> Uh, now he gets the idea too. You're smart. Not by choice. The um, I'm not smart. I adapt. Oh, survivalist. <laughs> then adapt by being smart. One can say so. All right. Does it bother you when I do this? <laughs> it bothers me that you exist. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What the fuck? Your face as long as you're looking now. Dang it. Oh, shit. No, I tried. Did you and me see the way I beat the shit out of that Rudy and me? Uh, yeah, yeah, I did. Yeah, I don't think it, my nephew was awake yet. Oh, oh man, I'm I beat the it. shit out of him. He hit my Rudy guy. like eight times over the head with a rifle. Sounds like Booker. She met one of my best friends. Yeah, where's Booker been actually? I missed her. I missed my mother. Oh, a little bit. taking a vacation, said. right? Yeah, she's on vacation. That's what I thought. No one around. I think she's over in sunny Guarma for a vacation. I was just going to ask her, yeah. Here's the nice time of year. Y'all should have Guarma sometime. Who says we have it? You should. Maybe I have. Um, I did not enjoy. Seven days or so. I got enough up. island here. Thank you very much. We got the um, floating bar. Does it bother you when I do this? Not really. No. The smoke Dang. bothers me. Here, grab one of these sticks and poke him with it. No, oh, I ain't, come on, that, really? I ain't gonna poke him. Man, that's a fat <laughs> stick, actually. That, that is a really big fit. stick. Come on now, come on now. I ain't now. gonna fit through the gap. You, you gotta give me a smaller stick than that. Well, I just gotta find a big gap, I guess. There was a big gap enough for that log, we can slip out. How many potatoes you got? It's so many. I took, uh... That Aurora pre inmates potatoes, and I took uh, J Bass's potatoes. They had a bunch. Yeah, somewhere right now, I'm gonna eat them. So I'm cutting them all into slices because I'm bored. Plus, more will cook them probably. Right. Uh, come, come on now, don't go out poke with that stick. Come on now. No, no, I shot a light in your face. That too. You don't like it, right? Like oh, is, is there a, is there a way out of this hot box? 
Death. Death or Big okay. Al feeling sorry for you. Come on, y'all. Y'all listen to Big L every single time? He's not looking right yes. now. Yes, George. We do listen to Big L every single time. It's not like he's our boss or anything. It signs our paychecks. I don't know. We can make it fun. I'll send out hot box. We can do things that are just unlimited versus pass that we have to give up. No, no idea. Not really. The smoke is getting to him, so it's working. Absolutely. It's almost like morning. I'm being slowly cooked alive. You are. You are. That's the whole point of this. He did, I think. The Our sun is coming really, really slowly, though. It is going really slow. You know, it's just like... Come on now. All right, yeah, we did just one day. Oh, finish up! Another for sunrise. Actually, you ever been confused about oh, man, um, they say uh, leaving on a night, leaving on a day, and you think, wait, patient. is it a whole day or a night? Like, like the day part, I, and then the I, night do get, I do get confused on that sometimes. Yeah. I don't wanna, I, I'm going to go back to the main prison and then, and then figure it out. Yeah. Right. Back. Yeah, if you figure it out, come back or don't, and we'll just open it in the daytime. <sighs> What's your, no, you, no, we were, like, weren't we supposed to stay in here for the entirety of the, the evening? Ain't, ain't it over? Ain't the evening over? Ain't it nighttime now? <laughs> Uh, don't worry, we'll figure it out and then come back. Oh, you good? Okay. <laughs> Son of a bitch. All right, we'll figure it out. It is until daytime. It's finally over. Till sunrise. Not yet. It ain't sunrise yet. Hey, the fire went out. What the fuck? No, he he picked it up. He, he got rid of it. Oh. Do we get rid of the other one or keep it? Mm, well, he went with that one for a while while the other one had it. Oh, no. Whoa. What was that? Oh, my God. Oh, oh fuck. Shoot the... Jesus Christ. Somebody shoot the gun right now. What the hell is going on? Oh, fuck. Hey, I think we're getting shot at. We're getting shot at. It's okay. What the fuck? Please stop. Oh, my God. Oh, what the hell is going on? They're I'm seeing bullets fly.
Jesus Christ. I won't give the prisoners to you. Good try. Oh, God. Get from my hands now. Oh, thank God we had to kill the, that violent upbringing. There you go. Dear Jesus. Jesus Christ. He got shot at. That's the second time we had to shoot those people. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. I think you would be nice. Get out of here, yeah. Yeah, should we, turn the yeah the should we turn the fire off of that one? Yo, what up, Bert? Thank you. Dude, Bert, thank you for showing up. Break the fire, uh, man. Just take the fire. Right, come over here, guy. Come over here, guy. Damn. God. Are you over here? Yes. Oh, Ed's here. Get back inside! Oh. He, no, he figured it out. He, <laughs> he figured it out. <laughs> they just were open the entire They were time open time. five oh. minutes ago, idiots. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one, guys. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, what did you say? What? Wait, what, 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 what did you say? Someone's oh, like fools. Ed's here. Ed? Yeah. My cousin? She was asking for you. Oh, Ed! The little worm. Did you enjoy your time in the hot box? That was fun. Yeah, it was amazing. We protected them from invaders. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. I love my time in the hot box. I've learned so much self discipline. Good. It worked. Another successful. Uh, oh, I don't know. My mind's gone. That's all right, it happens. I've been working on this job for too long. Have you I'm thought about retirement? Alcatraz. What? Have you thought about retirement? No. I will hmm. work the day I die. I can respect probably, that. Probably even after. Probably after, that's right. We'll have you in a casket protecting it. Well, somebody leaving on a boat. Might be Ed. Bye, Ed. Oh, that's depressing. Is it? I don't know, maybe. Oh, there were two prisoners that did get picked up. Uh, one of them was Stalio, and the other one was... Uh, hey. They're going to be feeling? taking inmates out of prison, by the way, soon. Wait, what was that? Sorry, more time. So they're gonna be taking inmates out of prison soon. You wanna make a room for it? It's a possibility. I said we get killed. Are you sure it's the right move? Not for me. But I think it's the right move for some. I'll be out in a few months, so um, gotta just keep it together for the time being, right? Can't leave these scumbags win. That's what they want. They want you to run. They want you to be scared. How you feeling? Hanging in. Yeah, I hope.
hope Aurora is okay though. Oh, we're both out, so she should be in. I hear what Big L said? What? Going solitary for the evening, just like us. Going to Hotbox for the evening. Hopefully, it's only for one night, but you know how it is. Gwen, or guard Gwen, Miss Gwen. Mm -hmm. We were supposed to be in the hot box for an evening, while Aurora yes. was in solitary for the evening. So yes. she's released as well. Yes. You know that's the thing about chess. You're supposed to think five steps ahead. Inmates. You're obviously not very good. Get the fuck back upstairs. What the hell are you doing down here? It's coming with you. Well, you don't need to come with me. Okay. She left the prison. Oh, you got forgotten about. Howdy. We tried, we tried to approach them, fella, but they, it, it, it was it was hard to get there. Were they were they trying to roast ya? Yeah. That's tough. What was all that sorting about, anyways? They were shooting at us. Oh, I, we thought the guards turned on each other. Did Did you see where James went? Nope. You don't always get to control everything, Big L. You're death included. As I've told you, little boyfriend, I greet death as an old friend. Hope you get to see him again sooner rather than later. What the fuck did he do to his uniform? You're gonna miss me when I'm wearing? gone. And why is that? Just wait until yeah, Booker's warden. Then you'll see. <laughs> Years of training. <laughs> you think she'll be worse? They'll be begging to dig me up. Unlock the cell. It's morning. This part of the game is over. However, I have a little sugar to add on. You're gonna have these back with good behavior, inmate. Inmates of mine. Yes. Oh, hey there, uh, boss. I had a little cherry on top of our sweet little deal. But that cherry is out of its cage now. However, I like a little sugar on top of my cherries. Your stay's extended. 
undetermined. Enjoy your free time, inmates. You know what that means? Do you, do you know what that means? You're stuck with me. <laughs> Forever. <laughs> hey. Do that? You two okay? Yeah. Can he do that? Do what? They extended his stay indefinitely. <laughs> what? No, they can't do that. Can they do that? They can do that, right? What's going on? That's not right. They can't do that, right? He can't. What? He said he's for an undetermined amount of time. Who are we talking about? Aurora, who are we talking about? Big L. Extended Jabasa's stay indefinitely. Why? Because he won. We well, said for an undetermined amount. Indefinitely. Is it undetermined? Right. Um. Uh. We'll. We'll send telegrams, multiple telegrams a day, uh, just to don't the law. Don't worry about it. I uh, will. I'll be just fine. play his game. Just play his game. It's, he I'll thinks it's all a game. He wants us to do something dumb to get him put back in solitary. Yep. The hell? I'll be fine. All right, you see this inmate? Huh? Yes. You motherfucker, see this inmate? I, I yeah. This is apparently a protected inmate. Okay. All right. If you fuck with this inmate, if you so much as fucking pass on the ground like this. We're gonna fuck you up. You can't. What the hell is this? As far as fish this nearby. Fiver. Oh, Fiver. You finally made it. I don't understand. How do y'all think this is okay? What, what do you not understand? Why do you sound so calm? Because. He's gotta play along. What's going on? How do you play along when you're winning the whole entire time? Because the big L of the game was not on the loop. He's not going to let you lose. Uh, sorry, he's not going to let you win. He's winning every single time. Okay. So you want to know something? He told me that? if I do anything, if I even slightly act out of line in any way, shape, or form, that I go back to solitary forever. So him extending my stay for an undetermined amount of time, he's hoping that I act up. Let's see. He's trying to get under my skin. He's hoping that one of us do something dumb. And then I go back to solitary forever. Well, I'm a pretty model prisoner, so I won't cause any trouble. But if you just stay calm and relaxed, it'll be fine. He didn't say extended indefinitely. If he said extended indefinitely, then I wouldn't be so calm. He said undetermined. 
Which makes me think he's trying to get somebody to do something. See, man games, okay. And I fucking hate Big L. An absolute parasite of this world, that's what he is. You won. Yeah, I did win. <laughs> I can't believe I won. <laughs> did it feel like he was playing? Yes. Howdy. That was a good deal. That was a nice game. I loved it. You see how I won? Yeah, he's an idiot. He fucking sucks. Uh, he's fuck terrible. fumbled the bag so many times. Did, didn't he sacrifice a queen for a fucking pawn? No, he sacrificed a queen for uh For a, for for a, a horse. horse. Yeah. That's right. Idiot. Absolute blunder. That was a lovely game of chess. I uh, love chess. Thank God I practiced. <laughs> I thought he was gonna put you back in the, the hole, actually. You say something? I didn't hear. You. No, I didn't say anything. Is this like the Jack Kettleman get up or something? That's what everybody says. It looks like that because yeah. I'm bald right now, especially. It's See. also the hat. <laughs> that is Jack shirt. Kettleman well, get up. You want, wait, no, 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 no. It's no, also no. the high pants. Hold, hold up, hold up, hold up. I can really do it for you, okay? How do you know what Jack looks like? By the way, I don't. I don't I'm just fella, a By the way, <laughs> now I got wore the that coat. I wore that. I wear that coat. There you go. That's a bit blue, one. isn't it? No, it's not blue. <laughs> this is the on. one we wear, James. No, I don't wear that one. What? It's fucking blue. It's got a blue. Uh, like, come look at this, Winsborn. It's got a blue tinge to it. Look at the sleeves. Oh yeah, just like a yeah, horse fucking hat is fucking red. This, it fuck, is this red. shit is fucking blue, that is, man. That's blue, ain't it? It's that's not blue. blue. It, it, I think it, you're colorblind. It, it, it's, it's navy blue with dirt on it. The dirt don't make it blue. It's, it's like the dirt it's is blue. It's literally blue. What are you talking um, about? It's like a fuchsia. A what? Now come look. Come it's, look at this. Oh, you talk, you talk about that. Is blue. C come over here. Tell me this shit ain't blue. Oh my god, that hat's so bright pink. It's fucking Th red. This blue, ain't it? Yeah, it's that's a blue. washed out black. What? It's no, blue. it's blue Rebecca. with dirt Thank on you. It's fucking blue. It's blue. It's washed out black. 100%. Your shirt is black. That jacket is blue. Yeah, yeah exactly. The third is black. The jacket is blue. I, I'm about to request solitary at this point. Holy shit. Can't handle the truth. Boo hoo, fella. That's the truth. Does anyone have a cigarette? I got like no, one rolled up cigarette. But I won't smoke it. Oh, you James, there was a part no you missed, by the way. Rudy. The they, extended, they extended my stay. Well, I'll stuff this sick way up your booty on, man. Thank I don't you. Want your what, sh what did they extend it to? Uh, yeah, what? Undetermined. Undetermined, which means it could be a second. Wait, wait. Did they give you... Did they give you any... Any... Any estimate? Nope. They gave so they're you holding you for time? however they want. However long. Yeah. Make that make sense. No, he's just trying to spark an arousal out of me, so I go back to solitary forever. That's why you find him in solitary. In. He was almost about to do the earlier. My nephew went to sleep then, I'm guessing? I'm assuming? Yeah. Yeah, yeah he, he went to bed. He already went to bed, alright. They, uh, they took someone who looked like Fiverr into Big L's office. I don't know what they're doing. Look at the gun finding out. Where the fuck is Fish? It was her? What's this? What? I told you it would look like fiber. You know what they're doing? Uh-uh. Last That's time I heard. about uh, her being protected or something. Huh? Protected from what? 
I don't know what came up at the ass end of it. You got this then? Uh, they don't protect anybody in here. The fuck is that? I'm guessing it's the plan of they're trying to make her snitch or some shit. Now they're gonna quote unquote protect her. They gonna make her snitch? Maybe. Make it look like she is. Or make it look like she is. Or she did. Well, that's our problem anyway. Yeah, it sounds like a mill's problem. Mm -hmm. And a forest problem. <laughs> and a forest problem, yep. Yeah, not, not that it is his problem, but he'll make it his problem. But yeah, and then it becomes our problem. I'm missing some context here. Alright, uh -oh. scumbags. Howdy, Doyle. That's us. Which one of you fucks is Everett Thompson? None of us. Me. What do you None want with us? Ever? What do you want with Everett? It's none of your business, you mates. I'm Everett Thompson. Alright, you come with me. Oh, wrong person. That's Let's Josie. Go. Oh! Don't you just score me? Fuck. I am! There you go. You know, pop open my stitches, it's gonna be real bloody. Okay. You wanna untie Jen? No, never mind. I don't think you're gonna do that. Yeah, never mind. Hold on. Oh, that works too, I guess. I'm starting to piece things together. They took Fiverr into the office and then they want Everett. Congrats, old fill me, Fill me in here, cause I'm, 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 I'm lost. You don't need to be filled in. Why is that? Why would you need to be filled in? Because there's nothing fucking to do here, motherfucker. All we got is fucking words and conversations. Well, and chess. What? And chess. Well, we do have chess. And poker. And that. Yeah, but they ain't Fishing? Fishing? They can't know that we play poker. Remy's mining? Remy's back in the moon. Yeah, he yeah. said they took Re my poncho. Remy, never Re Re Remy like is a true... Remy is a true member of Kelly Gang. Man knows what earning is. He, <laughs> he does not stop earning. Motherfucker got like... Out, had a poncho. They took his poncho and said, Fuck these people, I'm going back mining. Motherfucker, <laughs> he got like three different diamonds, motherfucker. What the fuck? And physical. Yeah. He's, he's, his dad reminds used to do me, the same. Reminds me of when... uh. Somebody help. What the when fuck? When I first went mining. Oh, what the fuck? What the <laughs> fuck? No. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Alright, inmates. <laughs> I repeat myself. Where oh, is Everett arms. Thompson? Oh. Don't know. I haven't seen him. Sleeping. Sleeping? He's asleep. Seen yeah. him since, I haven't seen him since the day he came in here. <laughs> Alright. So I had to say, don't Fuck with me, inmates. <laughs> I don't have a bag. Oh, these poor sockies. Back, back away. Old Box. man, come here. Yeah. See yeah, how his arm is. Back in. Y yeah. You want to pop it in for me? Sure. Right. Want to oh. untie him first? Yep. Feel like I can scratch my fucking shoulder blade. All right, I'm slowly getting these off. Oh fuck.
You gonna pop his arm back in? Yeah, I'm waiting for you to untie him. Yeah, I already did. Oh, you did? Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh. Are you ready? Oh, God. Are you ready? Yep. Yep. <clears throat> All right. Three, two, one, go. Oh, 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 oh fuck. <laughs> God damn. There we go. That's the sound you want to hear. Right. Oh, God damn. <gasps> Fucking hell. <laughs> oh. oh, fuck. Oh, oh you were right. better. Oh. Look at him just watching there you me. Go. Oh, fuck. At least it wasn't broken. Oh, I think it might be. Nah. I mean, they popped it back in the, in the place. Maybe, maybe. Yeah, maybe no, you're it was right. straight. Quick, uh, quick burn. Yeah, it's just gonna be very bruised. Ooh. I don't think that's a bruised motherfucker. It looks like a bruise. They, they, they do say Sissica got the best doctors, but I feel like that's a lie. Mm. When's more is it than no? Definitely I'm a lie. definitely not a doctor. What the fuck? Oh. All right, inmates. Line up. <laughs> but where? In a row. In front of you. We're going to the fields. Oh. Follow the blind one who's good at chess. <laughs> what? Think it's gonna last? What? You being out? Probably not. But hopefully it'll be for at least a while. It is fiber. What was that? It was fiber. She's coming out here. Yeah, I know it was fiber. <laughs> yeah, I, I think everybody <laughs> knew it was fiber, old man. Oh, me and Kelly didn't. We were confused. <laughs> Kelly said it was Mills. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> Real quick before they uh, get over here, were you updated on the uh, the whole the Chinta's uh, send spies thing and then uh, yeah, Edgar? She knows. And then what? And the Edgar situation? Uh, old man told me. Okay. Fucking dirt, there's no- I probably picked all the potatoes y the other day. Ah, uh, they brought me back over here. Welcome back to the field, Fiber. We're gonna be here for another five hours. This is right. time we're looking for fucking potatoes. I'd run yeah, I can't find trivia. any. Howdy, Fiber. Oh, a potato. I can't fucking dig. Howdy. They didn't uh, keep me in. Uh -oh. You okay, Jim? Oh, God. Holy shit. All right. Inmates. Who's the loudest? All right, inmates. I said, who's the loudest? I'm old. <laughs> All right, uh. old man. Yes. You're the chosen one. Fuck. Warden? This one right here. Good. 
start. Where am, where am I starting, Big L? You leading the chant today? <laughs> oh, lovely. Make sure everybody's motivated. Let's go. Line up properly. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? I don't know. Maybe dig a line. Dig right me. Line up behind Human someone and dig. Specified. Or in front the of someone. Freaking line. You're supposed to line up. All right. Uh, we love to pick potatoes. Potatoes are really good. Repeat. Oh my God! Repeat. Repeat. Potatoes. Potatoes are really good. This yeah, is the sorriest <laughs> chant I have ever heard. Let's pick it up. Your bass is really good the at chess. The day is running out. Your bass is really good at chess. So let's go. Get motivated. We love chess. We, we love chess. We love chess. We love chess. Change the subject. Okay. Uh, potato. Board games, board games, board games. Uh, fucking board. Board. We don't like chess anymore. We, we, it sucks. we love board games. We love board, we love board games. games now. We love board games now. Oh my god. You guys suck at repeating me. What kind of board games? Medieval board uh, games, say it. Medieval board games we love. Medieval, board, medieval board, games board games we love. We love. Uh, the ones that bring us pain. The Dark Ages. The, one that brings us pain. the ones that bring us pain. Pestilence. Damn it, Rudy, get off the fucking. Motherfucker, can you quit complaining? No, get off it's my the, ass. The... And me. Do you think we don't see you not digging? Do you think you don't see. Uh, 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 my arm is in a. My fucking shirt. You have another arm, don't you? And how do you propose I dig with one arm? I don't know. Why don't you figure it out, though? I'll try. Okay. What's our potato quota? 30. 30, 30 potatoes. Oh. 30, 30 each? Yep. Yes. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Someone else want to take over? I'm shit at this. Okay, I'll do it. Yeah, there you go. I don't know what I was told. I don't, I don't know, know what, what I was told. I don't know what I was told. But apparently they told me to dig potatoes. But, but apparently they, they told us to dig us potatoes. 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 Everybody playing that stupid chess. Everyone, Everyone playing that stupid chess. 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 I couldn't give a rat's ass. I couldn't, I give couldn't a get a rat's ass. ass. They said we gotta pick 30 potatoes. They, they said we, we gotta pick 30, 30 potatoes. potatoes. I can even eat 30 potatoes. I can't even, I can't eat, 30 even eat 30 potatoes. This motherfucker in front of me. This, this motherfucker in front of me. He's complaining about getting too close. He's complaining about <laughs> getting, 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 getting too close. All I'm trying to do is suffer. All I'm trying, I'm trying to do is suffer. I can't even hear these motherfuckers. I can't, I can't even, even hear these motherfuckers. I'm starting to lose on words. <laughs> I'm starting to lose, lose words. words. That wasn't even a sentence. <laughs> that wasn't even a sentence. Repeat. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, I don't know the what the fuck is Mort. I don't <laughs> know what the fuck is Mort. <laughs> I think he's a potato with his legs. I think he's a potato, he's a potato, with, potato legs. with his legs. Are we digging potatoes for more? <laughs> Are we digging <laughs> potatoes, potatoes for more? Cause, uh, Cause I'm really hungry. Cause I'm really hungry. Cause I'm really hungry. Are you hungry? If I get another fucking worm. Really, it's my. If I get another face. worm. I'm about to lose my shit. I'm about to I'm lose, about my to shit. lose my shit. Who the fuck planted these potatoes? Who the fuck, Who the fuck planted, planted these potatoes? These potatoes? Cause this is fucking torture. Cause this, this is, is fucking torture. 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 Okay, do I have to keep doing this, motherfucker? Or just try and give it to someone else. Okay, I'ma pass it. Somebody grab it. I'm throwing it up in the air. Somebody catch it. All right, inmates, who the fuck is the chain leader? All volunteers, huh? Oh, 
Jesus. Well, we it's really fucking done cold it. as shit. It's fucking cold it's as shit. shit. Why are they making us dig in the night? Why, Why are they, they making, making us dig, dig in the night? night? That's true, These... blueberries probably are there. What the fuck is blueberry? What no, the fuck, fuck is blueberry? blueberry. I kind of want to fuck around and find out. No, I no. Kinda wanna I kind of want to fuck around and find out. If you ain't going to use it, put it down. No, seriously, what the right. fuck is blueberry? It's all right. Seriously, what so the, what fuck, the is fuck is blueberry? Is blueberry? Just stay behind Can me, I all right? Can I fucking eat it? Can I fucking eat it? All right. Yeah, I don't think I eating you is going to solve anything. No, it won't eat me. How do you know? I get this one I've dealt with it before. I guess there's one way to yeah, find out. God, me and Kelly carrying this. Motherfucker, everybody just lost faith. They're not motivated. He's an alligator because he has a short snout. He's an alligator because he has a short snout. Because he has a short snout. He's, he's, short snout. Because he has a short snout. he's fucking changed the whole Crocodiles are better than alligators. I'm just gonna knock the fuck out of Josie and then I'm gonna run. Because I have a large snout. Because they have a lot of snow. You see a reptile, don't freak out. You see a reptile, don't, a freak reptile out. don't freak out. Just throw five at them and let her pout. Just throw five at them and let her pout. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. No it's getting fucking real potato. fucking dark out here. They say we gotta move to a new line. Alright, we gotta move to a new line. 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 One to the right, get moving. This next time probably got no potatoes. I wish we could pick grapes and make some wine. Oh, weird. Alright, come oh, on, get moving. One to the right, one to the right. Found a potato. Is that your first potato? No. And mates, I would like to remind you that uh, it is part of the rules that you must potato. yell potato each oh. time you <coughs> find a oh. potato. Okay. Oh, potato, 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 potato. Okay. Potato. Banana. You but you found a banana? Potato. Duh. Yes. Wow. How's that even possible? Potato. Oh, potato. 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 Banana seeds in here. That's how plants work. We were looking for for five hours. God, Jesus potato. 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 Oh my fucking god. Wait, are we Pebbles. Potatoes now. Potato. Rudy likes potatoes. Rudy likes potatoes. How he likes to eat them. He likes to eat them. Rudy likes to feed more potatoes. Really like Rudy likes to feed more potatoes. We feed the potatoes. Oh, I think that's Booker. I feed the potatoes. Yep, I feed the potatoes. I think so. Potato. When no one's looking, I feed the potatoes. I got good news, inmates. Yeah. Did you just oh, drop the piece I gave you? I don't have any space. Oh, it oh, it's like a bubble. Potato. Okay. Um. Call away. I don't have anything to replace it with. Potato. I'm just disappointed. I literally can't hold them. How many, how many potatoes do you have? What are you talking about? Fifteen. The one I can give you all my. This won't make a difference. Oh, oh, oh. Fucking, they might Fine. let you go back inside the walls. Fine, thing. No, fuck. fuck. Just stare straight ahead, sweetheart. Why? Just stare straight, straight ahead. Just trust me and stare. Ahead. Potato. What do you need? 
Actually, potatoes. Um. Luckily for you. Oh, you're about to run. Is it who it is? Oh, it's blueberry. Blueberry. All right. All right. What you the fuck is that thing? That's a blue fireball. We can start running in three. Run. Fucking run. Don't listen to him. Go, 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 go. Fuck you. That's fine. Oh, no! Not again! Not again! Get your salad, you son of a bitch! Go, go, go! Oh, Jesus! Help me! A car just murdered him! Not again. All right, it's okay. You shouldn't have done that. I don't let you die. I'll be alright. I'll be alright. I'll be alright. Let me go. I'll be alright. Don't make any sudden movements as you dragged by. She might bite you. One guard said run. No, it oh, we didn't hear the warning. Get back Everyone in the field. Every single person said don't run, except all you. No, that's not oh, true. You run, but in the field. Man. Say he was cute. Is it Gators too, too? Somebody will certainly fuck up. <laughs> Go. Potato, potato. Did you just pet that thing, big girl? Of course I did. You know? Is anybody able to pet it? Why don't you go ahead and try? Let's get digging. Potato. We have quota to meet. <laughs> the gator is here for your motivation, oh, you. your speed, Potato. your productivity. Uh, yeah, I don't like him so at all on me. I hope nobody has meat in their pockets. I got potatoes. And blueberry won't eye you at all. 
I can't dig. My arm is broken. And mate, what did I tell you earlier? You have another arm, so you. Yeah, I'm it. shuffling around the dirt, but potatoes aren't five if centimeters you've got deep, to are they? I'm right. trying my hardest. Use your teeth if you have to, inmate. Potato. Blue, blueberry. Yep, uh, blueberry. Stay away from that guard. All right, he's just taking a nap. I didn't like me. That is blue. You do not like blue. Stay away. Bad alligator. Oh no, Doyle's coming right for me. <laughs> oh no. He is coming right for me. I hate Jenkins. Booker, I'm gonna take this one to the infirmary. Control Blueberry. Free to move up, Rudy. He's right fucking there. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah. Get him back in line. Inmate! Remy, come back. He's coming for you quick. Remy! Remy! <laughs> Remy. <laughs> You're too fast, inmate. Stay with the group. Potato. All right. All right. All right. Take it easy. That's good. Good, Blueberry. Here. There's something about when it's the two of us. There's always gunshots, huh? Ain't that right, Doyle? There you go. Ah! Oh! There okay. Go. Shut the fuck up. Oh. Are we supposed to move forward or not? Yes, but there's a group. Well, nobody. Just be careful when you get close to him. He's enjoying his meal. Okay. <laughs> Slow. How'd the chess game go? One. Hey. No moving. Wow. Need to move. Does that mean we don't have to watch them playing chess anymore? That's right. Oh no, we're gonna be playing oh, chess all the time. Like me oh, and Big L, of course. I think Big L's retired after his one loss. God, Doyle, that's poker and chess. What is he gonna do now? Big L really sucks at you games. You know what? There are too many of you in the same line. Some of you spread out. What the hell are you doing? You're not all gonna uh, find potatoes in the same damn row. All right, yeah, inmate protected. I'll, I'll go this good, way. Good, you're in the other line. Fine. Good, good, good. Yes, sir. Potato. Oh, fuck. Would you all believe <laughs> that Blueberry is only a quarter of her? Full-grown size. Oh my god. Just oh a shit. baby. <laughs> what was uh, Booger's mother's marble. name? Bojangles. Something like that. Bojangles? Yeah. I think so. What's the matter, inmate? Come here, Blueberry. I don't know what I was told. <laughs> Get some scratches. I don't know what I was told. I invoked his name and found out. I invoked his name and found out. So don't what move. Don't look behind no you, Joseph. Don't look behind me or what? Don't look to the side of you. There we go. P Potato. We don't like these inmates, do we? They're criminal. That's right. <sighs> don't forget to breathe, inmate. <laughs> Wouldn't want to fall on the ground from a lack of breath. Don't look odd. Don't look fucking odd to me, Gary. Right? Blueberry, come on. One. This one. Well, Pope's in the back. Pick Not here, eh? Okay, yeah, it's two potato. Four, nine, something. Potato. What you say? Something. Oh, two, two four, seven. nine. What? Oh, two four nine. Oh, two seven. <laughs> I 
Are you sure? Sixty percent. That's not good enough. Yes, I'm sure. You don't. What'd you say? <laughs> say it louder. My name is two four oh two seven. Good job. And I love picking potatoes. Don't mind me, inmate. How'd you break your arm anyway? And again. <laughs> you fell off the wall? Yeah, you fell off the wall. Don't be so stupid and fall off the wall. Yeah, it's these socks, you know, they get muddy and slippery sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, My bad. Potato 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 every time potato. 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 To the edge of the field. Yeah, it was all my fault. The guard on my left, Doyle, didn't make a blunder or anything. Did me. you apologize to the, the to the guards for being Pro so stupid? Profusely. Come on, we're Good. Who's the order fuck said that? Don't you concern yourself with the health of the guards. Move. Sorry. Oh, well, a look at that, inmates. Nice. A beautiful rainbow in front of you. <laughs> Start of a new day and a new quota. What's our new quota? Keep digging. Yes, sir. Uh, How many potatoes do you have, here, mate? Twenty-one. Keep digging. <laughs> Potato. Put your name in Mac. What? Remington? Did I? I'm talking to you. Don't you move and don't you any, know any manner? How long have you been here? How many Potato. potatoes do you have? What's your Potato. prisoner number? Potato. Potato. So it's my fault you don't know your prisoner number. Oh. You've never met me before. What's your prisoner number? Nope. <laughs> Potato. What's your prisoner number? He doesn't know his prisoner number. Was I talking to you, inmate? I didn't think so. <laughs> Always a whack knock in the line. <laughs> Shut your mouth. Correct answer. Inmate is, I don't know, Miss Booker. Please tell me so I can remember for next time. I don't know, Miss Booker. Can you please tell me so I can remember next time? What is your first name? That's your first name. Potato. Your parents hated you. Inmate. Mm -hmm. Why'd your parents hate you? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Your prisoner number is 361348. I'm not going to Where's tell your you failed again. excuse He's for nephew? Five. My nephew went to sleep. Lazy! Potato. Potato. It's good to see you. It's good to see you too. Lots of inmates today. You mm -hmm. say good to see you to her, but not to me? What the fuck, bro? Doyle, you know it's always good to see you. Well, yeah. no, of course it is. It's implied. 
Um. Booker. Yeah. Yeah. Come here. I am very Potato. disappointed in all of you. I would have thought at least some of you would have 30 potatoes by now. Close. Yeah, well, how close is close? Maybe it's the lack of singing. You hear that? Mm. Her what? junior warden exam is next know. week. You really fucked that up, didn't you? <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Keep digging. Potato. I mean, you'll never be a warden anyway. <laughs> Potato. What's this? Two inmates falling asleep in the line? Dear God. Oh, shame. Oh. Warden, two of the inmates fell asleep in the line. What do we do? Wake them up. You know, I feel compelled. Compelled to what? Can you... Are you able to... Okay, you know what? I'm going to back up. Do you have a... Can you... I got the one. I got the one. Do you have one? I, yeah. I, do, I do. Potato. I'd hate the idiot. Okay, there we go. Mesh, it's fucking ranger. All right. Potato. Good job, inmates. Potato. Good progress on those potatoes. I'm proud of you. Potato. Damn, he, he definitely did something to the butt stuck up its gun. Potato. Potato. Good job, inmates. How many potatoes we got? Yo, blazing with the five bomb. <sighs> yeah, I miss it too, man. Doyle ruined it, bro. Back to work. Of course. Twenty three. Good. Twenty three. Twenty four. Potato. Then made. All right. Twenty three. Good. Up you go. Go catch up with the other inmates up there. Twenty five. Okay. Put yeah. down the shovel. Keep it up. Put nails in the back of your gun. Now I have a pair of lips carved. So I can kiss each one of these little bastards. Twenty-four. Tido. Twenty-four. 
You only have 19. Yes. 20. There's nothing wrong. Oof. Potato. I'm still I'm still blown away we even won that game, Jen. And then on top Potato. of that, I, I'm excited to go back to solitary. I fucking dug all the potatoes, bro. Yesterday's quota. Show me your potatoes. How many you got? Twenty-five. Potato. Got twenty-two. All right. Why don't you go join Miss Fiber down there at the end of the yard? Don't want to pause. No. Potato. Not even a pat on the head. <sighs> Yeah, but I'm not gonna play oh, Javas okay. often. I don't. I don't know why you guys are acting like it's that, that crazy. Wonderful. Go join. Potato. God damn it. Is it because I said I had more than you? All of a sudden, you have to get a bunch to beat me. Potato. <laughs> this isn't real. Potato. Potato. I should have uh, I should have told Kono. I should have given Kono an idea. You know what I really wanted him to do, even if he didn't commit to it. After I won this chess game, and P and like it, it calmed down and said, "Take me to solitary." He said, "All right, come with me," and he made me go up to the gallows, and he started fitting a noose around my neck. They said, you know, and he, he quoted Sam's original deal, which was solitary or execution. <laughs> Would have been so good. I should have told him that. Potato, I got 30. I should have given him that idea. Potato! How many potatoes you got? 27. Got 26. Potato! Potato! Potato. 
How many yet? Still 27. Potato. Once you have 30 alert to guards, and you will be escorted to the side of a potato field. <sighs> Join your freedom soon. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bet you miss the days of that darkness now, don't you? My arms are real sore. That's what hard work will do to you. Potato. How many? 30. To the edge of the field, let's go. How many for you? I am, let's see. At 30. Edge of the field, go. How many are we at in here? 28. 27, ma'am. Alright. Guards, let's bring all the prisoners what's done with quotas into the mess hall. Unload all the potatoes. Stop your crying. Put those fucking keys on the ground. Put your hands up. You too. What's in the snow? No. Oh. Throw the keys on the ground. Put your hands up. All right. Let's stand up. Put your hands up. You too. Mm -hmm. Whose hat is that? I don't know. It's over it's here. It's on my fucking hat, is it? I don't believe so. I think so. it is. I think it is. Here, I'll. It's all over here on the floor. Yeah. Put your hands up. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I had a bunch of, like, dirt and keys and shit. I threw them away. I kept the dice. Is that okay? Yeah, whatever. I also kept the worms for fishing. Wait a minute, wait a minute. That's a lot of money, you mate. It is, yeah. What do you got all this money for? Mm, this is my money. I don't know. Don't you use banks? I do. What would happen? Oh, it feels nice. What the fuck? I wouldn't take your money, inmate. Yeah, I didn't think so. I don't even know who did looks at your best. Is this everyone? Uh, I think there's some no. still in the field. Yeah, there's still one or two in the field. We got a slacker in the field. Yo, what up, Slappy? I found scissors, by the way. Okay. Yeah, I've had a bunch of those. Oh. It took me and Forrest <laughs> in five or five hours last time. 
<laughs> thrown away like four of them. Do I hear laughing? No, no, it was my stomach rumbling because of all the juicy potatoes I've dug up. You're not here to have fun, inmate. Say what? I'm you not. need scissors for them things. How's your face? It is as usual. Over whispering very loud. Pretty fucking money. Fuck. Got any for them pretty goddamn long? You're peace and quiet over here? Finally, thirty potatoes. <laughs> Inmates, if you have ammo on you, drop it right now. I don't got no ammo. Did I ask you to tell me you didn't have ammo? No, I said mm -hmm. if you have ammo, drop it. I didn't ask you to talk back. God damn. I'm always strapped up. All right. What's next, Warden? All prisoners to the courtyard. Lying against the wall. I think at some point they get tired. Good God, single file. Have some apples. There we go. All right, fix it back here. Come on. You two, stop kissing and let's go. Who no kissing? I, I think you were tied to James and Jody. Mm. I need a damn bandage. My head hurts. She walked me over the face with a gun. A gun? Mm -hmm. Man, you're lucky. I got smacked like five different times in the fucking head. They just slapped the bandage on. Literally slapped the bandage on my forehead. She asked me what my prison number was. I ain't never been fucking told. I said, I don't know. I ain't even never been told. She walked me over the fucking head. <laughs> The hell I think he's gonna do other than piss us off and make us wanna take our anger out on him. Yeah, no idea. Yeah, I know. It, it's so weird seeing Remy without a poncho, man. Cause then, alright, we can take our anger out on these people. They behind walls all damn time. Mm-hmm.
can't eat an apple. My arm is fucking. You have, you have you seen it? What do you think? I was not broken. I have another arm. I was gonna say, what the fuck? I forgot. He dislocated his shoulder and I popped it back in. That's why it's all fucked. Chelsea, can you can you tackle can you tackle James for me? Do you okay? Are you doing okay? Not yeah. being in solitary? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> well, I walk through you, then it's you, bro. Dude, isn't it kind of perfect we ended up getting out of solitary without the law? Like, I'm gonna rub it into the sheriffs so fucking hard, chat. Can we play trip down? Line it up, stand still. I need to eat. I'm so hungry. We have a special announcement for you inmates. Especially, uh, the wounded fucking bird over here. Because you did such a good job filling your quota last night, and because it's raining, so you can't fill your quota today, otherwise you might get hypothermia and die, or whatever the fuck the doctors keep saying. We're going to be doing an inside sport. Trivia. You inmates like sports? Yes. yes. Poker. Good. <laughs> Chess. Okay, so today you'll be sparring. Get marching to the barn. Hold on one moment. One of you, each one, one by one, line up. Hold your hand out to me. Ensure that you are healthy. It's hard to see James. That's a you oh, problem. <laughs> I'm getting the whole line of slash me holds that hand. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, come on, move, move the uh, move the line up here a little bit. All right. Okay, you don't need to stand that fucking close to me. Get away from me. What are you? What are you? You're standing right freaking next to me. Okay. They're good enough. Oh my! <laughs> get get the fuck away from hand. me. This one's got no chance with a broken arm. I know. <laughs> He's gonna get his ass kicked. I have and my so head in my teeth. In the back over there. Holding, holding their hand. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we'll put them up against each other. Oh my god! I think Shut that's up, perfect. To the goal. I can't believe we've been live for like five hours already. Man, you could find Booker. Yeah, you want to 
to fight me? I don't fight yes, fair. Me either. That's why I said I have my teeth. You have your teeth. Keep talking like that, you won't have them for long. You said prison rules. Prison rules. You want to start now? No. All right, okay, good. Line up. Let's go to the ball. Yeah, this line sucks. Come on. <laughs> Stop overtaking me. Oh, fuck away. You get out and get pussy, mate. Stop <laughs> laying on the ground, James. Tower 32 away from 1100 subs. Sub again happening overnight and 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 stuff like that too. Ain't your one's primary rulers. Ugh, wait for these morons to catch up. All right, let's go. Beans with the five bomb. 27 away now. I got bad news for chat. I started playing League of Legends again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I played a few games the night I stayed up to uh, fix my schedule. When I get really bored, I don't have another game. I was playing chess in League, bro. All right. I in we go. I didn't feel like installing Valorant again. You get your wish, you bass. I mean, are you kidding me? Rudy's here, so what, what's the point? I was I was hoping for trivia. Or chess. <laughs> you can ask for it, James. And Mike, did I ever tell you about when Jack was in here? No. Oh. <laughs> it was a shame. What a good time he we had. His, had. Yeah, he had amnesia, and we were we were trying to help him. We really were. I think we did help him. I think we did. But my favorite part, Doyle, was when he said, "Please, please, Booker, you're scaring me. You're hurting me. Don't do this. I'll be no. a good dog." When he no, looked at us and he said, no, "Why are you doing this?" and he was crying and bleeding. You know, what my favorite part is. Yeah. What? He got his memory back, so he probably forgot everything you did to him. I don't care. I remember. Oh. We'll have to refresh it for him me, when he comes not back. For him. It still happened. Yeah, he doesn't remember it, so did it really it happen? Doesn't matter. It still happened. Yeah, I mean, he, three, he doesn't remember three, it. Though, remember so it. the three of us remember, and that's the whole point of punishing headed. someone is to punish them. You don't get any enjoyment if he doesn't remember that it happened. Oh, we got no. no. He's got he's got we a point, got Booker. I think what he's saying is we need to do exactly what we did again. Just sure, go ahead. Again. Yeah, we can do that. When yeah. he first came in, we we comforted him and we told him everything was going to be okay. And then when the deputies they left, oh. well, when he was the look smiling at us, he was smiling <laughs> at us. He was he was looks like he was going to be in a safe place. He he took our hands. Oh my god, it was like stepping on a puppy. A really ugly puppy. Real fucking ugly one. All right. Fucking awesome. Let's get this uh, is out of the way. I think we should do a fair fight, shouldn't we? I thought we put um 
inmate pigeon fucker against um, the, the one that's pigeon. holding her head. That's what I was thinking. That's exactly what I was thinking. I'm so happy when we're on the same wavelength. It's you know, really it's great. So good. But what are, what are the rules? There's no rules. Okay. All right. Fiverr and uh, pigeon fucker, get in there. <sighs> Excuse me. Remember, Excuse you're me. learning proper techniques to protect yourself from other prisoners who might want to choke you to death. I'll give the winner of this fight some beans. <gasps> you hear that, prisoners? A reward. Prisoners, that's where you clap. Thank you, Miss Booker, for being so nice. Thank you, Miss Booker, for being so nice. You're welcome, inmate. <laughs> Disgusting. I still ain't 100% getting whopped over the damn head. All right, begin. Oh, that was a hard hit. Yeah, have a good night, Meow. She's laying down Fuck. like Alice. <laughs> Hope it was worth the beans. Here you go, inmate. Now, do we put him up against somebody else until he loses? How are yep. we doing this? All right, sure. Uh, inmate Rudy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, begin. Take it. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh. Oh, he's back up. Oh. What? <laughs> Get this weakling out. All right, let's move him. Grab him. You got him? I got him. I got him. Let's move him out of here. Put him in the fucking corner. Pathetic. All right, redhead one. Get in there. You want me to beat up my niece? <laughs> Begin. <laughs> I'm not doing it. By the way. Did he stutter, inmate? Come on. I said I'm not doing it. Did I stutter? No. <laughs> <laughs> I said. Start sparring. Fuck you. Do not make him ask again. Uh. Oh, no. <laughs> oh no!
You'll be lucky if you see him again. What happened? He didn't want to fight his niece, he says. Who's your uncle? All right, Poncho. Which one? Get in there. Begin. Come on, Remy, just hit her. Ugh, ugly scene out there. This is not good. I wanna see. No, it is not. Yeah, <laughs> I really I just expected. Remy to just start going full in, bro. Just like full murder. Very nice. Very nice. Job. Well, good thing we always fist fight each other. We owe you beans. Hmm. I just, I'm, I'm hoping I get to kick your ass for fun. <laughs> really think you can kick my ass? I, I mean, I already right. kicked your ass today. I let you get the first hit. I put my hands behind the I have a medical bag. bag. Yeah. All right, Red. Move out of there. Maybe. Sockhead. Yeah, I must have fallen between the cracks or something. And Flathead over here. Uh, oh. My flathead? Yep, sure yes, did. your flathead. Old man. And my sock uh, head. Yes, he made fun of your sock head earlier. Wow, well, I'm gonna lose this. <sighs> Come on, old man, you just gotta keep your hands up. It ain't that hard. Think, think this is punishment us fighting each other? You got this, old man. You can do this. Kick his ass, Josie. Oh, she's floundering. She's floundering. Oh, she's getting him now. Oh, oh he's getting a bank. Oh, Jesus. Nice hits, Josie. The old man don't know how to fight. Hey, what the fuck You're always against Josie. Uh, he really doesn't know how to fight. He has no clue how to fight. <laughs> oh, you hate to see it. We owe you beans. I got it. Put him down. Did he shoot the punch? <clears throat> right on there. Uh, I'm cursed. You're right. Oh. Why don't you pick it up? Okay. Hmm. There's, there's a lot of people standing up still. Yeah, there is, is, there is. I figure we'll wait for, uh, wait for the warden for this next one. Oh, that's very this good. next one's gonna be special. They both tingle with their head. <laughs> the thing on your hand. You want me to go get him, Doyle? I mean, it is, but not like. Hey, J Bass, you remember the last time we were in here? Yeah, I sure do. You want me to go get the warden for you? Uh, you know what? Nope, I will go look. I refuse to hit me.
I figure the uh, loser of this next one gets a free uh, pickaxe. What do you think? I couldn't do anything. Ooh, that'd be good. Everybody loves a free pickaxe. Yeah, who doesn't? You know, would would you guys be okay if I was able to jump off that? Me to fight. Don't see why not. I think it'd be I think it'd be, it'd be a special move. Can you feel that? All the excitement in the room? Bon the crowd just filled with electricity. <laughs> yeah. You know the what? Enthusiasm. The roar of the crowd. <laughs> you know what I'm going to call this? I'm going to jump what? off from here, Doyle. I'm going to call it the inmate's elbow. I just, I'll just land elbow first. I bet you could. Okay. No matter what they decide the loser gets, you fight fair. You don't throw. <laughs> Doesn't this just beat pig and potatoes? I think it's someone crying over there. Yeah, but they're gonna kill you if you lose. I'm throwing. They're not gonna kill me. Well, they're not gonna kill you when you lose. Yeah, they're gonna give solitary the hot box to lose. I'm gonna throw too. No, you're not. A lot of whining, though. A lot of whining, though. A lot of it. <sighs> All right. But so we make way so he can pass. Hi, right, welcome back, Warden. You just missed the, uh, I can take a night. the premier fight. But you almost did. Almost. Missed Let it. me almost. take a night. That's what it comes down to. Okay. All right, lovebirds. <sighs> Make it a good show, would you? These last ones have been sad. All right. When are you, uh, when are you ready to will? Well, I think I'll let the warden uh, choose the start of this one. What about choosing? When we start? Now. Yeah, that's right. Now. Oh, and he flung this. Oh. Look at this. Actual competitors. You see these inmates? Look at that. They're dodging. Oh. oh Battle of the Cyclopses. One. Whoever wins gets a whole cave of goats. Come on, sweetheart, you can do better than that. <laughs> you already got this one. Come on. He hasn't even done the thing yet. <laughs> yeah, I haven't even done the thing yet, Aurora. Yeah, one more. <laughs> oh, he's done the thing, he's done the no, thing. No. Uh, special move. Oh. Oh, I missed. Oh. oh, and he gets kicked. He gets punished. I risk, I reward. Kick him in the nuts again. Oh! Oh! oh. 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 I like that one. Now oh. do the move while she's down. Look at oh, that. yeah, do the move while she's down. Look, look at that. He's just... like a little clubhouse for the little pendejos. Look More at time. That. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, no we got a contender. Oh, ring. God. Do it. You okay? Are you talking to me? I'm talking to you. I thought I have another fight, unfortunately. What's going on? Do I have to do the culebra? Yes. I have to bite it. All right, begin. Get the hell out of the ring. Okay, 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 of course. Oh. Is this the boss himself? <laughs> the big boss in the ring. 
Howdy. The uncontested heavyweight. <laughs> I mean, uh, Doyle, get the fuck down here. Weight. Stop talking and take, <laughs> take, take something from me so I don't stab this fella before. Oh, shit. I'm gonna get out of right. Yeah, they were gonna take that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Should we get back to announcing or? Yes, go back to announcing. You're doing a great job. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right, inmates, I expect you to cheer for this. All right. So cheering, all right. The uncontested, you sure you want to fight? Perfectly weighted champion boxer of Sissica. The warden, Big L. This way, yeah! cheering, mate. Yeah! Woo! Warden! And the other corner, the one eyed fucking freak red, J Bez. Uh, I've got. Kick his ass. When do we start? They start. Now. It did. Oh. J base taking it on the chin. Oh. He's fighting back against the warden. Come on, Lawrence. Come on, Lawrence! Disrespectful using his name. Kick his ass, amigo. Kick his ass. He almost down. Come on, motherfucker. You got this, man. Fight. Come on, now. Come on. Again. Sit the whoa, fuck whoa, down! Whoa, 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 whoa! Alright, guards, ready! Ready! Aim. Yep! <laughs> He's underneath you, Doyle! Senor, your bus knows how to throw the... Throw the hands, amigo. Oh, shit! Oh, oh, yeah. oh no! Alright, rope him up. All right. We're gonna let him drop him. Yep, move him a little bit. There you go. Uh. <laughs> uh. Oh, just. Go to yeah. You got 15 minutes. Oh, he got. <laughs> oh, I'm right here the whole time. <laughs> I don't know if you heard me and made Oh, get eyes. up. <sighs> 15 minutes. Okay. <sighs> Inmates. All right, come on. I'm not sure if you heard me. Uh, but I said go to the yard. Doyle? Oh, what? Yard? Okay. Go to the yard. 15 Doyle. minutes. Doyle! Yep. Uh, come here. Doyle, this is this this is this is pretty bad. It's pretty bad. He's breathing all over up? the place. I thought Can it was supposed to be medical? a fight. That was supposed to be a fair fight. Put him in a box. Shut up, inmate. Was at least a good fight. Hey, 
was all right. All right, your favorite box. <laughs> All right. Get in there. I'm, I'm going. <clears throat> I hope you've got some water in there, inmate, because you're going to be in here a long time. Why? I don't understand it. He here? wanted a fist fight. I don't understand. It's not like I fucking attacked him. He wins. Fucking do this. All right, inmate. You just earned some time in the hole. Fucking cowards, every single one of you. Oh my god. Get pissed off when you fucking lose. Assuming this is locked, I'm just gonna assume it's supposed to be locked. Dude, what a what a good scene though, man. I can't believe Dude Big L was eager to fight because he lost chess, man. Oh my god. I'm so glad I got the execute. If you're close to a wall and they're one shot, it uh it it auto knocks them out. So like if I have a quarter of HP and I'm near a wall and I get hit, God, that would have been insane.
Something that tells me that if we ever tackle him off the leap of faith, he's 100% permering with me. That is going to be such an insane scene if we ever give him that skull. I'm I'm just saying, can you guys imagine we finally we finally uh, agree to the skull and just tackle him off the leap of faith? It would be such a good way. Especially if it was a double perma, that shit would be insane, chat. That shit would be absolutely insane. I don't know, Blazing. They might let me. I mean, I, I guess it depends when they figure out the Big L situation. Ken. What are you doing? What are you doing, crazy? Good idea. No, Yali. You said no.
Uh, we, we, uh, we basically knocked out Big L in a fight. I was gonna see if it like would let me like bounce off of the door if I tried to hit it. I don't. Whew, I feel like we're gonna be in for a minute. Hey, fuck face. Howdy. Doing that one? Yeah, I am. I'm coming in to get you. Uh, oh, <laughs> I'm out of here. You go back. You go back to General Assembly. All right. This is because they're a fucking lockdown because of you. You fuck. What do you mean because of me? No time for details. Let's go to fucking. You put get put back in General Assembly. You fucking girlfriends in solitary. Taking well, your fucking spot. Why can't I just go to solitary? Well, listen. Solitary is solitary. Just because we're in fucking lockdown does not mean that we break tradition. Good lord. Boy, we might be executing you in a few minutes. <laughs> what? You might have killed the warden. Why does that mean I get executed? I don't know. That's the only really. That's the only thing we can do, right? That's the only logical uh, no, progression. No, you could it's, uh, keep me in here longer. Well, it, maybe he wanted to fight. Listen, I don't make the rules. He does, and he's dying. Okay, so don't that mean since I killed him, I get to make the rules? No. That is how the to kill you, I guess. <laughs> no, no, hold up, hold up, no, no, no. <laughs> I spoke too soon. What the fuck do you mean you're gonna? What, what, do you, what, what do you mean you're gonna execute me? You're not fucking doing it. We were definitely not putting you in there now. You send him for a doctor's guard? Listen, if he dies, we might have to execute everyone in this building. So I won't <laughs> be smiling. What? You yeah, okay. okay. Uh-huh. I'm not freaking out, you're freaking out. You sound like you're panicking. Hey, you could be the junior warden if he dies. <laughs> now. Booker, Booker's got our exam on the in February. First man in the fucking crossing to kill a fucking warden. <laughs> what a legacy. Yeah, but what a legacy. Am I right? Yeah, now you're making me weird. I didn't throw the fight off to kill the warden. <laughs> They'll talk about Jabaz for years to come, even if he dies tonight. Question is, are they gonna let this shit slide? Oh Probably no, not. they won't, no, but. <laughs> God damn. They'll most likely execute me. Yeah, but think of the impact your name has. How the fuck would I care? Saying I'm they dead. Don't execute you, fella? Yeah, most likely. Why? The warden dies, then yeah. I know, the fucking warden. they asked for it. 
They don't care. If that's Sifika, they Sifika played the game fair. and I'm, he lost. They fucked well, remember, around and found out. Remember, remember, the chess game. He still won. They still put him in the hot box. There's no winning. Fuck, 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 f
killed the warden. They'd almost kill that person back. That's how it works, right? Blood for blood. Death, that de now. Nah. Well, come on, you going against your own word. How are they gonna explain that you. to any sheriffs or anybody else they plan to send here? Well, sheriffs don't have power here. They try to, yeah. they try no, they to kill the warden. Come on now, they'll, they'll be able to spin it. Shit, the guy just said he's gonna try to execute all of us, probably the fucking fake story. He's scared, this is fear talking. How hard did you hit his head against the wall, Jabaz? Did it feel like it broke? Oh, I... I hit his head into that wall as hard as I humanly could. <laughs> you know, I was kind of expecting you would start kicking him while he was down, too. I felt like you probably considered it at some point. Inmate! Yes, ma'am. Yeah. yeah. Are all of you still alive? Legally, I have to ask that. I don't really care. Unfortunately. Are all of you still alive? What'd you say, you mate? Just but we're all thinking. Say it again. I asked if all of yours are still alive. Scared you, didn't I, inmate? The warden is fine. Yeah. Sure. Who the fuck is Morgan? Nobody knows who Morgan is. Good. Kill the pendejo. Your voice I said the warden. Scared. What'd you say, inmate? Ay, caray, you look at that one talking back. Does your voice tremble when you're scared, inmate? Do you scream when you're in pain? Kick your ass! Oh, sick! Watch your mouth. The beatings will continue until morale improves, Pendeos. Motherfucker, shut the fuck up. I wouldn't call getting shot a beating. The pain will increase until the morale improves, Pendeos. Okay. Let, let me tell you something, motherfucker. Tell if me, Pendeos. You talking all that shit, they're not gonna give you extra potatoes, motherfucker. Nobody asked your bitch. I don't give a fuck what you have to say. You're just another oh, pendejo you. inmate, amigo. See, si, see, si, see. Si. Maybe we can sing some songs to improve morale, amigo. <laughs> Is the bus still in it or is it exiting out? If you got shot in the leg, of course the blood's gonna be coming out. Not the blood, the bullet. Oh, the bullet? The bullet. See, the bullet's in the side, or did it come out the other side? You got another hole? All right, what the hell just happened? Okay, you're gonna have to get the bullet out of your leg. You got, you got any tools questions. inside? Oh, you fell, okay? Yeah, I know that somebody got shot. It was you? Okay. Alright. Where'd you get shot?
fuck? Why can't he get out of his cell? Well, who the fuck is out of their cell? But you gotta be a little tattletale, you pendejo. Tattletale, motherfucker. I wanna be on my cell too. Hell in your look at this one. Look, look at this one. He, he's already filling out reports, this one. Do not make filling me get reports. up. Oh my god. Did he fucking die? Yeah, I swear on me. It was that guy. It was that one right there. What's the there. point that you get? You getting all this special treatment. Why the fuck you getting this up? I got on you. Shut the fuck up. Get Howdy, yourself. sheriff. And sit down. I should just blow your fucking head off. You know that? It's not what you fucking think it is, motherfucker. Uh-huh. Oh yeah, he it was a fucking fight. He wanted to fight. Should be locked. Well, you better hope he don't fucking die in there. Cause fair fight or not, it's gonna be you that hangs for it. The wording got his ass kicked, pendejo. So I saw and you know what? Head. If he did fucking die, it'd be fucking worth it, Malone. Good. Okay. You can tell me you know that when I'm putting know. a bullet in your head. Oh my god. Fuck you there, man. Hey, Pendejo, what you have to tell on me for myself? They lucky, man. Yeah, what? They gon' they was gon' see you regardless, my You was literally didn't you didn't have to you say nothing on me, go I could have done stuff for the rest of us. What you mean? I'm saying for myself, I wanted to get the Ready. fuck out of here. Okay, it's getting the bullet. I ask if I ask for bandages, ma'am. I'm bleeding who fucking is. Oh, look at that one, she dying. I know. <laughs> no, okay, I get it. She talked first. Huh? She talked first. <laughs> Am I understood? Is God? Am I understood by oh. everyone? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. What? What did she say? Much better. Let's give it a shot. Like Chihuahua, man. What the fuck? Wait, there's a cat now? What the? Would anyone else like to make a noise? Nope. Hmm? I think it's pretty rude myself, man. Yeah, I think so. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. What about you, sir? What is it? Would you like to make another noise? Huh? This I, is your last chance. I don't understand. You guys said no, no words. Exactly. You said nothing about animal noises. If I hear any other noise, is that more clear? I can't hear you. Can you speak louder? I really cannot hear. I said any other noise. Am I clear? See, si, see, si, of course, of course. Are you sure? See, si, see, si, of course. Wonderful. Before, you, can I have a book or something to read? No. Like a Bible or something. What about me? Can I? Can I? Oh. It's 
That's it. I'm not going to get any fucking medical treatment. Hey, Calayo, can you hear me? Are you listening? Amigo, do you have paper? Papers, do you have any paper in a notebook no, or something? No, I got no paper. Ay, carajo, we can't even pass messages in here. Nah. Got some bandages. We need to figure out how to pass messages back and forth, amigo. Do you do you have a do you have a book inside your uh, cell? I don't think so. I don't know. I don't think anybody in no sign language. That would take forever. What the fuck are you talking about? We're gonna do more coding here. They are seeing I, I don't even know how to them. fucking read my. Howdy. Early. Oh, I think Chica really dying down there, amigo. Can we get five with some fucking bandages? She's bloody bleeding okay, out. Yeah, answer. where is she? What inmate? What inmate is the one that's injured right now? Over there, by the door, to the right of the stairs, Tabitha. Upper level or lower level? Lower level, right of the stairs. Right there. Okay. Too many people talking at once. Please keep your your voices down if you're not necessary to talk right now. Look at that! Look at that! He's got his pump. Thank you for your good can, work. Can you help me understand what's going on in here? You know, can I... Will you actually Senor believe me? Base. Because I, I'm not... Didn't. I would not hey, come Senor over here and ask yourself. you if I was not prepared I to believe you. I mean, come on, you should know ba that. Alright, basically, they took us to the barns to have fist fights. Which started... So you had a, a, a match that got you out of solitary. That's why you're here, right? Uh, no, okay, I'll back uh, it all the way up. I challenged... Uh, Big L wanted me to dig up Sam, my uncle. Right, you had told me about that the last yeah, time I was here. But I counter-offered him with a game of chess where he takes me to the old solitary. I don't know if you ever saw the old solitary, the one that's yeah. the cellar out by the rain. Mm -hmm. uh, or if I win, I'm out for good. I won the chess game. So I'm out of solitary. For good. For good. All and right. a part of just general prison, they took us to the barn to have fist fights. All the inmates fought each other. They made me an Aurora fight. They didn't realize that me and Aurora fist fight for fun. Uh, I knocked her out, and they were going to make me fight another inmate, but Big L hopped the off warden, from the, the top the and said, nah, get the inmate out of the ring besides Jabaz. And then said, and then I said, are you sure you want to fight? And he, he grinned. I said, when are we starting then? And he swung at me twice. So I started fighting, and I didn't stop. I'm just wondering why it wouldn't no, I, I beat the ever living shit out of him. And after I knocked him out, they all pointed guns. I backed off, and he wasn't looking good. Why, why is Aurora down there freaking the fuck out saying that you're going to be executed? They're trying to execute me. Even though he wanted to fight me. Well, I mean, you're sitting in here. That. Uh, yes, but they brought me here the entire time. They were talking about executing me. They walk you up onto the gallows at all? Not yet. They just carried me off here, and they said if he's dead, you're executed. I said, well, I thought it was a fair fist fight that he wanted. They said, that don't matter. We're going to kill you anyway. Well, from all the reports coming out, it seems that Big L asked for this fixed fight. And it doesn't seem that you're the only word that's saying that. Okay, I, I told Aurora 
I might be a manipulative piece of shit, but I will get to the bottom of things. <laughs> what you're telling me is truthful, isn't it? It is. D don't get me wrong, I hope he dies, even if they execute me. But... Regardless of feelings, I'm... No, I... He wanted the fist fight. Right. His truth has no feelings. Alright. You know what? Mantis. Would you mind? I need to get rid of all this content. Alright. Oh boy. This isn't exactly the conversation that I was planning on coming over and having with you, but it's a start, I suppose. Would you, uh... Would you mind telling her that I'm not dead yet? I will go down there and tell her. And, well, I already did, and I assured her that no one's gonna be executed. Well, if the, let's be honest, if the warden died... Well, she ain't gonna if the warden died, it would probably be a manslaughter charge. Yeah, Accidental but they would death. Still execute crush, then take him out <laughs> I mean, I'm not arguing that they wouldn't try. But I, I, I don't know. Look, it's not my... You know I have no power and no say in it. That's what I'm saying. I would be I, very I, surprised if show, it did happen. I'm gonna be honest with you, Kramer. If you really think, even if it was an accident, they would let me live in here? There's no way unless y'all came in. It's tough. We'll see. But is he is he dead? Not that I know of. Oh, there you go. Nah, I guess I ain't getting executed. I wonder if they'll just use this as an excuse to put me back in solitary. Well, I'd, I'd say that's highly likely. Yeah. I'm not gonna sit here and lie to you. Yep. What is your prisoner identification number? Guy sounds like a fucking dickhead, doesn't he? Yeah. <laughs> he makes uh, everybody have a different number than Big L gives them, so people have to remember two different numbers. Why? Just just because he thinks that's fun? I I guess so. I don't Fair really enough. know why. All right. What? Well, I'll be back. What I'm gonna. I'm gonna go see what I can do and no, try and no, calm no, this place down no, because there are people running the around. Are freaking the fuck out. Gunshots. Yeah. Pretty everywhere. sure they shot Fiverr in the leg over there. They shot Fiverr. Off. Aurora caught one. She um, got a bullet. In the arm. The fuck? It's okay. She's all right. There was a lot of gunshots going when we arrived. Was this some sort of prison riot? No. No. We're going back to the cell. This is all because of a fist fight. Yes. Okay, okay. Oh, let me just catch my breath. My lord. All right. But I'm gonna really. I'm gonna go try and get to the bottom of this because it, it's just just not adding up to me. How are you? But I believe you. All right. Right. What is your prisoner Here. identification number? Here, reach out to me. Yep. Uh, I unfortunately oh, cannot. Yeah, yeah. Yep, yep. If you're trying to give me something, you might be able to throw it through there. the bars. I got a you. What was that? If I had a gun right now, I would rob him of his pocket. I don't smoke. Him. You caught the fact you were missing a four the first time, eh? It's not much, but it's something. Yeah, I appreciate it. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Yes. You work in a fucking prison, not a library, pendejo. Are you threatening me? Put your fucking hands down. Oh, you fucking shit, goddamn piece of shit. Uh, uh, Alright, enough, enough. Hey, hey, Alright, You want help? Moment there, I didn't know what was grabbing in my gun at, so I decided yeah, not to do right. anything. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 
no, no, come, oh, come on. Come on. A little much, don't you think? You know, I should I should actually double down and just propose to Aurora. The actual true Tell double me. down. You wear my fucking hat? Yeah. Like, look, I thought I was gonna get executed the other day. <laughs> uh, now? I'm gonna make the contingency she needs to get religious first. She needs to go become a, reli a religious yeah. woman. Yeah. I think I like it. I, I think that's actually I think I might do it I I, I think it'll be worth it yeah I think I'm gonna I think it, when I see when I see Aurora I'm gonna I'm gonna tell her look you're gonna get out before me whether you go to Guarma alone or not go grab a get a religion and by the time I'm out I need to ask you something <laughs> Jubass, where are you? I'm over here. I'm over here, Booker, to your left. I'm getting up. You can let these inmates out. Follow them? Yeah. I'm stepping away. Well, I just washed my uniform near this blood on it. They will land the inmates out. All of them. They're going to the fucking box. Why? Because I said so. You know, I even asked him if he was sure he wanted to fight, Booker. You know, I asked him if he was sure he wanted to fight, Booker. I heard And he was you. insistent on it. But you didn't have to force his head against the wall, did you? It was fucking hay. Hey, he ran over that way. The other way. Which way? Over that way. You took full advantage of it, didn't you? You know who else I pushed my their head into fucking hay? Aurora. What? Wait for Malone. Do you have anything to say to him, Sheriff? No. So by the way, uh, Booker? Yeah? We should probably tell the, the prisoners that you're the new temporary warden. Fuck off, Doyle! What? I'm serious. Tell him whatever you want. You know he's like extremely right. jealous of you being the junior warden. Or soon to be I don't want to be the junior warden. And now I have all this responsibility. Inmate. I didn't mean to hurt him. And it's your fucking fault. I didn't want to kill him, believe it or not. Don't get me wrong, I won't lie to you. I won't sit there and say, oh, I'd be so fucking ashamed if he died. Obviously, I would be fucking happy for that man to be dead. But my intention was to fucking fist fight him. I just wanna wake up and do my job, go to sleep. And now I have to do all this fucking paperwork. It's your fucking fault. It, you know whose fault it is? Your fault. No, it's Big L's fault. If that dumb bitch could have fought better, maybe he wouldn't have lost. What'd you say? I think you fucking heard me. <sighs> say it again. I didn't hear you. That's what I thought. You have been on my good side for a long time now, inmate. You've been very And you're lucky. still gonna take me to the fucking hot box even though he wanted the fucking fight. He wanted the fight. He didn't want to almost die, inmate. And you know what? Maybe he should have fought better, Booker. You're just gonna ignore well, the fact I did the same shit to Aurora? Well, that's right. 
It don't matter to he you. It only matter. It only fucking it. matters when it suits your fucking narrative, Booker. Yeah, it didn't hit Aurora as hard. I threw her Obviously. head into a fucking hay wall too, just like him. Yeah, well, you picked a nice soft spot for her, didn't you? I think the soft spot's fucking Big L's skull, and hopefully he's fucking dead. I can do this all fucking day. Oh. Oh please, oh please, oh please. Nothing to I'll say. I'll give you here, 20 George. bucks. I'll give you 20 bucks. <laughs> you trying to bribery? No, really, it was a mate? joke. It was a fucking joke. Are we in a joking mood? I I don't know. You don't know? You're confused? I asked Big L. Oh, god damn it. Oh. Fuck. This is taking a long time to get to the box in, mate. Uh, yeah, because you keep fucking kicking me over words. The f I shouldn't even go to the fucking box for this. You shouldn't tell me what we should do. Should we sit down and have mimosas? Should we sit down and finger paint? Should we sit down and have a fucking tea party? You're lucky you're not being executed, in, mate. Oh, I'm lucky I'm not being executed? Yeah, that's that right. right? Because if it was up to me and not the state, you would be hanging from a noose right now. Yeah, well, join the fucking club, Booker. Maybe y'all can go get fucking tea together. I have some fucking tea. While you're rotting in the fucking box. Do you want the one that I put Allison Mills in? Do you want the one that I put fucking Jack in? Or do you want the one that I put your nephew in? Pick one. I don't give a fuck. Put me in whatever fucking hot box you want. And you could tell Good. Boo Hoo. You could tell fucking Big L Boo Hoo. And I hope he's fucking dead. I really do. I hope he's fucking dead. I hope that worthless fuck dies slow. I hope you lose a fucking couple of teeth. <sighs> you have to kick me in the fucking head. You want me to lose my fucking teeth? All right. <sighs> Oh, great. Great. Oh. There you go. Do you need medical supplies? No, <laughs> I've got some. I didn't want this. I don't want this responsibility, you fucking asshole. <laughs> oh, good. I'll save that. Ah. Uh. You know what I did for you in my I went to the fucking sheriff and I told him that it was fucking wrong that the warden wanted to dig up your fucking uncle and put his skull on his desk I fought for that not to happen and this is what you do like I said put whatever narrative you want and that's the fucking truth I told Big L, he was wrong. And you know, you know what else he was wrong to do to fucking try to fight? You should have backed down. I said, are you sure you want to do this? And you should have backed down. It's just as much your fault as it is his. Yeah, except I'm sitting in a hot box. Where the fuck's he sitting? Keep running your mouth and I'll put you in the hot box just like this.
Go. How long am I in here for now? Until I feel like letting you out. Yep. I think of it this way. It's just like solitary. Only worse. Well, I'd rather be in a fucking hot box than a fucking coffin. Unless the hot box becomes a coffin. Well, maybe. Hopefully the, uh, whatever bad Big L's lying on becomes a coffin, too. I hope we're the one that kills Big L one day, though, Chet. I'm telling you, I really want to tackle that fucker off the leap of faith and perma with him. I, I really do think it's the, the best thing. It, it, it would be peak Jabass. It would be the uh, the best ending for Jabez. Could you imagine it even like imagine we marry Aurora, and I slip off the ring and put it on Sam's grave before tackling him off. <laughs> what? Why is the huh a question mark? Well, that way I don't lose the ring in the river, man. Yeah, and your body, though? Yeah, I, mean, I guess that's true. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> okay, now I, okay, that makes it even funnier to me. I, I kind of want to do that even more now. I don't think she would be there. But yeah, I'd probably give it to her beforehand. But I feel like if I gave it to her beforehand, it would be so obvious that Jabass knows he's gonna die. Cause like, Aurora's whole expectation is if I ever do that plan, if she's still alive, is that they go off to Mexico after. I just think it would be so fucking sad if they were waiting down below for him. You know, that's one of the only reasons I, I want Jabass to, like, outlive, like, a CD. Or even, a, like, if Aurora died, I think Jabass would have no reason not to do that plan. The only thing that holds him back from doing it right now is Aurora. I even think it would be sick to, uh, I 
I even think it would be sick if like they both managed to survive. If they both managed to survive the fall and the river and then got to their feet. And they just both started swinging at each other like covered in blood. Because I would choke that fucker out. In that situation. I think he would go for it too. And like if I threw him away and then tackled him myself. But I don't know at the same time. I think it would be it would be so sick if like Big L was fucking dead on arrival at the bottom of the river and Jabass was slowly dying. Just to have the reaction of I did it. I fucking did it. While like struggling to breathe from the water and whatnot. Chat, we're slowly losing subs. We're 43 away from 1100. Yeah, it's the end of the month. It's the end of the month sub uh, sub again. Dude, is it bad? Like, you know, dude, th see, I think also a really cool thing would be slowly like digging and then the thunder goes off and then that's when Jabass decides to do it. I really want it to be storming, bro. If that's in that scene. Like, just hailing wind and thunder and lightning. This fucking... I think it would be so good. Like I said, I really want to put the note near the edge and then have it be the actual note. And I, I really want to put on the back of the of, like, a new note that just says, Checkmate. And tell him to flip to the back and say what it says. <laughs> and then tackle that fucker right off the cliff.
Like I said, Chad, I really want to make a fit that's got the skull pants with these kind of sur the suspenders. One of the worn down shirts and this coat. I really want to. You want our OG bandana? Do the worn down hat. Because I really like the worn down hat. After the water scene, having an outfit, having a version of the hat that's worn down. I also really like having a relationship with Kramer and like Tabitha too. I think it's going to be so interesting if we execute Kramer, if she's close with Tabitha, to see her reaction to Jabaz after that. Yeah. Part of me for the spice really wants to tell Tabitha and show Tabitha all the corruption stuff for maximum st spice. But then at the same time, I want to also hint that there's evidence and they'll one day find it and then leave all of the evidence on Kramer after we execute him. Inmate Jonathan Devine. Howdy, Enrique. How is the box faring for you? Uh, I, I hate this fucking place. Yeah, well, you earned it. How did I earn it, Enrique? Did I you, had to... Did you I had to put... I had to put a metal plate into my boss's skull. And you know what I said to him before we started fighting? Are you sure you want to do this? Are you sure you want to fight? And he still fought me. It was a fucking sanctioned goddamn fight. It was. It was. However, the aftermath is not part of the bargain. What aftermath? I let off of him immediately. And suddenly it was the 4th of goddamn fucking July as I'm putting a metal plate into his head. The, the chaos that shots. ensued, that is not order. I did not cause that, though. You know where I was right after the fight? <laughs> In this fucking hot box. And then they took me to the main cells and they took me right back to the hot box. I did not cause any chaos. You may not have caused it directly, but, uh, sure, but understand, indirectly. but any of your actions do have consequences. Sure, and I do get that. I'd understand being punished or had extra time if I killed him, even if it was on accident. But what? He's fucking alive. He wanted to fight. And the big L that now we have is not the same that was before. Oh my god. What do you mean? That sort of contusion to the brain it causes oh no. lapses in memories. No! He doesn't even recognize me and we have been friends for nearly 40 years. Oh my god! <laughs> Now, will I stand here and tell you that I fault you for what it is that you have done? Will I tell you that you should really think about the actions that you take and how it affects people around you? That we here at Sisica 
have a particular purpose and reason for being in the crossing. That hopefully, with all the penitence that we are trying to give, hence the name penitentiary, that somehow reformation in one's actions and their choices oh will God. occur. Enrique would be another great The simple warden. fact of you fuck around and you will find out is where do we live by here in Sisica. Yeah. And yet you repeat over and over and over again. And here we find you inside a tiny little box. That's right. You know who else lives by fuck around and find out? <coughs> Fucking West. Am I allowed to speak candidly? Are you gonna kick me while I'm tied up or shoot me through a fucking hot box like the other guards? No, please. Let me indulge you in the uh, time you need to speak. My intention was to knock his ass out, which I believe I did. But he wanted to fight me quite badly. Especially after I beat him in chess. And I think, quite frankly... If what this island goes by is the motto of fuck around and find out, just like the West, well, I think Big Al found out. Because he fucked around, and he certainly found out. I'm glad he survived, mainly because I don't want to get executed. But, if he would have died, I would have been happy. Even if it meant a noose. Pray tell, have you ever asked yourself, why would you be happy? To kill Big L? Do you actually want to know why? Of course. Do you ever know my Uncle Sam? Yes, he has been in here several times. He's dead. Been dead for a long time. Yes, I have read the papers. Big Al did more damage to my uncle than any lawman has ever done. Any enemy of his has ever done. Now, I'd argue Big Al killed him before Rip did. Only reason I was ever in solitary to begin with was because of my uncle. Because I loved him. And I took his spot for him. The man that killed Sam Bass? Yeah, sure. Rip pulled the trigger, and he'll get his one day, I'm sure of it. But the real person that did the damage to him is Big L. So if I killed him, even if it costed me my happiness and my life, I'd be content, blood for blood, life for a life. At least I would have done my fucking uncle proud. You know, a long time ago, my uncle, he, uh, he got put in this hell and put into solitary with Big L. I think it was the, it was when he murdered, uh, that one dumb fuck. I forget his name. He murdered him. He got, he got put in solitary his entire stay and fucked him up. And Big L took pride in the damage to my uncle's mind that he caused. And eventually my uncle snapped one day. And I joined him as he went outlaw. And me, my uncle, four others went all around the crossing and crossed off my uncle's list one name at a time. All the people that wronged him on the cross and shot down, shot down a sheriff in cold blood. Stabbed another deputy, cold blood. Robbed. Got into gunfights. I think we racked up about 21 months. We were sitting in the Sea of Coronado. We were pinned down. We knew law would close in on us eventually. 
My uncle was willing to die that day rather than go back to the hell that is solitary. And any time I tried to fight my uncle, any time I told him I didn't want him to die, it didn't matter. So rather than continue to fight him, I said I got his back till he's dead. And I joined him and four others. And we were all willing to die that day at the Coronado Sea. My uncle had a death wish because of this whole island. And we managed to turn ourselves in for no solitary for my uncle. So, albeit I don't want to die today, but every man does have their day. And you know what? If I killed him, and today was my day because I murdered the warden. Oh. Like I said, I would have done my uncle proud. Would have been content with death. said you known Big L for 40 years. I have, yes. Even before we were guards. What did y'all do before you were guards? We were boys. Oh, I see. Like when you were young, young. I thought you did other work. No, no. It's always been this. Who's I did go down... No, I did go down the route of... Medical and... Barbering first, so that's why my specialty here is specifically patching all of you up and making sure that you're all very clean cut. I see. He had very high ambitions, though, which is why he made warden very, very quickly. Who was the warden before him? This old man. I think his name was Winsmore or something like that. What? I cannot recall. What? He passed away. And, uh... <laughs> Left the void there for about half a year. And as junior warden, he has uh, ascended the ranks very what? quickly. The state didn't know what to do, and eventually, Big L was born. Now, contrary to popular belief, not every single guard here is violence beget violence. I'm one of them. I don't believe in that sort of thing. I don't like using a strong, firm hand unless I have to, or it's unless fast. I'm commanded to. Oh. Yep, what that's right. What an L. What an L from Ron. This guy just takes L's constantly, bro. That sort of thing does get a particular outcome. But, is it the only way to do things? No. I believe talking to the inmates and making them realize that what this place is for is for penitence. Then slowly they will understand. Does it lead to any sort of reformation? Sometimes it does. Very few. Very few. But I've heard people in the mainland call this a revolving door, which to a certain extent it is, because the old outlaw ways, us being the last bastion of the West, it's hard to get rid of. It's hard to weed out. And there are very many weeds. Yeah. Well, I appreciate if you, the If you like to lessen in, you can come closer. But if you're gonna hide in the bush, I might as well shoot you. Hey, don't shoot me. What do you want? Uh, I want to make sure he was okay. He's in a box. How okay do you think he is? <laughs> I mean, fair, I guess. But I still want to make sure that he was, like, uh, you know, not in bad shape. Inmate Jonathan Devine, are you dehydrated, hungry, or do you need to use the restroom? Uh, I mean, I, I got a little bit of water. I'll be fine. All right, then, I mean, you know, you could pee through the hole. Yeah, I know. So he's fine, inmate. What oh, is your... I'm, I'm fine. I'll be out eventually, hopefully. Ronnie. It's Ronnie. His name's Ronnie it, Rivers. Yeah, it's Ronnie. Ronnie Rivers. Everybody actually thought that I was you, Jabass. <laughs> well, the eye patch and the... I'm probably bald, if I had to guess. Uh, well, yeah, but they also glued Pop Pop's back hair to my face. 
I don't want to know. I'm, so I have I really, a beard I now. I don't. I really don't want to know. Please get away from the hot box. Please just go back to the normal part of prison. Okay, as long as you're okay, so I can let the others know. Sorry. Understand that what we do here at Sisika is for your own good. You may not think that. You may not understand that. But we are polar opposites of the same spectrum. You the do what outlier. you do because you think that you are justified in what it is that you do. We do what we think we have to do because we are justified in what we do. I mean, I at least know what I am, though. And you think we don't? I think some of you do. Not all of us. But then again, there's also outlaws that don't know what the fuck they are. It goes both ways. You're absolutely right. We're definitely the outliers in this world. We're the few, not the many. Disturb the common people. You know who told me that? Hmm. Miguel. It is a difficult give and take that we are constantly always in, uh, I guess, a push and pull of each other. You'll come back here. We will see you again. That's right. That's because of that's the way of things. And we will go through the motions, regardless of the fact. Chess games, fights withstanding, it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, you are right in thinking that someone carries a bullet with your name on it. As does someone carry one with mine. One day, the bullet will meet its home. All we can do in between is making sure that we stop that process or belay it as long as possible. Yeah. Now, our intent here in Sisica is to make it so that way that bullet never finds you. Whether you know it or not, that is our purpose. Because in our heart our hearts, we know for a fact that you don't deserve that bullet. You deserve forgiveness. But you won't get that until you stop. Then I got a question for you. And what is that? Do you believe a man can truly stop once they've gone so far? You know Yes. I Yes, I do. I don't even need to think about that. Really? You can stop. You know, I used to be a man... ...when I was younger. I used to believe violence was the last answer. Only commit violence if you absolutely have to. Slowly, the more blood I spilled... The more time I had to, well, be a red right hand, I guess, instead of a civil man for my uncle, slowly but surely, not only did violence become my first choice, but it got easier. First man I ever killed was an accident. Cracked his head open with a hammer. Didn't mean to kill him. It's only supposed to rough him up. Then I had to kill the witness. Then I had to kill the other witness. Slowly but surely. By the end of that night, I didn't feel good. I, f I fucking felt horrible. Four months later. Five months later, six months later, a year later, two years later. I started doing heinous deeds and committing acts of murder. It didn't sit wrong with me no more. Quite frankly, it became easy. Hell, and then if there's a real sick son of a bitch, maybe not by society standards, but by my own, 
Something I really want done. I pulled the trigger on him, Enrique. I enjoy it. I just killed somebody that I wanted to kill. Somebody that deserved to fucking die. So. You really think somebody can actually turn around? Yes. As somebody who's thought about it. Somebody who's wondered. I don't think I could even if I tried. I think deep down inside last five, six years, however fucking long it's been now. I think violence will always be my initial reaction in life, even if I try extremely hard to suppress those urges. I have come to find that in the 35 years that I have been a guard, That every man has a chance to turn their life around. To make a different choice. To choose not to hurt people. Not to be what they are. But to be something different. The only limitations a man has is what their body can actually attest to doing. You can't lift that rock. You can't push that mountain. You can't ford that river that's too wide. Yeah. But what you change inside... That is by far more easier task now. That isn't relative to pushing down the mountain. It isn't an easy task in a relative sense to everything that you have going on in your life. No, it's a difficult thing. But I have seen men change. In full confession for myself, I have carried this six shooter on my side and this rifle on my back. For well over 30 years. I've cleaned them. I've loaded them. Oh my god. I've unloaded them. But truth be told. The five bullets that are inside of this rifle. The six bullets that are inside of this six shooter. They have been the same bullets. For 32 years. Oh my god. I heal more. Than I hurt. I use my words more than I use vengeance. I use fear as a tool. The promise of pain. And truth be told, the most pain I cause is every so once in a while a slip of the wrist when I am shaving somebody. But that's it. No one's ever died under my watch. No one's ever died under my hand. Have people died here? Of course. But I am not the one responsible. I may have watched many executions happen in my stead. Have I done anything to stop them? No. There is a purpose to all things. A reason. You have your reasons for your actions. And we have ours. But I have faith. In the formulation of what it is we do here in Sisica. That one day... One day, it'll all just click for one individual behind these walls. You've done wrong, but you can be forgiven. Yet that step, that first initial step has to be taken by you. Yeah, no, you're absolutely right. I guess. I guess that I hit a point when I was younger, after I murdered a couple people, after I hurt a lot of people, like I said, I stopped feeling bad. I realized I was, to me, it felt like I was too deep. To be honest, solitary, it fucked me up for a long time. I'm grateful to be out of it, even if I get dragged back there eventually. That twisted my mind. But you're 100% right. Anybody that wants to change, they have to be willing to change. I guess I think over the years, I've lost that will to change. I'm content with the man I've become. 
even if who I was five, six, seven, eight, nine years ago would be disgusted by who I am now. You now people change, whether it's for the better or the worse. And don't get me wrong, I prefer the lifestyle I used to live. <laughs> Happy. Yeah, maybe sell a bit of liquor. Play a bit of cards. Spend time with people I looked like uh, looked at like family and friends. But hey, at some point, you gotta be more than just a kid from fucking tall trees. At some point, you gotta you gotta go down a path that maybe maybe you didn't necessarily always want to go down, but hey, it worked out in the end, I guess. You believe in fate? In destiny? I believe in a sort of design that we eventually come to our particular ends that were written for us. Sure. I don't know that I would call it destiny or fate, but I would call it something of a particular design, sure. You believe in any religion? I grew up Catholic in Mexico, but here now, I think I've seen enough atrocities to fill a antithesis to whatever the Bible is. <laughs> I've read the Bible. Not my cup of tea. I prefer Norse mythology. You ever read Norse mythology? I mean, I had to in order to understand what the hell, like, Thorn was trying to talk about. Jesus <laughs> Christ, that one's a basket case. But sure. Mythology is very interesting. It is, yeah. You know, when you're not brandishing it as a weapon. Yeah. I don't brandish it as a weapon, but I do. I do quite enjoy it. Yeah, I'll name my weapons after Norse mythology, usually. Oh. Same as my horse. You got something named Odin or... Thor or something like that. I've got a horse named Asgard. And my name, my, my weapons are named after Fenrir. Loki's kid. And Fenrir has uh, two wolves, Skull and Haiti, devour the sun and the moon. When Ragnarok happens. Got a weapon called Ragnarok as well. The end of times. Yeah. When Fenrir devours Odin, Skull and Hades devour the sun and the moon. All the gods slowly die. I think they managed to prevail over everything in the end, though. You know what I like about Norse mythology? Those two ravens that hang out with Odin all the time. <laughs> Jugen and Mugen, or whatever you say. Yeah. Ravens are interesting. You know how... Clever little things, yeah. I don't know if it was after I started getting really into Norse mythology. I felt like everywhere I went, I could hear a fucking raven. Well, no. Do be careful. Like we have ravens here in the crossing, but sometimes people confuse it with a crow, and we yeah. got we got a lot of those as well too. But, yeah, a mix know. of the two. That's for sure. There's a lot of them. I know there's ravens and thieves. I've seen one. I know there's ravens, but you're not wrong. Crows and ravens could easily be mixed or confused. Crows are a little bit bigger. Actually, anybody that gives me information, I call them a raven. Yeah, I guess that's a bit like Odin. A little bit, yeah. You also got the one eye, so you got that going for you. Now yeah. you just gotta grow some hair out. I'm more of a Loki guy. Well, he had both his eyes. You find yourself to be a little bit of a trickster? 
conniving, mm. clever, fast on the talking. I think I'm a fast talker, but I'm I'm probably too honorable to be mischievous. Mm. Even though the honor will get me killed in the end. Not at will. This whole honor among thieves and gold you all live by. Not everybody Much deserves honor. That's for sure. This is true, yeah. That we can agree upon. But there are a few that do. It truly depends at the end of the day how you treat somebody. You know? Whether or not they're a mark for some sort of gain. Or someone you have to forcefully interact with. It's really how you treat people in the end. Do you ever leave the island? I go on sabbatical on occasions. Usually not to the mainland over here. I go across the other way to Mexico. Do you like it? Mexico? It's my yeah. home. I've always wanted to go. Yucatan Peninsula is where I'm from. Mexico City as well as beautiful, beautiful Cancun. Mm. It's a lovely place. Tequila's good. People are wonderful. Lots and lots of trepitas tacos and empanadas. Delicioso. I was, uh... You know, I usually uh, reside most of my days in Thieves Landing in New Austin when I'm free. You know, I found Not... a little spot to fish at and I could see Mexico from where I fish. I always realized... How pretty it looks, actually, from afar. Yeah, New Austin is not too dissimilar from the landscape that you have in Mexico. There, is there trees in Mexico? Oh, yeah, of course. Good. I, I think I'd miss the trees if I ever went. So good. I'm glad there's trees. Yeah, the one thing I don't like about New Austin is no trees. That's why I love thieves so much. It's not... Uh... It's not all deserts, as most people think. There is mountainscapes, there is beautiful beaches, there is just as much diversity that you have here in the crossing as much as you have over there in Mexico. And if you don't like it, you could travel a little bit, and there's Brazil. Where the people are way too pretty, way too fucking pretty. <laughs> Jesus Christ. God damn it, I hate Brazil. <laughs> People are, you just said way too pretty. Stupid pretty. Really? Stupid. Like dumb pretty. Like what the fuck? <laughs> I love Brazil. <laughs> I think the only... first Brazilian. Really? First, first one was Mexican. Second one was Brazilian. Third one was half Brazilian, half Mexican. Fourth one was French. That was a mistake. Not because she was French, but, you know. Because she was difficult. You know, uh... Only time I've been outside the crossing is Guam, I think. Ah, uh, yes. The Caribbean Isle of very vast and many mysteries. I've been once. Yeah, it's an interesting place. It's fucking horrible. When did you last go? Uh, the previous regime. There were more buildings then. I see. And then everything blew up. So you were there before it was all blown up, huh? Yes, that I was. I, yeah, I heard it was, uh... Quite a... Shit place. It was fucking then. horrible, yeah. Yeah. I'll tell you what, tourism, not a thing over there. Maybe now, who knows, I don't know, I haven't gone yet, but still. It's actually way different now. Been over there recently. There is a uh, the militia. There are, there's like four, five or six people, that, and, and the armed, there's the armed guards, there's five or six different heads of uh, the militia, ministers and whatnot. A lot of civilians. Pleasant hmm. people, surprisingly. Okay. It's actually interesting. 
So didn't expect it, to like it so much. It went from extremely heavy totalitarian government that was difficult to deal with and you couldn't see anything, do anything, or even try to breathe anything. But to, to extremely friendly and welcoming, yeah. Okay, so now it's just cuddly teddy bears and yeah, just I would argue it's even too cuddly for like I I won five thousand dollars in five horse deeds over there in a poker game. Oh, okay. I was about to say it's like what they're having like lotteries over there. No, like, no, the I played poker and I, I'm not even kidding, Enrique. I just told the truth the entire time and showed my cards to prove I was telling the truth at every hand, and I won the game. All right. Well, yeah, but yeah, maybe I'll go. It's a little. It is a bit too friendly at times, and you can't do. They're they're very against doing any sort of spilling blood, but uh, you know, even then, it is quite nice. Something to look into. I think you. I think they. You know, I, I will say this. I think there needs to be a middle ground. I think they need somebody that's bad, but not. Too bad. You know? Yeah, I kind of get what you're saying. Because like, 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 like the last one you said was extremely vicious. You, you couldn't even breathe. Now they're way too comfortable and friendly. Need a good middle ground. Like you said. Maybe somebody that don't commit violence. Like you. You were saying you don't commit violence. But you get people to act in line out of fear. They need somebody that won't commit violence, but they'll be afraid to commit violence due to the fear. That's how I like to operate nowadays. Most people tend to not try anything on me because of my reputation and who I am. I don't even have to usually swing the hammer or pull the trigger. Very few and far between nowadays. Yeah, it tends to be the case with me as well, too. Cut from the same cloth for the most part, but I tell someone to do something and they do it. So I actually don't have to pistol whip anybody. I got tons of guards to do that for me. Yeah. Did you ever take a warden position? No. Even if you had to? No. Next in line would be Booker, not me. Even though I have one of the longest tenures here as a guard, I would much prefer to stay as a barber or a medic. She's very upset that she has to be the warden. Not a lot of people want to fill Big L's shoes. If they need to. I'd imagine from the inmate side, or not the inmate side, the guard side of Sisica, the Big L's probably been the best warden y'all's ever had, pretty much. For some, that is the only warden they've ever known. Yeah. He has set a uh, precedence that we all respect and understand. And as a result, it has led to a lot of dissatisfied customers. I mean, truly, the end of the result is... We want people to not want to come back here. Yep, which he does. And they don't. Which he does. To be fair, he does make people not want to come back here. I'll give him credit where it's due. And that is part of the job. Now, I think there's some things he does that really makes people want to kill him. <laughs> that is also part of the job. State mandated sadistic psychotic tendencies. Yeah, no, we need one of those. Maybe I would have been a good guard. <laughs> Maybe you would have been a good guard. Like I said, every passing moment is a chance to turn it all around. Oh my God. Reform, don't do crime for a month. Hell, you could be up for a review. If you wanted to apply to be a Sisica guard, I'm pretty sure Big L would be happy to take you. Oh my God. Bro, if I got Sisica guard just to cap Big L on the back of the head, holy shit. But the lifestyle you choose is your own. That's true. Who you are from this day forward is your choice. All we can hope for those that play up on the side of the angels, or at least attempt to, is that one day you'll understand the contemporary idea of right from wrong. Rather than justified. Justification is not the reason. 
We're doing what it is. What you feel is right. Uh, At the end of the day, people still get hurt. Uh, hell, even Big L, I think, would attest to this. I think it, one of the reasons he likes me so much is I know the things I do are heinous deeds, and I know they're not right by society standards. The things I want to do, and only me, don't make them right. There's still violent acts, and there's still things that I should be punished for. So, I've never shied away from that. Truth is, I'm looked at as a monster, probably because I am one. A lot of people try to tell me I'm not. But I know what I am. And I know the things I do are wrong. But sometimes you gotta do things that not everybody's gonna like. This is true. You can't please everyone all the time. But to make the distinction that you're some sort of monster is a fallacy in its own right. You're still just a man. You do monstrous things. But like I said, every passing moment is a chance to turn it all around. I think I'm allowed out. Yeah. I gotta fill my water. I can walk and talk. Sad man. There's no clear edge on this side, just so you're aware. Yeah. It's further down. I have walked these grounds far too many times. Every inch of this fucking island. I love it. I part way hate it, but only because I know it all too well. When you know something far too well. You begin to hope for greener pastures or something different. It's not always the case. Because I did happen to set foot on other land. Here and there. Mexico. Sometimes the crossing when I need something. And I miss it immediately. This is my home. This is my job. I have created a love and a passion for the things that I do. Weirdly enough, I can attest this from every Sisaga guard. We want what's best for you. And sure, we give a heavy hand and heavy words that go along with it. But that is all in a vote of confidence that one day, <laughs> again, they'll turn it all around. You say every man has to decide what they want, which I 100% agree with. You ever considered doing a different line of work before you chose guard? Was there anything else you were thinking about uh, doing, or besides before barber and health and all that? Well, or was father, it always... was, father was a barber, mother was a nurse. I see. So now I do both of their jobs <laughs> and guard duty. That makes sense. So at the very end of the day, I think I upgraded. <laughs> Yeah, I, uh, I lived on my own a while, but my, my uncle, he was a businessman, went outlaw in the end, now to argue I'm a better businessman than he ever was, and say I'm living up to the outlaw life as well. Everybody does business. This is true. But I mean, you know, again, I do not fault you for the life that you have chosen. But do you really have to hurt so many people? Hmm. To be honest, I'm trying to think of the last person I hurt that... I probably shouldn't have. There's very few that I've, I've hurt that I would be like, you know what, I could probably have gotten away with not doing that. You know, sometimes, you know, if you gotta do something... I ain't gonna do a half measure. 
It's always going to be the full measure. You know, you, you've ever had a guard, or you ever had an inmate that you threatened, hey, mouth off one more time, I'm going to have to shoot you. Several times, yeah. And then they mouth off. Handful of times, yes. And then you hit them over the head, right? No, someone else does for me. Or somebody else shoots them for you? No, they don't shoot them. They hit them. I've threatened to shoot people, but would I actually do it? Probably not. Why is everyone laying on the ground? I don't know. Hi, Uncle. Can I take a piss before yeah, I have you... to inevitably lay down? Yeah, you're going. That was such a good talk. Um. That's such good RP. Holy shit. I'm gonna take a piss real quick though, Chad. Here be. You all right? Jabaz? Jabaz? Oh, were you talking to me? Yeah, are you okay? I was uh, taking a piss. <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm getting water from here, asshole. I, you started getting water after I started pissing. You're just standing here. <laughs> yeah, I'm alright, I guess. I didn't kill him. No, apparently he's alive. Apparently they put a metal plate in his head. Maybe next time you crack his egg, it will ding. How are you? Look, 
looking for fucking painkillers. Kramer gave me willow bark tablets. The rest of them are picking potatoes, I think. Where's Aurora? I don't know. Have you checked solitary? I'm gonna try. Now would be best when there's nobody looking. Christ, there's so many cards. Air raid's going on. All right. You have a ball in your hand, sir. I know. Ah. She's looking sure. for pain medicine. I don't know if anybody's got any. Um, you mean, maybe go to medical? I don't know. I don't know. I think she was just doing pain medicine. What? Yeah, no, like right I wasn't. Here, from, from like the gate to over here, you were doing pain medicine. Uh, no. You were walking it off? Uh, that doesn't quite. Right. I can't believe so much Siska Siska's popping off so much because of a fucking stupid chess game that started it all. That's insane, bro. the way oh. howdy howdy you okay <laughs> yeah he lived I'm all right you know Booker walked up to me to show me a bloody tooth she was so proud of yeah she kept tying she tied me up and Kept kicking me and beating me and kicking me and kicking me. I made sure to keep mouthing off so the two lawmen could watch as she kicked me more and kicked me in the fucking head. You know, they showed me it in front of Kramer and Thorn. Then I saw Kramer here and I was like, did he actually deserve that? He didn't even know what to say and he just walked away. I need to ask you a favor. Anything. You're gonna be out before me. Mm-hmm. I need you... Whether you go to Guam or without me to do this or not, I need you to... I need you to become religious. <laughs> I'm not joking. You're not joking. I'm dead serious. <coughs> Why? Well, no questions asked. Okay. Don't go mining. <laughs> Just don't go what? I said Mine? don't go mining. Mining? Yeah. Why not? Just don't. Don't worry about it. At all? Not without me. <laughs> Even here? Yeah. Nah, that's my expert. James. Oh. The mine here, is it a cave? <laughs> You say it's a cave. Uh, no, yes. Mm, yes. Nope, not even here. What? Okay. No, I'm talking to her. Okay, then. What's the cave for? Nah, nah, it's just... 
<sighs> Come over here away from this fucker. Yeah. You really fucked him up all the way. I know they told me that he has a metal plate in his skull now. His brain is so fucking scrambled that he was making us do arts and crafts. <laughs> you know, the Understand? guards said they're gonna ignore what Big L said because he's fucked in the head and they're just gonna keep doing the things they're doing. And if he ends up having an issue with it, they're just gonna blame it on Booker. There's prison rules in here, even for the guards. If they don't like the way things are happening, they'll do something about it. I wish you would have died. I think this is better than death if he really is that fucked up. It's gotta last. You might have turned him into a nice person. <laughs> Which is best case scenario. I guess this is just payback for everything he did to Sam. He told me I had to fill a void. If you didn't do what he... If you didn't do what you did, I would still be it. Still be down there. God knows how long. They're gonna rope one of us. Never mind. They're gonna yell at us. All right, come on, you three. It's supper time. Hurry up to the mess hall. Right. How's that fella? How's that clumsy fella doing? Who? I don't know, you tell me. You're pretty clumsy. <coughs> <coughs> Wonderful. Okay, tell me, how's he doing? I've been patrolling the wild for a tiny bit. You have a medical bag, do you? Nope. I do. I bring you that. Good chance. Dude, it was so good. Died of insanity fucked up, then bring me in that. What was that? Said I'm tired of insanity fucked up, then bring me in there. <laughs> you know, it was so good. Hey, doing, James? It was so, it was so, such good roleplay, dude. <laughs> oh, James, some of those things you said in solitary were not things I expected to hear from you. What was that? Tell James some of the things he said is not things I expected to hear from him. Yeah, well, it's been a while, hasn't it? I'm proud of you. I don't care what they do with me there. I'm just zooming me, I'm just making it all up. Right. <coughs> Probably be down there and you could pass, that's for sure. I don't want anybody to be in there because of me. Before me. Yeah, I get one. Getting up. You good? 
No. Could you help? Why'd she <laughs> still on the ground? I think she just had a headache or something. Mid. Take to the medical you you want. Okay, Fine. but I still need a medical bag. Why would you need a medical bag? I, I, trust me. I, <laughs> even if I take them in there, I need a medical bag. All right. Could you get me one? In the middle of my drink and my drink. I guess second hand. Yeah, but not for him. Plus, my cousin wanted me to beat him up anyways. I, I need a medical bag, all right? Fine, fuck. You luck I be doing this for you. Dead lad, though. Oh my god. Let's get out of the way. Wonderful. Watch out. All right, all you do is mess up. is being served. All right. All of you, you three males to the uh, mess hall while I have a chat with this uh, lady here. See, see. Look at him, already full in getting low. All right, he gives me a medical bag, I'll help you. Seem you were uh, arrested for quite a few different things. Hmm. Wow. Well. Some real nasty things, mind you. What the fuck? Apparently you uh, were present during some terrible things. You're an accessory as a result. Mm, mighty interesting. Mm -hmm. You like to hang around people who uh, attempt to kill or maim others at their own disposal, I guess. I suppose. You giving this little monster drugs? No, I'm not. I, I figured if she didn't have drugs, it's probably from a, a good reasoning. You know. Yeah. All right. If she's gonna get drugs, she's gonna get them from the fucking uh, what my call it. Craig, not not my place to do. Who the fuck is this? The, the, the fella you pushed over. Oh yeah, right. You wanna help? How's him? he doing? I don't, I don't know. All righty, mates, to the mess hall. Go get some supper. Yes, yeah, sir. I consider this is a... I don't know for Ed. Sure. Bye, Ed. It's a nice hat, sir. Thank you. A bit late to be trying to butter me up. That's what you said in the cells, inmate. <laughs> Not I want to make you guys know you're doing a good job. Very proud of you, Pendejos. Come on. Uh, dinner is ready. Howdy. Hey. I don't know if I'm allowed to serve yet. Am I allowed oh, to serve, shit. guard? Sorry, I'll sit yeah, down. Yeah, she may serve. Okay. Uh, if you're hungry, you can come up here, however. Look at that, look at Thank that. Thank you. Look Welcome. at the good little boys and girls over there. Look at the chicos and chicas. Can you reach out to me, uncle? Cooking like proper workers. Oh. Thank you. Thanks. That guy looks like cash. Yeah, they did all hear that. Yeah, yeah, with the aid. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Hey, what? What? 
You know what? Uh, for some reason, I have this strange compulsion to uh, uh, go huh? count the larder. Thank you. What? What? Go do what? For about two minutes. Are you insinuating a fart? Don't mind if I join you, do you? Huh? What about a fight? Okay, I said, is this guy trying to insinuate a fight? Okay. No, I don't know. How you doing, though? Yeah, not too bad. Oh, Rudy might go kick his ass. Glad to see you're out, your bass. Yeah, it's good to see you are not dead. Not uh, yet. Yeah. I'm gonna kill you. They do, I'm gonna burn down the crossing. Alright, is everyone eating their supper? I think it's still getting handed out. It's uh, I, I I just served it. Alright, keep it up. Oh man, I got a question. Oh, here we go. Do you have somebody in your family that was a warden? Formerly? Because the prison guard Enrique told me the warden before Big L was some old Uncle guy James. named Winsmore. Are you hungry? I'm not even uh, kidding. I have a big family. <laughs> if you have extra like potatoes, a huge family me, I'll of cook for you. Brothers and sisters. Go back up with the Family by choice. Some are blood, some aren't. That's interesting though. Watch. It's Remy. Remy? Hmm. Uh, I don't know where Weird. Remy went. He ain't been around in a bit. But I, yeah, I haven't heard from any of my family in a very long time. The fuck knows? What's between me and my gang? Don't concern you, motherfucker. Is he dead? Nah, them are, you go them back up. You go back up your uncle and Rudy. Kelly Gay, motherfucker. Rudy yelled at me last time. I backed him up, so at he wants me to stand with James, all right? Just in case. We can't really do anything. You do fucked up, motherfucker. Christ. Oh, oh Lord. And June Fuck went straight for Rudy again. Oh. Oh. Where did the other guy go? You wanna go, fella? You alright, James? Oh. <laughs> you alright? It's funny as they were asking me to bash with my dad. I don't know. What? No. Yeah. <laughs> Who asked if I sired you? Edgar. Edgar. What the fuck? Yeah. Why? Then he, a he asked if I loved you, if you were my dad, or if you were my best friend. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Disrespect my <laughs> name, motherfucker. <laughs> Give me some fucking roll! Yeah, hold up, hold up. I got this. Uh -huh. Howdy, fella. Oh, there we go. Right, now now it would make sense. Uh oh, trying to sound like milk. Oh, yeah, true. Ow, what the hell, fella? <laughs> Calm oh. down. Oh. oh, no. Ouch. Hey, Howdy, motherfucker. Oh, I'm down like a bitch. You guys say a lot more monotone. Howdy, motherfucker. You there you go. Thanks. We need Everett. He needs to wake up. Just mm -hmm. to do it. They can go back to sleep. This bald fella on here still wants to talk. <laughs> no, 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 no. I didn't, I didn't say nothing. Not I, you. It's a new blood already taking his side. Yeah, yeah. Well, take long. Yeah, he, he, oh. he, oh. he died pretty quickly. <laughs> Got friends oh, and then got beaten down again. You wanna say something again, no. Egghead? <laughs> See, I can't do much to you, I'm already fucked up. The Kelly kids are fucking running them up. You wanna say something else? Fella? Yeah. <laughs> we'll just leave them to that then, it's not my business. Say you... Yeah, I deal with him, you know, he's a fucking prick. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, you fucking bitch. And again. And again. Get no, you gotta get him between the ribs a little bit. Alright, there you go. Just take a seat, sweetheart. Feel a bit better, June? Not really. Ow. Oh, well. 
Wait, yeah. No. Your potatoes were good. You want more? No, I'm all right. Thank you, though. They were good, though. Anyone still hungry? I mean, I'll take some. So should get me through it. Where are the guards? They just fucked uh, off. <laughs> yeah, they kind of they took Rudy to solitary, I think, and left. What I miss? Fine. Yeah. None of those today. Get <sighs> back. Yep. Yeah, there's, there's been a lot of fights today. You know, I still have those rusty keys. Been a little wild mouse today. I escaped out of Siska, out of solitary. And the guard shot me and Ronnie. Well, the which guard was guard tackling her. You? I don't know which one. Well, they was. they were tackling her with ropes, so I started kicking him in the ass, and I was, I started beating the shit out of him, and then they shot us. I was just standing there. It was just a graze. What can I even do? They shot me, then walked over, and I think that was it's one of the times they hit me. Yeah, they they did. I don't even remember. Thanks. What is up with those guys? They're so fucking weird. <laughs> Good oh. Question. <laughs> Just like walks up and like stands there and just stares and then just walks off. Best if we all stick together, I guess. Don't get involved. Unless they start on us, Ronnie, then we can. Oh well, yeah, obviously. That was sound something to Rudy. Old fella tried to choke him. Called you a bitch. Hmm. Fuck him. Well. Did they pay off the guards? I have no idea. Uh, I think they saw that something was maybe gonna happen and they just left and let it happen. Huh. For once. I put Rudy in solitary, by the way. He did it. Uh, to be fair, that dumbass did it to himself. He just started swinging on like 18 people after the guard told him not to. What's he supposed to do? And to be fair, 
it seemed like they weren't even going to take him to solitary for the actual fight. The only reason they actually did it is because he kept going on. That was the fight. What well, fight was over at that point, right? Yeah, he was kicking uh, when he was down. Who? I thought he was fighting a bystander. No, all those guys were involved. They, they oh, all jumped okay. in. I, Everyone I in this room was involved. Who the fuck us. are they? I see. Yeah. I had no idea. I'm pretty sure those, those other guys that joined in were some of the new guys that just showed up. Yeah, I they think were, they just, yeah. I think Edgar just got to them and Fucking told them that they got to them yeah. first, Fires. yeah. And, and he was like, ooh. Yeah. Damn. How much longer do we have to fucking sit in here for? Who are those I don't fellas? think, I think I we didn't can see leave. anybody outside. I don't know. Who are those fellas? We just get abandoned in here. I think they just left us to our own devices. That's a bad idea. No, I'm gonna go walk. Give me a... What are you saying? Enjoy the fucking fresh Me too, I saw him chunking out Rudy, so I jumped in, that's all. I don't know who the fuck they are. Talk. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go into the infirmary for like two seconds, then I'll walk with okay. you to the bench or whatever. Okay. Anybody else need to talk to me? Or want to oh. talk to me? As you want to see something, you get. You want to see something really? I'll show you guys something that, that really looks cursed. Jacket on. <laughs> I need to put the hat on. I need to put the hat on, bro. Hold on. Let's put the hat on. God, th this mustache does not fit Javaz in the slightest, though. By the way, <laughs> holy shit, this mustache does not fit in the slightest. Jesus Christ. Now we look. Then the beard with the the bald head is Sam like. Yeah. I do want to? I do want to see something. Though. Hold up. I'm excited to do. I'm excited to do this. The light brown hair. Like this with the with the shoulder length, I think will look really good. Ronnie needs to talk to us for a second. Yeah. So, match, and now um, after the whole thing that happened with the guards and the fighting and the, the shooting, beach. they threw us all down into solitary in together. And, uh, Aurora had a bit of a surprise nap. June had come down and she was talking to James while I was down there and, um, 
He's telling him some things, and he, James told me not to talk about it, but it feels completely, utterly wrong to not tell you guys about it. So, uh, basically, what she told James was that she had treated Big L so that you wouldn't get executed and potentially saved him. But James didn't want me to tell you. And he kind of like somewhat threatened me. Like a veiled threat, I guess. The fuck are you looking at him for? <laughs> Cause he's talking. Well, thank you for talking to me, brother. Yeah. I, I don't know actually like how bad Big L was or anything. It's just well, they put know. a metal plate in his head apparently. Yeah, it was it was June who was treating her treating him. Fuck and me! What is, what is up with old people and weak heads? Am I gonna have a weak head? And, and uh, she said, yeah, she said she treated him so that you wouldn't get executed. Appreciate it, Ronnie. Oh, yep, uh, no problem. You okay? I like the lighter hair because it's different, man. There's a role play reason for it. I do think I'm gonna try to do a darker brown for the like the time we've been in Sisica. And then when we go back to Guarma, make it lighter. Which guard? The one that we just passed isn't he the one that shot down Doyle? I got another guard that likes me. Which one? Enrique. Hmm. He's the one that let me keep my hair. You know, he's actually not a piece of shit, surprisingly. There's somebody at the bench.
think we can swim to that boat. Probably not. They'd probably shoot us with a cannon. Fuck, I'm so tired, dude. I can't believe I won the game. Is it bad that it already feels like that was days ago? Yeah, it is crazy. Big Al was talking when I was in solitary to the other guards about finding a way to get that skull one way or another. Also, Big L is planning on making, not a surprise, Booker Warden. Yep, I'm aware of that. Doing something to get her junior She's warden. Me, telling me about it. Yeah. About how she doesn't want to be the warden. Sorry, I chased you out to the hot box. Yeah, it's all right. Were you even able to watch my fight? Not really. I beat the ever fuck out of him. So you slam his head into a hay bale. You're pretty good at that. I beat the ever living fuck out of him. Good. You know, Malone came down to solitary with his gun pointed at us saying, Who am I shooting? And we yeah. said that it, it was a fist fight Big L asked for. He said he didn't care. He just wanted to shoot you pretty much. Yeah, Big L, I mean, not Big L. Malone said that uh, when I told him, I told him what happened. He said, well, if I had it my way, you'd hang. And I said, well, you know what? If he dies, then hang me, bitch. I dare you. And he said, and I said, I'd be happy dying. If I'm infamous, I killed Big L. And he, uh, he basically said he'll smile as he puts a fucking bullet in my head. It's his word choice. He's just looking for a reason to kill someone. That's what he wants. Trust to pretend he's better than us. Oh shit, the guard's going to yell at them up there. Maybe they really won't see us over here. I just, let's just go back while he's talking to them. Make sure you trend the wonder what the fuck this guy's sharpening right now. How are you going to keep yourself out of trouble now that you have freedom? It's not I going so well so far. Trouble. All you've done today is get into trouble. How? I didn't even get in trouble for fight? tackling Doyle. You're supposed to let the guards win, didn't you know that? <laughs> I mean, you're going to pay if you don't. Oh well. 
Who's got a metal plate in his fucking skull now? Booker finally figured out how to get to me. James really has come a long way. I mean, even the way he acts, talks, and walks, carries himself, I mean, it's clear. Clear what he's different. Me and him locked in solitary together. I just hope he doesn't let the wrong people in. Yeah. People are changing for the worse. Talk to you, Uncle. Uh, not right now. Thinking about ending chat. I started to slowly actually fix my sleep schedule. I want to go make food. There's people live in Cisco, right? If I go make food and and chill off stream, there's people. There's, there'll be a POV. Quite a few. Good. Uh, I don't got any telegrams. <sighs> All right. Uh. Might go to sleep, but I'm gonna go take a seat and at least think for like five to ten minutes. Yeah, I think I'm going to bed. All right. Have a good night. Or I'll talk to you like tomorrow or at some point. I'm gonna try to uh, enjoy my freedom. Hello. Luke and Jimmy. Uh, we'll raid Jimmy. My God, I said so much. Yeah, definitely a highlighter. There's the Discord. It's free. Feel free to sub and follow. No. 
I I will not be I, I'm not gonna get a do this damn it when I had to stay up to fix my sleep man I have more than just the Malone talk recorded. I have a lot of it recorded. I might just try to edit it all together. I haven't decided yet. I sleep here tomorrow. -na 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 -na. <laughs> I gotta figure out cause I, uh, the unfortunate thing. I gotta see if I have Windows Movie Maker. <laughs> They just add all of it together into one mp4 and then upload it all on YouTube. That way there's several conversations to be had on one video. Let's see. In a new girl. No, I did not. Hold up. Well, Hold up, we'll send it. It's pinned in meta? Oh my god. What? I'll find out you. What is this? Is there a song in it, chat? Is there a song? Cause I'll pause if there's a song. Yeah, oh my god. Alright, here we go. Oh. <laughs> Wait, we'll, we'll go to this screen. <laughs> that show my wrestling article? <laughs> what, did, what did that... Oh, that showed the meta chat. You know what I thought that showed at the display capture? I thought that... Right, let me see if I can pull it up. Cause I think it pulls up my second monitor. I thought it pulled up my wrestling art. I don't even want to try to show. Wait, actually, hold up. I think if I do this display capture, nope. Why? Why is it? Okay, done. This should be fixed. Hold up. <laughs> I thought <laughs> I was I was reading it while I was in the hot box. I was reading this wrestling article <laughs> on on the Rumble. <laughs> And I thought that when I put my display capture, I th <laughs> I thought I showed my wrestling article for a second. All right, here we go. You called, I was blaming myself. Okay, so all I do is blame myself nowadays. <laughs> Pissed you off, then you was all angry, pushed away by it, and Rebecca, and then you ended up alive. I walked away from you, for my own reasons. You bias? Yeah. No. 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 no.
But then I also think about how I'm a failure and how I failed my uncle and how his blood's on my hands when I'm in solitary. I think about how everything could have been so different if, if maybe I just walked a different path. It's getting harder, Aurora. Solitary. It's getting harder. Don't go back. But there's one thing you need to keep in mind. When you have a lot of success in life, that means you're favored by God. But also, it means you're favored by the devil. And he gonna get you. Yeah. But he gonna try to give you here too. He gonna try to take you with him. And the end day, you always go to with the motherfucker that brought you to the dance. That's God, motherfucker. You stay true to yourself. You understand me? Yeah. I try to. Yeah, I know you did, but I prefer the current one. See that 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 is insane. Bro, that is insane. That was fucking crazy. Show the other one too? What do you mean the other one? Link it. Link it and I'll show it. You remember the 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 one right after? You remember the one right after the uh Yeah, link it. Link it. I'll show that one too if people hadn't seen it. Sure. That one's fucking amazing. <clears throat> That was such a good video, though. You came the wild, thank you. I I I like the RP. I I, I love Jabass's story. I do. Uh, I do. I I really. I mean, I, I'm open to perming before this, but I really want to try to make an attempt to kill Big Ill. That's like how I want to take Jabass out of the world. I ain't be so good even if he fails. There you go. So good. Gonna swallow us whole, we Who do you think, Kramer? Jonathan fucking divine. 
Dude, both the videos. You have think been everybody's so good. destiny is Holy shit. including our own? Yeah, I mean that's how it all works, ain't it? How would you like to die, Mr. Javis? How would I like to die? Uno ups. In the name of greed. You're my fucking brother. I slay my brother down. I take his soul. For ransom in the name of pride. I turn Can we get Olivia back, please? <laughs> Trying to get that revenge, you need to prepare for the things Can that we come get behind Sam it. Back? Right. Me and Uncle, we know you don't have to die for me to leave, right? We're basically both leaving it right now. That's how I see it. Calling someone useless, I useless, give up. useless. Fuck what you did. Baby. Fuck this shit, man. I, I can honestly understand why my fucking uncle didn't want to be safe. Cause my God, do I regret it. As a friend, someone I care about, someone I love. Do you think I want people that I care about to go throw their fucking lives away because they're arguing? He admits it. He admits it. He admits it. Y'all ready? Follow me, follow me. Olivia, you with me? Not for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. Oh, there we die. I love you. Love you too. I see the future here. There's a lot of bad blood that we need to get through. I mean, to be fair, I do see a future possible. <laughs> Where's Sophia? Mama, mama. Don't go. He's not. He's not with us anymore. Forgive us what we've done. Is he gonna let me out? Not yet. Not until you're fully broken, like he was. Like I said, Big L is literally the arch enemy of Jabaz, man. There will never be anybody that even stands, even slightly stands anywhere near that I said big Vicono does such a good job playing big L man Dude, Saab, are you still in chat? Yes, alright. You Just for that Olivia comment, you better have my back. The day that, the, the day that Josie wants to leave the gang for James, you better just have my back the minute I put a gun to her temple, man. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, fella. You 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 best have your uncle's back. Oh, I I intend on final saying it, even if everybody disagrees. I already see I already see the writing on the wall. I know it's coming. I know it's coming. I fear to be a good fucking use. A good fucking use of the final say. Okay, alright, hold up now, Oz. Look, Weaver died like a Muppet, alright? He, they, he, him and Law decided to pick a fight when it was thundering. Pure Muppetry, that, that one's on Malone, alright? Benny is because of Saab, okay? I, Benny, Benny's injury is the result of Saab, okay? Alright? Big L's 100% on me, alright? 
Dude, the chess game was so good, though. It was actually so good. The whole scene was so good, all of it. I think it makes up for the fact that we didn't get a Jack Jabass chess scene. As much as I as much as I wanted it. The whole day was super good. A lot of really good roleplay. I'm very excited. I, I I'm <laughs> I wish I wish it I wish Mills wasn't in Cisco for so long, because I'm gonna play a lot of Ralphie when I'm out of Sisica. Which is in Yeah, it's gonna be a Ralphie day tomorrow, even if it's just me alone. I can't wait to hold shit. I can't wait to hold shit down for the boy Mills out on the outside. I'm gonna do so many. I'm gonna kill so many people for Mills from Sis if it, while he's in Sisica. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna put Bolton down on Ralphie. Golden Mills gang, suck a dick. That's right. That's right. That's goddamn. You goddamn right. All right. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm going to stay in, like I said, I'm going to stay in Sisica longer on Jabaz just because I feel like, I don't know, man. I, I feel like all of the role play surrounding the law and how aggressive we were with the law, as well as Holly's perma, deserves more than two weeks of prison. I'm going to be honest. I, I feel like it definitely deserves more than two weeks of prison time, personally. Uh, we did a lot of shit to law. Most like, yeah, I'm not playing Ruth. Extending the time? It, well, yeah, man. It's almost like we all feel that a perma should be more than what they... What, somebody was only getting like two days for a perma, bro. Perma should should have some heavy heavy shit on top of it. Not only did I, did I actually perma Holly... So I should get a fuck ton of time. But also, we attempted to murder several deputies. Like, we should get a lot of time, man. It shouldn't be... It shouldn't be like a slap on the wrist. I'm sure for the permit was good, but they probably heavily reduced the one for the attempt. There was a lot of reductions, and I feel like you gotta understand. I here's the thing, chat. I murdered. I helped murder a deputy, even if I wasn't the one that actually killed the deputy. I hadn't been caught since oh, before Christmas, chat. So Castle's murder was on my rap sheet. Not only was Castle's murder, a deputy murder was on there. There was also. There was also the actual murder of Holly, that was all Jubass, and then several attempted on deputies. Like, it should be heavy time. It, it should definitely be heavy time, man. Uh, I, I, I mean, I get, I, once again, I, I feel like, so here's, here's the thing. As somebody that, that's from GTA, and I've been roleplaying for like six, seven years, and there's, I've been in heavy, such heavy consequence season, I've been in barely any time. OOC time, I feel like having a cutoff limit just makes it weird and also makes it way less consequence oriented. I feel like consequences makes the role play so much more dramatic and makes it so much more intense. Like that scene, Erica, with Mills, Ralphie, and Richie and Fiverr when Mills got caught was so much more intense because of how much time Mills had. Like, if there was a cutoff, we probably wouldn't have even taken that fight. You know what I mean? But because of how much time he was facing, it was so do or die. It felt so intense. Three versus six. It, it felt so fucking intense, you know? So, it, it's definitely like a double-sided uh, double sided coin. I feel like the, everybody on Wild's really, really talented role players. So, I feel like having multiple character slots adds to that. You know, like, like, like for me, when Jabass is super locked up, I, I do R Ruth, or like, I'll do Richie, I mean, not Richie, Ralphie. 
Uh, eventually, I, I want to get around to doing doing other characters, too. You know, I, I feel like there's definitely ways around it. And it, it definitely, I can see the argument of, like, not wanting to be in Sisica for that long. But there is some great roleplay that happens in Sisica, too. But luckily, the heavy consequences are only if you target law. And that's a player choice to target law. You know what I mean? Like... John Civ character? Uh, I think if I ever do, like, an Eastern business-oriented, like, slow burn crime character, would be definitely be Civ at the start. Same as, like, a, a, a uh, an up-north character that I do. It would probably be Civ at the start. I don't see myself ever long-term playing a Civ. Uh, I'll be honest, I really want to do an Eastern Outlaw eventually, one day. Uh, maybe not, like, a slow burn crime, but I really do want to do an Eastern... An Eastern Outlaw. Ah, uh, that's not true, Kite. I mean, okay, Ralphie was literally a character that's Richie's brother. I, I don't know what you expected. I'm not even in the gang yet, too. So I don't know what you expected there. Silver Spoon was a meme character. Every other character has been very, very slow burn into shit. Silver Spoon was made to shine. I do want to fit. I do want to. I might. I might drop Silver Spoon down to a one lifer and play him really, really, really intense. And I, I might have to go after. I might have to go after like Nathaniel Green's dead, bro. OG is dead. <laughs> OG, OG is dead. I might have to kill John Grace on Silver Spoon. That might be the role play I go with is going after John Grace to kill him. The, Saab does treat Moonshine like boosting. Saab, can you start DMing me the days you're going to play Saab on GTA? I told the nerds. I promised them I'd come around on Denzel if you start showing up on Saab. I told them I'll make it... Bo I'd make it double uncle day. Be around next weekend? Alright, fuck you. I'm not coming around on the weekend. They told me it was Monday through Friday that you, you, you've been coming around. I'm not coming around on the weekend. All right, the weekend, the weekends for drinks. Next Friday, then. Okay, next Friday. So the tenth, I could do the tenth. You're, you do realize you're out of Sisica on on Charles by then, right, buddy? Or you mean this Friday? Yeah, Sisica was really good today. I always have a lot of good time on Siska. This Friday? Alright, I'll I'll try to be there this Friday, okay? I'll try to show up this Friday on Denzel. Alright, um... Jimmy's still live. I want to raid Jimmy. Bum, bum. Ah, yeah, Saab, we got it. Are we, Saab, are we still doing characters on Hardcore? Bozo? I DM. Yeah, I'll start DMing you. You know that's probably better. All right, let's raid Jimmy. Jimmy's the boy. I missed him so much. I'm glad he's back. I've missed Jimmy. I love Jimmy so much, dude. He's so much fun to role play with. Please go send him some love. Uh, feel free to join the Discord if you're new. We'll be we'll be live tomorrow. We're gonna do Ralphie and Ruth tomorrow. Probably is the game plan. Ralphie and Ruth. And yeah, we'll be live. Uh, be live then. Have a good night.